we have a transition oh my god what did you think was that good was that good for you do you want to see it again do you want to go back let's go back in time there you go uh, another one is that good do is that fine is do we like it are you a flower are we flower people now We got, we got new we got new things in the chat. If we have another command that you guys would like to play with, um, let me know. Hi, Kayla. Welcome in. Hi, everybody. That's fire. Yes. Um, cause that, those are the only ones I could think of last night when I figured out how to put them together. 
um, was hug, love, and slap. We have You're new. Ugly. You oh. are disgusting. I'm gonna kill you. Give me two hundred dollars. Give me two hundred dollars. <laughs> If you're going to call me ugly, you got to give me $200. <laughs> Sound like that. They, they put you in jail. They do. Right away. Yeah. You're playing music too loud, right to jail. Right away. Mm -hmm. You're driving too fast, jail. Yeah. Slow, jail. You undercook fish, believe it or not, jail. Yeah. You overcook chicken, also jail. Undercook over. They do. You go to jail All, every time. You look like the 4th of July. <laughs> Makes me want a hot dog real bad. They sound different. Hold on. Maybe it's because... My headphones aren't in. Maybe that's why. Let me put them on. Let me put them on for you. You're hear you're hearing it old school, like when I wasn't wearing headphones. There you go. Oh yeah, Barry, you have to name Leonardo DiCaprio's babies. You have a. Um, you and Disco are naming Leonardo DiCaprio's babies. Old school. Like Adam and Eve? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's test it. Let's see. Let me t Tell me if it's any different now. Hold on. Tell me if it sounds better. But daddy is a state of mind. You know what I'm saying? I'm your daddy. I'm your daddy. I'm your daddy. Me. Yeah, it's better. Okay. Yeah, I think it was it was getting picked up on the microphone. That's what happened. Oh yeah. <laughs> um, welcome in everybody. Yeah, so we have some new emotes. We have exclamation point hug, where you do exclamation point hug and then a username if you want to hug someone. Exclamation point slap and the username if you want to slap someone. Um, you can also just do exclamation point slap and it should just slap yourself if you want to slap yourself at any point or exclamation point hug and it should hug yourself if you need a hug to you know self hug you want to say to ew gross uh, oh you slapped yourself ooh slapping ourselves mm. um slap them too this is gonna turn incredibly spammy it might um, and then I want to come up with another like fun one because oh there's also the love one exclamation point love and then the username and it'll tell you your percentage of love with that person. I'm in danger. <laughs> Perfect for when I do something dumb. Yeah, I kind of figured like once the once the novelty of it's over, then like it'll just be like sometimes. But I wanted to let you know about it. You can all try it out. Um, and then. Uh, yeah, if there's any other ones that we could do that would be more fun in the chat, like we could come up with them, right? Like you could come up with some type of percentage, like on um, Life and Beth's channel, they have what percentage of Welsh are you? On our channel, we could have what percentage of blank are you today? Or how, what percentage of a chance do you have in something or whatever? So, you know, what percentage of glamorous? I mean, yeah, I did think about that. <laughs> chaos? <gasps> chaos level would be good. What level of chaos are you today? That would be good. Okay. Let me write that down. <laughs> I'm going to write it. Let me write it down. What level of tragic are you? I think we're all pretty tragic. We should do like, <laughs> no, that's so stupid. What level of thirsty are you for Pedro Pascal today? <laughs> How, what percentage of thirstiness do you have for Pedro today? <laughs> you like it? How thirsty are you today? <laughs> Level of thirst. Should we just have it be thirst in general? Or should it be thirst for Pedro? Yeah, keep it open-ended. Okay. Because we, we do have different levels of thirsts. And our thirst interests change. So it might not be Pedro one day. Who knows? What percent moist are you? <laughs> oh my 
god. You're dressed like a Sim townie. <laughs> it's like all random. I kind of am too, actually. My top is specific, but my bottoms are just pajamas, and then I'm wearing socks. It's a very, which is usually what I wear when I stream, because why would I put pants on? Like regular pants. I'm just gonna wear PJ pants. They're more comfortable. Yeah, you gotta wear comfortable pants. Do you have an eyeball ring though? I feel like I used to, which is kind of weird. Every time I see that ring, I think, I feel like I used to have a ring like that. But I don't know, I don't know where it would be. I gotta put like random piercings on. I do have some piercings, okay. And then glasses. I got this, I got it. I want these ones. All right, I'm ready. This is my work outfit. Imagine wearing clothing. Something strange on your head. I don't have enough toys in here to play with. Is that better? One of my favorite things about doing photo shoots was that um, when I was dressing up other people, I would also like to wear stuff for myself. So I would just put random things on my head or on my face or something. Or gloves. I'm gonna wear gloves. I can't see anything. <laughs> Those are hard to see through. Okay, um, should we dive in? Should we dive? Should we go do a deep dive? Oh, I forgot about that, hold on. I forgot about it like every time I do it. Uh, I have another, I have, okay. Do you wanna, do you wanna make a, ch here, let's, let's do a, just make a choice with me. We actually have three screen things that we could do. I technically have four, but one of them Sam uses, and I don't want to copy Sam. So um, we have that flower. We have this flower. Are you ready? We have that flower, which for some reason has a weird delay to it that I have to figure out how to fix. And then we also have this heart. So let me know which of the three you like the best. There's the heart. The heart. Of defeaty the heart. Do you like the heart? Or do we like the original flower that I chose? Insane. How dare you? I didn't mean to go to that page. Sorry. This is the original flower. The heart shaped flower. You can't pick both. Heart because it reminds me of the Powerpuff Girls. You like the heart? Go back here. I love the flower, but the heart fits you more. Fine, flower shaped heart. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the heart really quick. Is it because it's pink and, and purple? Is that why you like it? Uh. Should I make my alphabet Sims teens? Hmm. Okay, so we are, uh, we're our C why generation. Am I old? Oh, hi. Why am I <laughs> I just want to address Hello. the elephant in the room. Why, why, why am I old? Why, why am I fat? Old? Why am I old? Why am I fat? Why am I old? Why am I fat? Hi, welcome. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. How are you doing today? Thank you for giving them a shout out. How are you? How was your stream? Galleon Sky, is that how I say it? Welcome, welcome. Oh, thank you, Lucifer. How are you? How was your stream? Did you have fun? Bruh. Tell me all about it. Thank you for the follow. Let me give Bruh. you a follow. Oh my god, you look so cute in your little picture. How are you? I gave I gave you a follow back. How was your stream? Tell me all about it. Thank you for bringing your community over here. We're just getting started, really. So this is perfect timing. Um. 
Love the 90s thing. Thank you so much. We were just picking a, a new a stinger. I think we chose this one. Let me let me see if you like it. The heart. It was between a heart and a flower. But I think we chose the heart. I think that they liked the heart the most. Um I put the am in amazing. You're so cute. Thank you. Um, thank you so much for bringing your community here. Um, we are about to start our alphabet legacy. We are, I was just about to dive into like talking about it. Um, so if you want to hang out, I'd love to have you. Thank you for being here. Um, and if you need to go D stream, please go D stream. I'm trying to like remember everything I need to say. Please go D stream. Go take care of yourself. You're, you're important. You need to, you need to do that. And, um, again, thank you for being here. If you need, if you want to see the raid video, let me know. Um, I will show it. Otherwise, I'll just go into talking about about the about what we're gonna get into. So, um, you want a raid video? Okay, let's do the raid video then, and I will get things prepped. Okay, BRB. Okay, bye, Lucifer. I hope you sleep well. Thank you so much for coming in to say hi. At least I appreciate you. Raid video now with transition. Yes. Okay, BRB. single one of you impregnate me by the end of this let's play drugs i don't want to get drugs i want to live my beach life oh Let's my god that is terrifying to change <gasps> Click on the continue that's button. fucking you terrifying are you serious with me right now look at him i'm blending in i'm being sneaky did you know that he will swing on a swing You just wear the top, it looks like you're wearing a condom. <laughs> so yeah, that's just a little bit about me. If you like what you see, please be sure to give a follow. I'd love to hang out with you. Um, <laughs> I, I still need to update it a little bit, but I'm glad you thought it was funny. That's what I aim for. Um, we are diving into our, oh, so many transitions. So many, oh, let me bring up the, let me bring it up. I'm, 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 I can do this. There we go. Um, we are starting our C generation on our alphabet legacy. And I'm currently in the Danny DeVito household because for some reason the game is being weird with glitches and they moved both Danny and Daniel DeVito out of their house. So we have to invite them back over and have them move in. No, don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. I just want Danny and Daniel to come over. Do you have a new shell out? Not yet. Not yet. Let me add you to my house. Add to family. Where's Daniel? There you are. Daniel? Daniel, you're going too fast. Add to family. Okay, I don't know why they were not in the family. No, I don't need the gallery. I do. No, I don't want a welcome wagon. Go away. Leave me alone. Okay, just go to manage worlds. <laughs> Jeez. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what happened, but you know, the, the game's been buggy. So, um, it, it decided to move out Danny and Daniel DeVito out of the house. So we're I just made sure they were back home. With, their, with mom. Just wanted to make sure they were good before we continued. That's the same thing happened to Emma where they moved um, her matriarch out of the house and I was like, what? All right. Okay, I don't wanna play you. I'm just gonna leave you. Oh yeah, Pickles is in here. Hi, alternate reality Pickles. All right, now we're good. I forgot that you, did you have another kid? Or is that your actual... Why do you only have $185? Hold on, this is our Boo, brother. You whore. Boo, you whore. This is the brother of our B generation. Who is this? Samir? Who's Jeanette? 
What happened to your wife? Did your, oh, your wife died. Who's Jeanette? Is that your girlfriend? Who's Samir? Where are your other kids? Oh my God, what, am I, what has he been doing? Okay. So we don't have a new shell out yet. I will be working on, we can work on making one. I assume you're being so slow where I'm downloading GTA. Yeah, I bet. Um, okay, we are going here. Thank you so much, Lemon. You're so sweet. Uh, we're going to our, our the Burgundy house. So, yeah, oh, there's a, yes, okay. So, um, we've been doing the Alphabet Legacy, which means that each generation starts with like AA. They have an A career. So we had Alan Allen. He was an actor. He married Bev Burgundy. They really only just have to have a B last name, but we've been like keeping it cute. Um, so we married Bev Burgundy. They had two kids, Bertie and Braun Burgundy. We then, Braun went off to live his life. He's a sex worker, mermaid living on the beach. Okay. He's just, I thought he's, he's a pansexual king. We love him. Um, my brain. Then we have <laughs> a sex worker mermaid on the beach. Honestly, it's such a vibe. Um, then we have, um, Birdie, who was originally blonde. Um, she married a guy named Christian Culver. They moved to their dream house. And, um, where's Birdie? Birdie was originally blonde. Um, she married Christian. Christian, they had a great life together. They had five kids, six kids. How many kids did we have together? Four, five, six, six kids. They had six kids together. She's had seven fucking kids. No wonder she's, oh my God. No wonder she's lived so long. Um, so, oh, look, they're compatible. That's cute. This is Christian. He didn't always have this long of a beard though. Um, he was very cute. Um, I believe Lemon made him. And, wait, we didn't notice if the Sims I'm making are teens or adults. Oh, um, teens, yeah. Teens for sure. Land grabs and goths go banana with with adoptions and babies in my save, they do. Especially babies for the goth family in my save. Um, so, okay. So yeah, he, he was great for a long time. And then, so we have a chaos wheel, if you don't know about it. Um, it's just, it's just a cute little, it's a cute little moment. It's a cute little wheel. Um, it's called a plot twist wheel. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. Um, we have a plot twist wheel in this game. That's how we decided that, you know, he, that's why my brother became a sex worker mermaid. Um, so in the plot twist wheel, we've had one of our kids going to witness protection. Our husband, Christian, cheated on us with our mom. Um, and we never found out about it, even though, like, whatever. Um, our mom ended up having two more kids after us. Uh, she had twin boys. The game named them Dallas and Goopy. Um, so we have more brothers. And uh, yeah, Birdie's had seven fucking kids. One of our kids drowned in a pool. Um, one of them's a witness protection and the other, one of them is a uh, transgender. They transitioned from male to female, um, Cassidy. And then, um, and then we have Chanel and then our newest, um, our, our newest person legacy, our newest legacy. I want to say matriarch, but she's not matriarch. She's a legacy is, um, Clover. Clover is, uh, Oh, and Birdie, when her her husband died because of old age, he died of old age. He he lived a long life, um, but she she had seven kids, so she's lived longer. Um, she then married, or she did she do we marry Lee? You have bad news. What is it? Was it about pickles? What happened to pickles? <gasps> There's eighty one percent love between you two. I want love. <laughs> did they get married? I think they did. Spouse, yeah. Okay, the wicked, the, the wonderful whims. 
Come on. You perceived as very unattractive? Come on. How dare you? Oh, thank you for the love. 1% <laughs> love. 8% love. Only Pojo loves me. <laughs> Those percentages are so low. Okay, attractiveness. Um, develop Birdie's preferences based on romantic partners. Okay, and then yours too. Because it's just weird if you're like married and you're like, I don't think she's attractive. Like that doesn't make any sense. Based on romantic partners. There you go. Okay. Honestly, it should just automatically do that based on romantic partners. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> Always. What's the bad news? What happened? Um, so then we have Clover here. Clover um, is smart. They oh, they're into computers. I forgot about that. They're like they're they're a computer a computer. She's a computer girly. She loves computers. That was you got a wheel spin. Okay. Um, they. That was the teen storyline that that our wheel gave her. She's relatable. Oh my god, so relatable. <gasps> First woohoo. Wait, that counts as wait. <gasps> oh my god, this answers my question. When teens fool around her, are they actually hooking up? Oh my god, they are. Oh my god, they're actually hooking up. They're not just like going to third base or whatever. They're like hook they're like first woohoo. Ooh. Oh my god, look at her manners. She's she has fantastic manners. Yeah, Sims Sims Woohoo. Oh no, but I meant like the teens. I thought because the teens it just says mess around. It doesn't say woohoo. So I was always like, does mess around mean like they're doing everything but? You know? But apparently. Oh, I don't, that's okay. That's okay, Disco. I was on an emergency phone call and had Cheesy stream on mute when the B Gen had a baby. I was calling out C names. I called out several, but also Clover because I was saying names while distracted. So I think she took my suggestion of Clover. Yeah, that's not, that's fine. That's no big deal. No biggies. It's not like they have the same last name, although that would be kind of funny. Um, okay. So she's, I think, ready to grad. She's ready to age up. Is it today? I think we were just going to age her up because I think, is this her birthday? No, wait. I thought her birthday was today. Did this thing, okay, whatever. We're aging her up today. I'm, I'm not, oh, her birthday is that day? The game changed everybody's birthdays because of the update. It's very annoying. She technically has two more. She has the the rest of the weekend. Okay, that's fine. You know what? Because I think today is prom. Um, and we didn't really get to go to prom last time because uh, it, it was buggy. <laughs> so um, we're currently dating Danny DeVito Jr., which is actually Danny DeVito's real name. Um... Let's invite him over. Come over. It's Saturday. Um, and the way that we play this is we usually play one person. Uh, as when Clover became a teen is when we started playing Clover more than Birdie. Um, Birdie's just living out her days. Um, they did have Birdie and, and Birdie and Lee did have a, t a toddler over here. So this is Charlie. Um, oh yeah, we gotta do the, the wheel spin. I hold on, give me one second. Okay, let me just sit it on them for a second. The toddler can do what they want. The update is in so much to my Sims. I know it's like in my. Um, oh, there he is. Oh, he's showing me funny videos. Hi, Danny. Wait, hold on. I want to ask you to prom really quick because I don't think I did that. Oh, I did ask him to prom. 
Um, ask for prom tips. Okay, let's do our <laughs> plot twist. Let's see what we get. Another one? Who? Who? Who what? So we got trans awakening, but I don't know who would be trans. We've already done that in this family. I'm going to spin it again. We've already done it in this family. Prom is coming. I know. I'm going to prom. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're getting all the really interesting ones today. Um, Cassidy should be Polly. Okay. You don't want Clover to be Polly? It's almost Clover. I know it's almost Clover's birthday. Leave me alone. Um, you want Cassidy to be Polly? Hi, Jacqueline. How are you? Your baby's so cute, by the way. Oh my gosh. Who wouldn't want to focus their sexual healing on only Danny? <laughs> All right, Cassidy. So is Cassidy the one that is going to be? Who's going to be Polly? Birdie likes jokes. Yeah, good. Good. I like that. That's, good. That's nice. Did you come downstairs on your own? Yeah. Charlie. Haspa. Oh. Vef. Cassidy doesn't have any lovers right now. Cassidy needs to get out there <laughs> and find people. Oh. Cassidy does not like Francisco. They're, they're oh. bad, bad compatibility. Huh. Oh, they weren't compatible with Colby, their brother, either. Okay, um... Okay, Cassidy. Is this a diaper? Why do you have a diaper just on the ground? Where is a trash can in this household? Do we not just have trash cans around? You have your jokesters. Chanel and Clover are jokesters. Cute. That's cute. Hold on. We need a tr we need a trash can. Where the fuck is a trash can? What am I doing with myself? Can Cassidy seduce Father Winter? We could we could invite him over. Let's see. Let's give you... You have money. Oh, they have a bunch of money. Where'd they get all this money from? Did they win the lottery too? Everybody's winning the lottery in my households. Oh, come on. Like, I can't fit a trash can in that little area. As if. As if. There. There. Am I gonna have to get a diaper changing station? Anyway, we're moving out when she becomes, <laughs> when she ages up on Monday. And I'm excited for that. Hi, Cal. Hi, Cozy Cal. How are you? Okay. Um, Cassidy, you need to invite over. You need, we're trying to be Polly. So who's this? Who's Javon? Invite Javon over and Father Winter and see if they want to be Polly with you. That's your sister. You need, you need to get out and meet more people. You don't have, there's not enough people here. You, you only know like elders and stuff. 
All right, so Clover's just gonna do what they wanna do. Hey, Javon. School is stupid, it's fine, you'll be fine. Oh, you're just gonna come in? All right. No, pause, excuse you, just, just don't just walk wherever. Don't just walk wherever. Why can't I introduce you in a like sexy way? Wait, what's my sexuality? Fine, um, friendly, and then friendly. Oh, he's wearing bell bottoms. Hey, <laughs> so. grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. That's the um. That is the intro. That's the. That's just what you say to people when you first meet them in my in my world. Grilled cheese. Grilled cheese to you. And a grilled cheese to you. Romance. Um. Ooh. Flirt. We gotta flirt. Um. Flirt. Do a little flirt. Money. You got money. He's like, I got money. Oh, there's Father Winter. He's coming. Pick up line. Oh. I'm just gonna introduce myself. Just trying to um. I think that we should have a thruple. Is what I'm saying. This is what I'm. This is what I'm. This is what I think we should have. Because of all those ho ho hos. You say dinner. What do you have for dinner? I hate him. I thought it would be funny. Compliment. Let's compliment you. Oh, try to cheer him up. Oh, don't be sad. Why are we sad when you can be happy? You're talking to me now. Don't worry. I can make it better. Um, ask her a question. You're going to be fine, babe. Kiss hands. I just want to flirt with both of you. Can I just flirt with both of you? Oh, oh, yes. Okay, fine. Hold on. I'm gonna focus on you for a minute. You're 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 given you're given what I'm you're you're <laughs> taking what I'm putting down and I'm gonna give it, I'm giving it. Sexy pose. Kiss hands. Oh my god. Do you like roses? Roses. This guy's cute. He's got the hair. Cassie gives me gold digger vibes. <laughs> And you get like 500k when you marry OG Father Winter. Wait, what? You get 500k from Father Winter? I didn't know he had so much money. Passionate romance. Oh my god, can we? You want to take romantic selfies? Oh no, I can't. Why not? Don't go on my computer. Excuse me. Why are you napping there? No, why? No, don't go take a bath. I know you go first kiss this person. Go first kiss them. Come on. I don't think Cassie is a gold digger, but I do think that they wouldn't mind it. He pays the elves in gumdrops, so he saves a lot of money. Oh my god. Kissing. Kisses. Clover's like, finally, you found somebody. Oh my god, <laughs> we were worried about you. Um, I wasn't sure that you would find someone, but look here, you are. Hold hands. I just had my first kiss. Mom, get out of here. You're blocking my style. Exchange numbers. Mom, get out of here. You're making it weird. It's very awkward now. Mom, it's mom. She's She's like, she's like, hi, I just want to see if this person's good enough for my baby. Oh, Mom, get out of here. You're making it weird. I'm trying to, like, talk to Javon. Mom, use the computer another time. Oh, my God, Mom, stop. Father Winter's watching my cat poop. Why are he, why is he embarrassed? Oh, he likes that. Why are you watching my cat poop? I'm gonna go 
discuss interest with you. Yep. He just <laughs> as soon as the cat's done, he's like, he's like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> oh my god. Ask risk a question. Heartfelt compliment. Oh, I smell. That's fine. That's fine. If you can't hand me at my smelliest, then are we even really supposed to be together? That's the question. Pick up line. Yeah. Nob. What? What do you mean, Nobil? You know what? I don't have time for this. I don't have time. For, I'm, I, this is not. This is not Cassidy's journey. This is Clover's journey. So we're just gonna. So we're just gonna. We're just gonna, we're just gonna do this. This isn't even. It's not even Cassidy's storyline right now. So, boom, boom. We're true lovers. Yeah. Just taking away all of your autonomy there. Javon, also. Just, we're just true lovers. In fact, we might even move out together and into our own little place. True lovers. Let's also, let, let me just do friends, at least. We should at least be friends. And then, hold on. Oh my god, relax, Clement. No, don't send him home. Don't send him home. Don't send him home. This one. Thank you. Don't relax, Clement. Oh my god. Don't be like that. See, now we're gonna be we're gonna be good friends. There you go. Eat it. Eat it, Clement. Go give him residence keys. He's leaving. I know I told him to leave. It was an accident. Fine, whatever. Why Why did our friendship go down? It should have gone up. I faked it. Ask to be boyfriend. Will you be my boyfriend? Wait, be my boyfriend. I know I smell, but be my boyfriend. I also have to pee. Be my boyfriend. I don't No, wait. Be my boyfriend. Will you be my boyfriend? Him. Yes. Okay. That's all I needed. Thanks. Oh, Cassidy does want to find their soulmate. How cute! All right, I think I think that that's good. Cassidy, Cassidy's working on it. Okay, Clover. It's feeling very romantic, very flirty. Do we not have prom? Oh. oh. Where is my Oh, yes, travel to prom. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm saying. Prom. Okay. I have strawberries. Does anybody have snacks? What are your snacks? Strawberries. How's everyone doing today? Did you have a Did you have a good day? Did you have a shitty day? Are we relaxing? We're having dinner, chicken soup and chicken sandwich and vegetable soup. Nice. It's a good dinner. A little bit of everything that you need. We made it. Oh my god. Where's Danny? Where's Danny? Who's this? John O'Donnell? Okay. Who are you? Corey? Zayden? I don't know you. Vahan? Okay. Leon Roswell. Who are you people? 
Lane Roswell, Pat Fleming, Philip Roswell. What are the Roswells doing? Jeez. Milton. Hey, Milton. Friendly introduction to Milton. Yeah, where's Danny? I guess we gotta invite him. <gasps> there he is. There's Danny. Oh my god, we match. Whisper about crush. Danny, you're my crush. The sexy pose for Danny. Oh my god, look at her dance! Oh my god, look at this dance! Uh, look at her hips! She's very hippy. Yeah, photo booth pics for sure. Show off outfit. Do you like my outfit? Do you, oh, I did my little pose for him. He's smitten. He's smitten. Do you like my outfit? Oh, did that work? Yeah. Dance. Oh, let's dance. Hold on, I want to dance. Sweetheart, dance together with Danny. <gasps> We're compatible. Yes. Yes. Danny. This is um teenage Danny DeVito as made by Disco. Oh, he has earrings. He's cool. They're so cute. Shut up. Pazish. Okay, we need to go over here and mess around. Oh my god. Take flirt take photo, romantic photo with Danny. I need it. I also wanna vote. I'm gonna vote for prom jester. I'm gonna who's gonna be okay. I'm gonna vote for who who do we who do we not like? I kind of, mm, Volkov, are you a werewolf? I'm gonna vote for you. Um, prom royalty, Danny, obviously. Obviously. Since I can't vote for myself. <gasps> Going in there. <laughs> Should we mess around at prom? Do we do that? Oh my God, maybe we should. I wanna see the photo. Mess around with Danny. Where's the photo? <gasps> oh my god, it's so cute. Shut up. Oh my god, they're doing a little heart thing. Oh my god, we need more. I just need a million of these photo booth photos. Oh, we're going. Yeah, get out of there. Get out of here, bro. Why can't I? It's occupied? Get out. Oh, it's occupied by me. Oh shit, oh shit. Ah! No, not headless me. No, I want to look at Danny's face. Not my boobs. No. No, it won't let me. Show me his little face with the little num 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 nims. There it is. There it is. There it is. Num 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 num. Num num num. Kisses with Danny. Ah! Oh my God! It was in his face. <laughs> Adorable. All right, let's go over here. We gotta go listen to the awards. Did nobody vote for me? Come on, Danny, let's go. Who won? Did Danny win? Oh my god, yay, Danny! Woo! Woo! 
Danny won. Hey, welcome in. Who's this? Oh yeah, Zayden. You look like a real estate agent. He looks like he looks like a lawyer. Oh my god, look at your butt. Who are you? Pat Fleming's got a little tushy. He's gonna he's gonna hold tushy, honey. Alright, we need to grab a drink and dance and gossip. I want another no, 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 no. I want like one of these. Want another romantic photo with Danny. <gasps> In his little crown? Please. Please. Danny. Photo in your crown. Let's go. I need it. Alright, and then I'm gonna do a slow dance with Danny. No, I don't wanna pee. No, don't pee. Do a slow dance. Okay, yeah, by the door, sure. Oh no, do I smell? Oh no. I saw you in Tiny Stream last night, yeah. I love Tiny. They do such an incredible job in this, like, in their streams and in The Sims, it's so cool. Let's take a romantic photo with Danny. I do smell. <laughs> no. Okay, fine. I guess we won't get another photo. Yeah, let's go to after party. Yeah, with friends. Let's bring Alexandra and uh, Danny. Of course. We should bring my friends. Who's Devin? She's cute. Gina Tinker. Oh my god, she looks so much like her mom. <gasps> Callie Tinker. Oh my god, they're so many of them. Who's Christy? She's hot. Callie. Leah Huntington the third. Oh, I have to invite you. I have to know who your mom is. Um, I don't. I don't think I want Tushy Tushy Boy. Maybe Rox Roxana. Sure, bring Zayden. He's gonna be my future lawyer. I'm sure. Hi, hi, Sinful. Welcome in. How are you? Shauna. I know, I'm just picking people right now. We'll bring Milton. Um, ooh, Justice? That's such a cool name. Justice. Cody. I'm just like, ooh, Chance. No, I want to invite Chance. Chance looks fun. Okay, whatever. It's fine. We're in the after party. So we're on our C generation. And um, this is our last prom before she ages up. And then we're going to move to a different world. And start our life with um, our boyfriend, Danny DeVito. <laughs> then we can start, like, having kids and stuff. And, oh, God, we have to figure out how many kids she's going to have. We have to do that on the wheel, too. So we're going to spin the wheel to figure out where she's going to live. We're going to spin the wheel to figure out how many kids she's going to have. God, last time we got five. And we ended up having seven for some reason. This time I hope it's one. I don't want that many kids. With infants? Oh my god. <laughs> so far proms only worked for me when I got the notice on the home lot. When I go to pre-prom parties it doesn't work. Interesting. How are you liking the infant update? Well it changed everything. It gave all of my saves different birthdays. So for instance, she was supposed to age up as soon as I logged into the game and they gave her three extra days. My um, 100 baby challenge, it gave us 10 extra days. And I was like, oh shit, now I have to do the 100 baby challenge for 10 more days. Um, so we ended up doing that in our last, on my, on Tuesday. And we had, we had an impromptu 12 hour stream on Tuesday. And then um, we ended up having Snoop Dogg's babies and uh, 
then we got pregnant with Leonardo DiCaprio's babies. And I think we're going to be able to get pregnant with one more. So we're trying to hook up with Kyle Kyleson, the new townie, for the, for the last one. Because then our baby's name is going to be Karen Moon Kyleson. Karen Kyleson. That's just too good. I love that. Um, but yeah, it's a lot more challenging. Specifically, it's a lot more challenging. So I'm hoping that we don't get a ton more babies. Because having just like one infant is quite enough work. <laughs> we, um, we just did, two, we got through the first stage of two infants in the hundred baby challenge. And, um, we had one of the kids grow up and say they had a bad upbringing. And I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Okay. All right. Thank you so much, Barry. All right. This is the after party. Oh, yeah. I need to see who your mom is. What? Oh, did, are you... What? What? Your parents are Tatum, Volkov, and... I don't know how to say that name, but... Because I'm going to butcher it, but... Has you... Has you... But how is your last name Huntington the third? But you haven't... What, and your dad's not Jay Huntington the third? What? 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 That's why I'm saying, like, I, but barely, and they had good traits. I don't know how they had, like, such a bad childhood. Am I going home? No. Is there a bathroom here? I really thought there was, but I don't see it. Go mess around with Danny on the cuddle carts. Where do I mess around with, with them? This one. Let's mess around with Danny. Why can't we? Is it because we smell and we have to go potty? Do you want to go mess around on the cuddle carts? Since it's kind of like our last night to be like really teenagers. She's really got to be. Mwah. <laughs> Let's go. It's cuddle cart time. Are you ready? Have you seen these? Messing around on the rides is probably one of the cutest parts of high school. Why isn't it doing it? Danny used a condom. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I don't know why that just like took me out a little bit. <laughs> Good for him. <laughs> yeah, it's very responsible. I was like, what? It just took a little while for him to get the condom on. It was fine. <laughs> we didn't get caught. Okay. I think we did hook up on the Ferris wheel. I think we've hooked up at all these places. But we got kicked out of the cuddle carts last time. BDE right there. Yeah. Oh, here's the bathroom. Use the bathroom. She's really gotta pee. Where's the any? Oh, we're just leaving him here? Okay. Oh, and she's so smelly. No, we should just go home. Let's just go home. Just go home. Just go home. Say, Danny, I gotta go. I gotta go. I smell. I, uh, I need to go take a shower. I need to pee. I need to go. She's ovulating? Oh, God. That's what I get for putting wonderful whims in here. Why are we angry? 
I peed myself. So I really gotta go. Angry about crush? How dare Clover's crush just wave at someone else? Waving is something special only for Clover. Oh my god. What? Who did he wave at? Who's he waving at? Because he waved at... Oh my god, stop. He, he, you're literally dating. <laughs> Super smart move with the protection then, yeah, because she's ovulating. <sighs> this could have been the teen pregnancy let's play. Jeez. Although I don't think I have that turned on. Is that something you have to turn on? Are we gonna get pregnant? Go home. It's taking you forever. Did she get a crush on someone else? I don't think so. Oh no. Oh no. Go home. No, go home. Oh god, we fainted. We fainted because of the fucking werewolf. Damn it. Alright, spin the wheel. <laughs> we fainted. It was very scary. Fight? Who, the werewolf? Are we fighting a were- who are we fighting? I don't think- I think the werewolf's gonna kick our ass. I'm gonna- not gonna lie. Like, where did they go? We will lose? I agree. Who are we beating up? Who's Matt? No, not Matt. Who's this? Maybe we should beat up her, because she's not even a Huntington the Third. She's faking her name. You know, like, during the MySpace days when everyone was like, oh, I'm- I'm a Hilton. Like, no, you're not. She might get bitten. We're not gonna fight the- <laughs> We're not gonna fight the- Wake up! It's almost Charlie's birthday. Shut up. We're not gonna- <laughs> We're not gonna fight them. We do need to go home, though. Don't talk- No. Don't show- Show off crown. No. Just go home. Just go home. Just go home. Are we gonna fight- Faint again? I'm in danger! Oh my god, we are in danger. We aren't friends with her kicker butt. We're just so miserable already. Hold on. Oh, we're running. We're running. Well, there's Danny. Bitch, <laughs> why are you mad? Because my pussy pops severely and yours don't. Huh? Honestly, why are you mad? Uh, now I'm mortified. Fuck. I gotta go home. Go home. I'm just gonna switch. I'm just gonna switch. I'm just gonna go home. <laughs> we need to go home. Now we're mortified. <laughs> I was gonna go beat somebody up, but no, we're mortified. We're gonna yell at somebody else at instead. <laughs> it was all going so well. Well, to be fair, it did go pretty well. I mean, we got a lovely photo at prom. Our boyfriend won prom royalty, and we hooked up at prom. And we hooked up in the cuddle carts, and then we peed ourselves, and then we saw a werewolf and we fainted. You know, it's just, it's fine. This will be a prom she'll never forget, yeah, honestly. It was just, <laughs> it was, it's fine. Our boyfriend used a condom, it's fine. Oh my god, I rewatched um, Knocked Up for the first time in like probably 10 years <laughs> the other night. Um, I can't believe that I used to, those movies don't age well at all, and I can't believe, and I know that the people in them, like, Seth Rogen has said, like, that they don't age well, and he knows it, which is good, I'm glad, but, like, I'm surprised, no, oh my god, I'm so stupid, I'm so stupid, I was going to bring her over, no, all right, anyway, Seth Rogen was like, I know they don't age well. Anyway, I was watching it and I was like, why was I on his side originally? He's a, he's a bum. <laughs> and he was the one who was like, 
he's the one who's like, oh, she's like, she's like, come on, let's just do it already. And then he was like, okay, fine. And then chuck the condom. What a dumbass. Hit him in the face. That movie sucks. <laughs> Why did I think it was funny? <laughs> All the parts that I thought were funny weren't even funny. Paul Rudd is the only one that's funny in that movie. Humor has changed quite a bit. Or my humor, at least. <laughs> I don't want free earbuds. <laughs> Why did I do this? I just got a computer part for my computer. So I'm going to be trying to teach myself how to put it in. And I'm praying that I don't ruin everything. So. I haven't done it yet. But it should make like my loading screens and a bunch of things faster. And it should have more space, ideally. But we'll see. We'll see. You know, all these times and we still haven't gotten join a cult. Or start a cult. Yeah, bladder failure and woohoo, yeah. We've already done both of those. 40 Old Virgin will always be a classic. That one stands up. I've rewatched that one and that one stands up pretty well. There's still some like jokes in it that are pretty stupid, but like it stands up pretty well. Talk about Daddy Pedro. Sims frustrates us. Goes off on random topic. Yeah, fair. I did all those things. Just catching up. Yeah. If there's one thing a rampage where. Oh. The computer has an interaction that lets you adopt a new family member. Yeah, I know. Do we have adopt on here? We have adopt pet. Do we have adopt kid? We have one night stand. We have hook up. We have accidental pregnancy. She was stranger. Coming out. Uh, drug problems. I don't think we have adoption. Adopt child. Or science baby. So we can choose. So we can choose. Go home. Ooh. Go home. Get him. <laughs> Let me save that. Because now uh, the Sims have a thing called a science baby. So you can have a baby with literally anybody that you're friends with if you want to. Which is great, especially if you're doing like... um. If you have a sim that, like, for instance, can't get pregnant or you're doing some kind of surrogacy type of situation or any of that. MCC Woohoo has teen pregnancy as a setting according to the Sims 4 subreddit. Does it? Shit. I think MC Command Center can do way more than I think it can. The free airboats thing is annoying. I get it. And I don't even have the pack that gives them to you. <laughs> I think it's weird that they, I, I kind of understand why they would have like a blanket statement of things that pop up, but I don't really know why they would have, I don't know why they would do that because there's going to be so many people who don't have the fitness pack that the earbuds came with and they're going to be like, what do you mean earbuds? There's no earbuds in this game. It's not even like a feature really of that pack either. So a lot of people won't even know what pack earbuds come in. It comes in the in the fitness stuff pack, by the way, if you didn't know. Which is interesting. It's an interesting pack. It has some cool furniture items and some cool like workout gear, but it's really not much. All of the stuff packs really should just be, like, revamped. <laughs> I know they don't make any money from that, so they probably won't do anything about it, but they should. 
Okay, first I need you to go here and give yourself a pep talk. Just immediately do that and take a bubble bath. We gotta, we gotta bring this mood down immediately. Farting is addicting. <laughs> it's fart night addicting. I bet if you, especially if you get good at it, it's probably really addicting. Yeah. Tripna. I know you're hungry. Oh God. That's not good. Oh God. Don't, you can't, you can't die before we even start. You want to see me try it? You just want to see me die immediately is what you want to see. I've tried Fortnite and the only, and when I did, I just died immediately. I ran around and then I died. And then who I was, and then the people I were playing with got annoyed that they had to revive me. That's why I had you say thank you. Make out with Danny. I mean, yeah. Get to know Clarissa, your sister. Play chess. Okay. We're going to feel a little better after this, I can tell. All right. Let's get some food. Get some leftovers when you're done. You're very hungry, very tired. What are you sad about? You're cold? Let's put you in your in your winter outfit. I don't even know if I, I don't think I did his outfits. I think they're just random. Let's see what your winter outfit is. That's that's fine. You wanna what? Be friendly with your dad? Cute. Parenting level seven. I can't believe she's not parenting level 10. She's had seven kids. I mean, one of them died, but. Bears, yeah, bears. Bears, bears. Talk about sibling. Read toddler books. Grinia his lip. Prum. Oh, you're hungry. That's good. That's a good thing to know. Why don't you read to him and then take and then take him to get food? Oh. Zimona Cero? Maybe? Oh, We have food in our inventory? I don't think we do. Kisana's Navy. Oompa free. Okay. It's almost, I think it's today or tomorrow is Clover's birthday. Oh my god, I forgot about this outfit. Look at how big her boobs look in this shirt. Um, because of their mom, Bev, who had gigantic boobs, all of our all of our girls have really big boobs. And this is like smaller than than they used to be. Smaller than Bev's were. Uh -huh. Um. Yips. Uh -huh. What is it? What's it? What? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Hi. Hi, Crystal. All right. We're gonna move. We're gonna move out. Where do you wanna? Where do you wanna go? I think. Is it tomorrow? Is her birthday? It's both of their birthdays. Okay. That's probably, that's probably good. We don't really need a toddler. <laughs> we don't need to leave a toddler around here. I think we're going to figure out who, what her life is going to look like. Let's open um, our worlds and our numbers. Let's do our worlds first. Let's figure out where we're going to live. Okay. We have the new one in here, right?
What's the new one called? Hold on, I don't see it. It's called San Sequoia. My cat got anxious hearing the meows. Oh no. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck is that? Who, who is that? The cat's the cat is annoyed. Alright, now we're now where are we going? San Sequoia is in there. Somebody better pay attention to this cat. Grilled cheese. This food this family's all about grilled cheese. It's how we communicate with each other. Grilled cheese? Oh, oh, my goodness. It's still going. It's going. All right. Really? Oh, God. All right. That's fine. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> Grilling cheeses are a lovely way to communicate. Yeah, I always thought so. I like grilled cheeses and grilling cheeses. Sometimes when you grill the cheeses, you can make those really nice, like crispy Parmesan, you know, little cracker type of things, but they're not crackers. They're just crispy Parmesan. What are you giving? Popcorn? That's not food, man. Okay, we gotta move to Strangerville. That's, that's fine, we can live there. We're moving out on our own, you know? All right, numbers. How many babies are we having? I feel like I need to add more numbers on here. Oh my God, six. <laughs> fuck, fuck you with six. I'm gonna add in one, two, three, one. I'm gonna add in more of these. One. To the country she goes. <laughs> to the desert she goes. Two. You wanna become best friends? Yeah, of course. Three. Putting some more ones and twos and threes in there. There we go. Now that you're here, do you want to be my boyfriend? Whoa. Billy, oh, Billy's calling. Hey, since we're like besties, do you want to be my, do you want to be my boyfriend? You want to be my boyfriend? Do you want to move in? Oh, look at Lee. Oh, you're just going to walk past your child like that? Oh. Okay, Cassidy's got multiple relationships going. Clover's feeling very playful now. Go to bed. Why are you awake right now? No, not coffee. Oh my god, you guys in your coffee, bro. No, go sleep. Oh, I forgot. It unassigned it all the, all the beds. <laughs> I forgot. Clover. That's one of the new glitches right now. It, uh, it's unassigning beds. Ah. Uh. What do you want? Hey, uh, things have been sort of crazy lately and I need a place to stay for a while. Mind if I crash at your place for a bit? Sure. Who's that? If that's Kyle, I'm gonna freak out. If that's Kyle? Uh, we need Kyle for K. We'll have to re-download. Can we re He must be in the gallery under Maxis, right? Kyle Kyleson? 
we gotta we gotta marry Kyle during cut for K. One of my Sims had a kid with the Grim Reaper one time. How did you do that? We have been trying to figure that out. Okay, assign bed to Cassidy. And then this is your bed. There you go. Who did I, who came, who's coming over to stay for a while? And is it Kyle? babies are we having I want to know who's coming over three three we might have to adopt who's this Rashawn you're staying over. Who are you? I know you. It could be eight. <laughs> well, the most we have is six because then it would be like a full household. However, we do have an extended household, so I guess it doesn't matter. Oh my God. All right, so we're moving to, uh, to Strangerville, and we're having three babies. Oh, yeah, how are we starting out? That's the other part we need to know. How are we starting out? to this. Bron's calling. Hi, Bron. I can't believe Bron is still alive. Bron has had a long life. Okay, now I want to add one. Um, so whatever you pick is not what I'm doing. Uh, Roommates. <laughs> Rags to riches. Maybe. Okay, now go. That might be what we're doing. All right, how are we starting? Oh, a tree house. That's smart, too. Do I add that in and then redo it? <laughs> You just watch James Turner do it. It makes sense that they would do that. Roommates, we got roommates. You can sleep too in it. Okay, hold on, and then we had treehouse. Are, are there any other ways that we could start? We have, um, we get a gallery house, a tiny home, a mansion, roommates, a tree house, rags to riches, base game money, inheritance 100K, or an EA house. Squatting at the rec center. That's essentially rags to riches. Um, and if you do, if you, I was, I was thinking like she could stay at home, but then what measure would we have for her to get enough money to leave? Because it would be tied in. It's not like we have different bank accounts. Um, yeah, it gets tricky. I think that's good. We'll go with that. All right, this is the real one. Whatever one we get, this is the one. Does Chanel have a job? Base game money. That's not bad. Oh, yeah, Chanel's an actor. 
Natwa. Do we have a cake? Oh, you're playing. Oh my god, how cute. Um, replace. Are we gonna move into the, that trailer? <laughs> if we have base game money, I don't know how many places we can afford in Strangerville. Pretty much everything on the lower level. I think the upper level would be too expensive. Unless we, like, bought a lot and then built something small on it. Let's see. Do we have a cake for tomorrow? We don't. No, we have a, we have a lot of half-eaten cakes. Lots of half-eaten cakes. Okay, can you make a cake I forgot we have a guesting over okay we're gonna make a hamburger cake get one of the cheapest ones the cheapest lots or the cheapest houses look at how big our mom's boobs are should we keep her redheaded or should we um you have to assign a bed for the guest oh okay we do happen to have an extra bed assign a bed to Rashawn. there you go you're welcome Rashawn. how are you I feel like Chanel's gonna hit on him. Friendly introduction. Hey. I like your hair. You look nice in that outfit. You're friends with my sister? That's cool. I'm also friends with my sister. He's kind of cute, not gonna lie. How is he a land grab? Who's your fam? Who? How are you a land grab? Who's? I don't know who Ren is. And Nolan. Okay. You're, you wait. You live in a mansion? Hi Mars. How are you? Welcome in. You live in a mansion? Hey. See, see, out of all of them, I think Chanel would be the one that's gold digging. Friendly introduction. Are we? Have we even not even introduced? Let me introduce myself. Hi, my name is Chanel. Uh -huh. I'm an actress with very large boobs. Add birthday candles to this. Thank you. That's for that's for the birthdays. In fact, I think I'm just gonna have them age up anyway. Why don't you serve some lunch, some some franks and beans? How about that? I don't know why I always choose franks and beans, but do it. Okay, if you're not doing it, um, help. We're also gonna help out the candles. Oh, Charlie, because it's basically it's his birthday too. Chinese food for super yum, yum. All right, Clover, can you come here? It's technically your birthday. Come on in here. I'm, I'm tired of waiting. Blow out the candles. Yeah, in your little cute little birdie outfit. Oh my god, totally. <laughs> Fish for compliments. Ask about day. Thank you for coming to my birthday, everyone. <sighs> oh, can't wait to finally be an adult. Alright. Oh, romantic? outgoing and loves the outdoors okay all right all right we're gonna do i'm gonna do dice humble borfna <laughs> i'm gonna do dice actually i'm gonna do this dice because this is bigger okay all right let's figure out what we're doing with our life 
Um, 11. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Nature, wow. Um, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. She wants to be a country caretaker and... Okay. All right. She graduated high school. Graduation. Let's um, add birthday candles here for your for your brother, and then you can go to the bathroom. Um, we might have to ask your brother to come over. Not your brother, your boyfriend to come over and age him up too, because he's still a teen. And you guys are moving out together, so. What did that say? I got a special gift for you. Oh my God, a gift for me? Yes, invite in. Okay, Danny's coming over. Hey sis. Hold on, I just gotta finish going pee. Okay, Danny, I'm just gonna really quick add you to my household <laughs> so that I can age you up too. Full house, yeah. Daniel. Okay, are we on our way to talk to our sister or no? Oh, 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 oh. Charlie is about to age up. Let's go, Charlie. Hoppaborfna. <laughs> The cat's eating the chili. Okay, I need you to come in here. Are we, are we good? We're gonna add um, candles to this so you can also age up. You can do it without adding them? Well, too bad. Cause we also gotta move out together. So technically it'll be easier this way. <laughs> A cow named Melissa. <laughs> Blow out candles. Happy birthday, Danny. Oh my god, don't tell me you're going outside to age up. Okay, Danny. Oh, that's perfect. Danny is romantic, self assured, and a goofball. Danny, what do you want to do with your life? Seventeen. I think that starts over again. There's fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen. <laughs> really? Oh wait. Where'd it go? Uh oh, where'd it go? I dropped it and it's gone. Oh no! I'll never know what number it said. Rude. Well, I have a smaller dice until I find that one. Okay, um. He wants to be a bodybuilder. <laughs> Danny DeVito, the bodybuilder. Danny DeVito, the bodybuilder. Thinking about graduation? We should probably do one where it's like, are they gonna have, are they gonna go to high, are they gonna go to college or not? We should probably have a, th a we should probably have something for that, right? <laughs> Are you, are you both, were you both sitting in a chair? On short lifespan? Oh, true, we are on short lifespan. So they just never have higher education on short lifespan. Danny, let's move out. Oh my god, I can propose? It's a little soon for that, is it? 
Mom, I'm moving out. Oh wait, where's Charlie? Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's evil. <laughs> no, Charlie, no. Charlie, no. No, he is not. Fine, he's a green fiend. How about that? Snapped. Okay. Oh. Alright, Mom, I'm moving out. Me and Danny are moving. Um, I would like to... Why don't I ever have the split and move from household feature on here? I just says move household. They like never give me the split one. Why is that? Okay, fine. I'm gonna say I'm gonna manage worlds. The one kid gave Birdie a pizza. Who did? The guy that's visiting? Or the one that came in? The mullet one, Clarissa? Our, our daughter, our non-binary daughter? Would you still refer to them as a daughter? I don't know. Child, our non-binary non child. The pop-up said they have Birdie, they gave Birdie a gift of pizza. Fuck yeah, I love pizza. Okay, we're gonna have to do it manually. Um, transfer Sims. Where is my, where did it go? Am I gonna have to stand all the way up to see where my dice went? Oh, it's right there. I found it. Okay. New household. Um, Birdie, no, Clover. Oh my God, I'm gonna do that the whole time. We need to change her hair. Cause she looked too much like Birdie used to look. Danny. And they get twenty thousand dollars base game base game money. Twenty thousand dollars to go live your life. All you have it's what's in your pockets. Okay. Let's move. We're going to Strangerville. No, that's Oasis Springs. That's not Strangerville. Wait, where did that one guy live? He lived in Oasis Springs. Was it this one? Did he live at the land grab house? Oh my God, he does. With a dog and his dad. Cute. Okay, we're going. Hi, Tori. Who is this? Hi, Queen. How are you? Um. One of our, <laughs> one of our Sims, we, sp we have a wheel spin for plot twist. So one of our Sims just became Polly. <laughs> that reminds me of you. Okay, we're going to Strangerville. Um, I guess we're going to have to move. Oh my God. The only place it's open is the trailer. We can move into the trailer. <gasps> Kyle lives. Oh my God. Kyle lives in the plane. Kyle's there. Oh my God, can we put cheat with Kyle on the thing? I love Kyle. Kyle's ripped, by the way. I was watching Tori's stream and I was like, mm. I think that um, we're gonna put him in the game when we reach um, K and then, we, and then we're gonna marry Kyle at K. Cause right now we're, tr we're at C and so we have to marry someone with a D last name. So we're going to marry Danny DeVito. And then it's going to be E, F, G, H, I, J, K. Oh my God, there's so many now. It's going to take a while to get to Kyle. Kyle's going to be dead by then. We're have to get, we'll have to get new Kyle. Yes, that's how the alphabet works. I know, I was just seeing how, how long. Hold on. It's 
like seven generations from now. You made it to make sure to keep aging him down. We can probably get a new one from the gallery, right? They've got to have put him in the gallery. On Maxis, hold on. If not, I guess I could put him in the gallery just to like save him late for later. Um, oh, I put a new picture by the way. How does it look? That looks cute. Um, Maxis. Maxis. Maxis will absolutely have him up. Oh, look at these little rooms. Are they doing the little room challenge too in Maxis? Why is he not in here, Kyle? Why did you not put Kyle up? I feel maybe they just haven't gotten to it. All right, well then I just wanna do this really quick. Kyle Kyleson. Can I just, oh, I can't do it right now because we're moving. Okay, it's fine. We're, so I think we're gonna move to the trailer. It's the only thing that's not, doesn't have other people living there, but we could technically make other people move and we can move into this little house or we could move into the, pla the plane wreck. <laughs> Hi, Mandy, welcome in. Do you think we should move to a completely empty lot? The plane, the trailer, or the house. Let's do it. Let's do a little poll really quick. Which lot? Um, plane, trailer, house, empty lot. On the empty lot, we would just build our own. Uh, you can have additional votes. Start poll. Okay. Let me know which one you think we should do. Honestly, I'm kind of open to all of them. I think the house might be kind of boring, but we haven't really stayed at that lot. The trailer we've stayed at for one of our Let's Plays, but not... It was a really messed up let's play, so it would be more like realistic. Um, we haven't stayed at the at the plane wreck, and we haven't and we haven't stayed at either of these. So, oh, house is in the lead. If we had an empty lot, we would build our own house. By the way. Just so you know, maybe you're, maybe you're thinking, I want to live in a house, but there's only that house. No, if we had an empty lot, we would just build our own house. Okay. Nobody wants to live in the trailer. So someone's fighting for the plane and someone's fighting for the empty lot now. The house is like out of the question. We're building our own house. <laughs> I lived in that trailer with my useless of a drug dealer boyfriend so I killed him off and then ran away with my girlfriend <laughs> oh my god that's the best storyline empty lot is in the lead who who really wants plane somebody really wants plane somebody really wants us to live underground in an in a underground plane bunker Okay, I think empty lot is the winner. <laughs> Disco really wants the empty lot. <laughs> Dis Disco was going for the house, and then they're like, oh, we build our own house? Yeah, empty lot then. <laughs> Who was really going for the plane? I wish it would tell me. <laughs> All right, let's go for an empty lot. We could say it this one or this one. Creek Corner Cove. They're both the same price. You were the plane? <laughs> <laughs> Fixy. I just voted once for playing, but empty lot sounds really good too. Okay. Uh, do we want to be like on the cliff or inward? The 
cliff might be more of a cool... Oh, there's, there's a lake back there? Do you want cliffside crest or creek corner cove? <laughs> yes, claim your abundance. Welcome in. Daily dose of abundance. Oof. Um hold on. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do I'm just gonna randomize it. I'm gonna randomize it. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Cliff. Over likes nature by the water. Bruh. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. I don't even remember seeing water over there. Can you get to that water? Can you fish? Fine, let's go find out. We'll move there. I guess it really just is like one of them's more horizontal and the other one's more vertical. Why are we the DeVito family? Why aren't we the Culver family? How, se how sexist. <laughs> Welcome in everybody, by the way. If you are here just lurking, if you're new here, please feel free to, if you want to chat, feel free to chat. Everyone in the chat is very nice. Even if you've never been here before, um, you're more than welcome. And uh, if you ever feel intimidated, just know that uh, if anyone's ever mean to you, I will beat them up. I will throw hands. We will exclamation point slap them in the face. So don't, if you ever feel intimidated coming into a, a stream or a chat, I got your back. I will, I will welcome you with open arms. I don't know why I keep looking at the microphone when I say that, when I should be looking at you specifically. That was a little weird. But yeah, I just want you to know that. I know I go into a lot of people's chats and I'll be like, I don't know these people and I feel really intimidated, so I just want you to... Have you saved recently? I will when we get in. I will as soon as we get in there. Have you saved recently? All of you. We're all a little nutty, but kind. <laughs> True. <laughs> it's just like a silly, we're just like a silly, fun, chaotic, comfy crew. You just did? Yes, nice. Okay, I gotta, hold on. We gotta sit up straight. I hate sitting up straight. It's not in my nature. I gotta get, I thought, I feel like I used to have one of those brace things that you, that would like help you like sit up straight. I don't know where it is though. It's lost somewhere. I'm not sure you saw my redeemed Victorian slang word. Ooh, okay. We got new ones today. Thank you for reminding me. I did not see it. There it is. It's right there in my face. Um, I found more. Let's see. I don't remember what it looked like though. It was this one. Okay. Okay. The first one is the first Victorian slang word of the day from this new one is. Oh, God, there's so many too. There's literally an entire book on it. On Victorian slang words. Okay, hold on. I want to see really quick. Oh, my homework. Do I really need that? I don't think so. This is our new lot. This is nice. This is nice. Where is water? There's a, a lake or a river. There's a river. Where's the lake from the picture though? I don't see a lake. I see a river. They're tripping. Whatever. It's nice though. This is a nice look. There's like plants all over it and stuff. Why is the mailbox over there? All right, we'll save. Um, okay. The first one is <laughs> um, 
We'll do two because um, the first one is just like wild. Um, the Alexandra Limp. The slang is Alexandra Limp. What, what did that refer to in Victorian times? Alexandra Limp. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. Oh my God, we only have $15,000 to build a house. <laughs> We're gonna have to build a tiny house. Alexandra Limp. It's not sexual, if that's what you're thinking with those, with those things. Hi, welcome in. How are you doing? We're doing our Victorian slang word of the day and it is Alexandra Limp. What do you think that meant? Alexandra Limp is when you got such huge tatas that you have to limp. <laughs> Building a house from scratch. Yeah, we're gonna build. Um, we only have fifteen thousand dollars to build a little house to live in, so I guess we're gonna have a little um, tiny house. Um, a dying flower. Mm -mm. So this is wild, and this is like a history thing, which is what makes it even cooler to me. Um, an affected manner of walking seen in many women for several years and attributed to the then Princess of Wales who had some trouble with a knee. People would walk with a limp to walk like someone who had a bad knee because they were the epitome of being. They faked a limp because someone else had a bad knee. That's the cool thing to do. That's crazy. That is so wild. Victorians were so odd. Honestly, this is what happens when you don't have like everybody, you know, have it, getting the same, getting more news. They wanted that good parking with the Kara carriage. You changed your color, Toke. Did you change your color? It used to be green for me. And now you're like a pinkish red? You did. You're like a, it's like a red? You changed it a bunch? Uh oh. You're gonna you're keeping me on my toes. But clearly feisty. Hi, welcome in. So like bitches wearing fake glasses for fashion when my blind ass needed glasses to see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we're gonna do one more Victorian slang phrase of the day. This one is, you're green? You're green? On mine, on one of them, you're blue, and on the other one, you're red. I don't know why also on Streamlabs, sometimes they're a different color than on Twitch. That's weird, that's wild. Whereas like disco is always purple. Selenia's pink. On mine you're green on yours you're green? What the fuck? It's wild. It's green for you on mobile? Oh my god. What is why I don't know why it changes it. That's so weird. You're green for you too. That's so funny. Okay, um, so the next one is air hole. What is an air hole in Victorian times? Air hole. I think we're kind of essentially gonna make a little trailer. What's an air hole in Victorian times? Purple by a show is gray for myself, which is offensive. You're, you're purple for me. An air hole is a man who is a jerk when flying his hot air balloon. I like it. <laughs> it's not that, but I like it. It works for me. Uh, 
Um, an arrow hole in Victorian times was a small, often dismal, public park adapted from old graveyards with the gravestones removed and replaced to stand century style around the circumference of the gar of the park. They would take old graveyards, take all of the gravestones and just make them go around almost like a fence. And then it would be a park? That's fucked up, right? Isn't that fucked up? <laughs> Clearly the Victorians were fine. <laughs> Clearly they were fine. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Tote got his first hug. Alright, I think we're gonna live in a trailer here. Because I think that's what we can afford. Your first hug. I was gentle. Oh my god, it messed it up. They left the graves. <laughs> they left, they left, I'm pretty sure they left everyone buried and then just lined the gravestones around. <laughs> I don't think that they viewed a burial as being as important as, as we do. Not my first slap though. Why is it that everyone seems to have one slap already? That's kind of weird. Every time somebody gets a slap, it seems like it's already been there. Like they've already been slapped once. Everybody's been slapping. I end my hugs with a little slap. Aww. <laughs> Just like, I slapped all of us early. I didn't though. Caskets and graves used to have air holes and bells just in case. I know. Oh my god. And you can still. I was at a cemetery for a. At a I was at a funeral and I was looking and I knew about the bells. So and I saw bells in the cemetery and I was like, oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Just in case. I don't like that though. I don't like the little out thing like that. Can I get one that doesn't go out? I want it to be flush to the house. It messes with my vision. Fine. I'm gonna move this. All right, so we're essentially gonna live in a in a tiny home, tiny home with tiny home trailer. What? Wait, I'm gonna turn it into a tiny home for real. Tiny home. Not my biggest fear, but it's up there for sure to be like buried alive. Yeah, it's pretty terrifying. Okay, we're at 71 tiles. Okay, we need to bring that down. We need to bring that down. This is this is a, a slightly large trailer. It is a fear, but not a big one. Wait, now that I think of it, <laughs> now I'm terrified. <laughs> there we go. I want all of my 64 tiles, so I'm gonna have to just do that. I can't just live without it, I need it. I want, there. Give me one more tile, thank you, I need it. That's for the shower or something. <laughs> just like a little one. <laughs> a 
Okay, we're living in a tier two. I think a tier, a tier one is just too small. It's only like a 30 by 30 or something. It's very small. This one will at least give us cozy comforts, less bills, feeling good, better skills. So we'll go for that. I don't wanna be cramped in there. I think we need different stairs. Um, what pack should we use? We gotta use Tiny Living. Base game. Tiny Living. And then give me two other packs to use. Eighty percent platonic love. <laughs> High school and dream home. Eighty percent is high. It is high. Um, earlier it was telling me I had like one percent. Uh, and dream home. I went to a haunted house and literally froze. An employee had to open a side door so I could escape. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. I went, um, I did photography. I photographed somebody in a haunted house. It was like a haunted, it was like a warehouse that they created for like doing haunted houses in it. And um, it was wild and they were telling me all about it and like what they do and how they like, it was one of those like touching ones where they can touch you, which is so scary. <laughs> They're like, yeah, we've had people faint. <laughs> we've had, um, and I was like, no, <laughs> this is a no for me. Thanks, no. I'm, I'm going to pass. I don't know what you would have out here. These? I'll go with that. I keep going to more and more extreme ones. I've been to ones that are all that are alone. That's crazy. There's a really good one. The the one I went to that I photographed people in was in Portland and it was really good. I wouldn't go there. They had it they have a counter every year on how many people throw up, how many people shit themselves, how many people um, physically hit the people working there, how many people lose shoes, people have lost keys, phones. It's wild. Okay, let's see. Uh, outside. A, a pink trailer. <gasps> I want a little pink trailer. We're gonna live in our little pink trailer with, um, what, with what? It's gonna be decorated, cute. We'll have a cute little trailer. We like the insides all nice and fancy. Danny's just gonna have to deal with our pink trailer. He's gonna be like, I like pink, good. You better, you better like it. There we go, something like that. Toke, you're gonna scare Disco. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> gone no more come with me I'd protect you I don't think so <laughs> I'm pretty sure disco would just be like no 
this could be like we're no longer friends. Bruh. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Let's see. That? No, I don't really like that for the floor in there, actually. I'm just gonna be totally honest. I don't know if I like any of these. How much is this? Four dollars. A tile? <laughs> Four dollars for the whole tile? Mm. A wood floor? Oh, it doesn't look right in there for some reason. A white floor? Carpet? <gasps> Would you have carpet? Maybe you would. Tile. Ooh, fancy tile. Hi, I'm new. I really like the energy of the stream. Yay, welcome in. Welcome being here. Feel feel free to chat or or lurk, whatever is comfortable for you. Um, everyone here is really friendly. And if they're not friendly to you, I will beat them up. I've already told them. They already know. They've been warned. Not that they would need to. <laughs> How expensive is this? Six, oh my God. Yeah, yeah, this is a luxury. This is a luxury trailer, okay? This is a luxury trailer. This, I'm just building it as if I was building it for myself. This one, that one, this one. I actually don't know if I like that there. I don't like the little things. <gasps> Toki, you love it here? Yay. I love having you here. I didn't see any there. Yeah. I found out you get the special bassinet if you have a baby shower. If you have gold on the baby shower. I don't know if that's going to help. It's oh, hi, Kittles. How are you? Dancing frogs. Dancing frogs. Um... I don't know if we're gonna get gold on a baby shower. The last time that we had a baby shower, it was a, a breakup baby shower. And I don't think that that's, yeah, a baby shower would be easier if we aren't trying to dump eight celebrities, yeah. Uh, we ended our stream last time by having a breakup baby shower where we broke up with everyone that we were dating throughout our 100 babies that was still alive. Yeah, because we were going to get married at the end of it. We're trying to marry Kyle, Kyle said. I've got goals. You know, I want to show him I'm dedicated to him. I just found out the other day that apparently a majority of men think that women are talking to multiple men at the same time, which is like the weirdest thing I've ever heard because I... I've only ever known, like, if a, if a girl's talking to someone, it's usually just that one person. And only sometimes do I meet people who are like, oh, yeah, I'm talking to a bunch of people. But, like, usually that's because they're on some, you know, they're just not really looking for a specific person. They just kind of want to date around. But, like, I thought that was weird. I was like, if I'm talking to someone, usually I'm talking to one person, mostly. Although some people do talk to other people, a bunch of people, I don't know. What's the special one do? I think it just looks different, the special bassinet. Yeah, I don't talk to a bunch of guys at once, never been that way, yeah. When I was single, I would chat to a few at a time, needed to see who deserved to move on to the next round. <laughs> like I've, even when I've, even when I tried doing that, I just stopped because it felt weird to me. Like, because I don't, I didn't feel like I could, um, I, I mean, this is where people are different, but I didn't feel like I could get to know someone if I was trying to get to know multiple people. Your ex talked to multiple, I fixed her car and she drove to another dude. I was shocked. Oh my God, that's wild. <laughs>
We think women can get any man anytime. It's kind of insecure, but we think it for sure. We kind of, we think the same thing about men usually. Or I have in the past. I don't really know if I feel that way now, considering the fact that um, most women aren't standing for men who are misogynistic. And a lot of men are misogynistic, so I don't, what do I don't know what door I want. Do I want a single door? I mean, that would make sense. I attract losers. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> I think that we attract people who illuminate things in our life that we need to change. Um, I tend to attract people that need to be fixed in some way or need like to, or like just don't have their shit together and want somebody else to fix it for them. And so as like, I'm like working on myself so that I don't have a need to feel like I need to change anything about anyone or fix anything about anyone. That's fine. I value my relationship so much and I have far less energy emotionally to waste on throwing a large net, honestly. It's hard. It's hard to be friends with a lot of people. It's easier when you're streaming and you have a bunch of people to talk to at once though. <laughs> But like in real life, in like day-to-day uh, -day life, I usually don't talk to anyone. I'm usually just, um, you know, conserving my energy. Can I have big windows? Out here. I'm gonna have one big window, a nice large window. Ooh, and one of these for this like little kitchen window. And I'm in my 30s now and with four kids. Oh my god, four kids. How are you how are you doing? Are you okay? Do you need to sit down? So I'm like, don't waste my time because I have none to spare. Are you okay? <laughs> Anytime somebody has a kid, I'm like, are you okay? Do you need to sit down? But like four? Oh my god. That's just exhausting. I'm exhausted for you. Are they attacking you? Yes. <laughs> Let me see. I want, like, these windows are really cute, but, like, I don't know if they look, they don't really look right. Do they? I like how they look like you can open them. Even though you can't. Hi, Stoney. Welcome in. No, they're good kids. Good kids. That's nice. Oh, I do like this window. But what, we wouldn't really need to escape our house. These are the new windows they gave us. I rarely use them, but it kind of go, it goes with the door I picked. And I rarely use them. I love realism in game, so I'm ready for the challenge. For the top, for the infants. The infants definitely make it more real, that's for sure. The 100 baby challenge almost broke me the other night. My, baby, my babies on the other, and the sims on the other hand are exhausting me. <laughs> yeah, honestly. They really did like almost break me. I don't... 
was a, it was gonna become like a challenge between who can break who first, and they broke me for sure. I don't like that either. I don't know what I want. A trailer would probably have more like um, these kind of windows. I only have eight eight kids in The Sims or eight what? Eight what? Only. I'll do that in the front and in the bathroom. No, it doesn't look. I don't like it. It doesn't look good. Okay, I can't. I gotta chill out. I gotta chill. I'm chilling. Are you chill? I'm chilling. I'm gonna be chill. Just be chill. I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna move this door over. There. I hate it. It's fine. <laughs> Is it fine? No. It's not. I'll keep that. I'll keep the door there for now, though. I just want like these, these plain windows. Is this who I am now? Am I plain windows? Oh no. Am I plain windows with shutters? I don't know. I'm not loving my window choices. Ooh, what about this one? This one has a similar feel to the other one, but it's less, it's less. <gasps> Mojo spinning the wheel. Oh no, Mojo. I will say though, if you are talking to multiple people on dating websites, it makes more sense because uh, you don't know if you're gonna like anybody on there. But usually if you decide that you like someone, you're just talking to one person. In my, in my opinion, in my thing. Oh yeah, the other, another shell. Yeah, we usually don't do, um, you can't, you have, you can't have CC because we can't really transfer it, but you can do, uh, any of the packs. Hi Zoe! Sorry, I'm both trying to concentrate and trying to read the chat, and I'm, I'm having a hard time doing both. Oh yeah, you gotta finish the bar. I still have to finish my bar too from the last from the last shell challenge. If anybody has, uh, we have our previous shell challenge was doing a bar in The Sims, and if anybody does do that, um, and we already looked at a lot of the submissions, but if you have been working on it, you can just let me know. And we can look at it on stream. If we do talk to multiple, is that bad? I mean, I guess not. But if you do decide that you like somebody, you know, you should stop talking to the other people. <laughs> I mean, I see why people do. It really just depends on the person, though, you know, to be honest. I, don't, I shouldn't say, like, people don't do that. Because people do do that. But, okay, you know what? I kind of like this window. We're going to do that window. They'll both be gone in a month for sure. <laughs> why is and why is that, Toke? Let's have it. Let's have a therapy session. Why are you sure that they're gonna be gone in a month? Cause you already know that it's not gonna last. And if you already know it's not gonna last, then why are you still talking to them? Or have or do you think that it could have potential for it to last, and yet? you're resistant to it for some reason. Let's talk about it. <laughs> you're like, no, let's not. <laughs> you're talking to multiple people because none of them have taken me on a date. So I'm, yeah. And that's fair. If you haven't like met any of them in person and like, 
doesn't seem like it's going anywhere. If that makes sense. Because going out and having someone to do things with is fun. Then that would just be a friend, wouldn't it? I think that was where I used to get really messed up with dating was that like I would be dating somebody because I saw potential in that relationship going somewhere and they would be dating me just because I seemed like a fun person to hang out with and I was like okay well could you could you define that for me because if that's all you want then I would like to know that so I'm not like so that I'm so that I can put the same energy into it you know and not be like oh yeah I'm so excited that I'm dating this person uh, and I really think it could go somewhere. <laughs> and they're like, not. <laughs> I don't know why I like symmetry so much. And other things. I love you. I love you too. Well, you can still do other things. Like if I had, if I had a guy who was like, Hey, like I really like hanging out with you. I don't see it going anywhere, but I'd really like I like hanging out with you and I really think you're hot and I want to fool around. I'd be like, oh, okay, cool. Down. <laughs> Let's go. But then as soon as you're like, oh yeah, I'm down for that, then in my experience, they're like, oh, peace. <laughs> Bye. I don't want no. <laughs> you mean you're down for a consensual sexy relationship with just just being friends oh mm, i don't know about that do they make a harm hallmark card for that you can make one you just make a special one just for that hey i think you're really hot and i still want to do you but i just kind of want to be friends i don't see it going anywhere <laughs> and it's just gonna be me saying it you open the card and it's just that sound bite of me saying that and they'll be like oh and hey, then, that, but then they get to choose, you know? What do you look for in a partner? Um, somebody who works on themselves, somebody who likes to learn things, somebody who's funny, uh, preferably like a similar sense of humor to mine, which is pretty stupid. Um, like a stupid sense of humor. Uh... What else do I look for in someone? I have like some preferences when it comes to looks, but that's not really something that like is a defining factor in what I look for in a person. You know, like there's things I enjoy that like I'd like a strong jawline, but like it doesn't have to be that. It's more of like what you, you know, it's how you vibe with people. I call my long-term one FWB, my for sure's. <laughs> I've done that before, friends with benefits. It lasted two years. I don't know why I can't seem to get one. They, they, they tell me that I'm a girlfriend girl and that they can't do that. I don't know why. Something about me is just screams girlfriend girl or something I'm not I'm that girl <laughs> this is fine just do that door they're like you're you're gonna you're gonna want a relationship I can't You said you were a fixer kind of girl. That's pretty girlfriendy. Yeah, I'm working on it. I'm working on it because I don't want to be that way with anybody, to be to be honest, right? I don't want to be that way with anybody because then you're just asking for problems. You can't fix anybody. People are just who they are. Um, which is why I want somebody who works on themselves and is genuinely like building a life that they love. Well, Joe's a girlfriend girl, but has guys wanting the FWB experience. So weird how people don't read vibes. 
I found it with a guy that I knew for a long time. Don't know if that had anything to do with it. I trusted him though. I feel like if you're friends first, it could turn into that because then like you can have a really honest conversation about being friends with benefits and it's like chill. This is like really laggy for some reason. I don't know, my sims have been really laggy. So update, my kids did not go to sleep and I'm dying. Also just seem to have a warm vibe. <laughs> Maybe they mistake that as ooey gooey girlfriend type. Oh yeah, cause I'm warm. That would make sense. I, I am a pretty warm person, so yeah, maybe that's part of the girlfriend vibe too. I'm, I will also 100% try to get you to talk about your feelings. I am that person. I will 100% start talking about your feelings. <laughs> so <laughs> maybe they're just like, oh, I forgot we're on a budget. <laughs> I, was just, I can't have that. I can't have that. Um, we gotta get a cheaper shower. No, we'll get the cheapest shower. So maybe they're like, oh my god, you're a girl who wants to talk about her feelings? No. You wanna try to, you wanna, you wanna, you, you. I'm basically like a therapist at this point. I probably should have gone into being a therapist. I just didn't want to. <laughs> Bruh. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. We'll have a cute little bath. We need a toilet. How does that make you feel, Chelsea, right? Right? But how does that make you feel? <laughs> so you cried after we had sex. How does that make you feel? bad why does it make you feel bad not manly oh I hope you're gonna be fine honey maybe it just stirred up some emotions for you mm. Mm. <laughs> so in fact they are the problem I don't want you to see me cry. Uh. I told my kids to bring their man arms. <laughs> their man arms. Hi, Giggles. Welcome in. Thank you for the lurk. Hi, Pip. How are you? I'm good. We're talking about um, dating, I guess. And I'm making a small house for to live in. It's like it's a tiny home. I'll open up really quick. I feel bad that I had someone that lived kind of far and I didn't tell her I got a car for like three months because I didn't want to drive. She drove. <gasps> Ooh. As the person who probably would have been the driver. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of messed up, but she probably would have kept driving anyway. Dating you, said, Yeah. Although I definitely would have been like, you have a car? Why are you coming over? <laughs> but hey, that just shows that like, how, was it because you didn't want to drive or was it because you didn't want to see them? That's the question. Okay, wait, stop buying decor. We have a limited budget. Okay, I gotta stop myself. I, I'm a decor person. Bitch, <laughs> why are you mad? Cause my pussy pops severely and yours don't. Huh? Cause you didn't want to drive? I have definitely done a lot of driving for 
for sexy times. It's it's just a thing, you know? It's fine. Yeah, like that, like that. Do your spin? Oh, yeah. You could get a dream house. I don't, I want to build this house, though. I'm nervous for your spin, Mojo. The last time we spun, we got Polly. I got a hotel a few times, so she didn't have to go home. Oh my god, how nice. How, how thoughtful. We love thoughtfulness. Hotel or motel, good point. Good point. <laughs> There is a difference. <laughs> a hotel, I'm in an ugly area. Momos aren't, aren't it. <laughs> yeah, because there's like some places where a motel could be fine, but it's usually not. It'll be like in Sex in the City when they start off at like really nice hotels and then end up in like a cheap motel by the end of their affair. It's like at first I just want you to know I really care about you, but at the end, let's just do it. There's a bed. Let's go. Doors straight to the parking lot aren't the best mood. <laughs> Why is this thing so laggy? Exit. Let me restart you. I prefer motel in a sketchy area because it just gives serial killer vibes. <laughs> just like, <laughs> is that what, so that's what you're looking for? That's what you want? You got her to play hooky once the day after I went to Disneyland for a day? That sounds like girlfriend behavior. <laughs> Perry's kink is mildly concerning. <laughs> I stayed one night in a motel outside Vegas and it was the shadiest place I've ever been. <laughs> I didn't even pull down the covers I laid on top. Oh my god, right? Is that how emo Jesus Nickelback came to be? Oh my god, no. Wow, they really want a trans awakening. I I just don't see that for what we're doing right now. It's a little early. Let's have some kids first. I don't think our main character is trans. We don't have kids. You can't take them. Our main character might be trans in another Let's Play. Identity crisis. Oh, we're gonna have a makeover. That's cute. That's fine. That works. She's an adult. She's an adult. That makes sense. All right, identity crisis. All right, hold on. Let me just finish this house really quick. I can do this. I can do this, I swear. I can do, I can do it. You, do you doubt me? Are you doubting me? In this house, with all these people here, in front of the guests. In front of guests, honey. Put it away. I was hoping for more money, yeah. What's horrifying? <laughs> I slept on my own towel on a crappy motel bed once. I shudder at the memory I get my shoes on because the carpet was crunchy. <laughs> Not crunchy. This is why I think that the internet has helped a lot because a lot of these places that are gross like that, now people know about it ahead of time and they just don't get the business at all. So they have to either close or they have to change. You know, it's helpful. I'm gonna put the fridge over here. My seven year old dead ass just looked at me and puked on my feet. <laughs> <coughs> oh my 
my god, that's crazy. <laughs> they get business. They get they get certain business. Yeah, they do. They do get certain business. What are these? Mm, I don't know. We're pretty broke. I'm going to have to get this one. Okay, let me get a bed too. Pop a bed in here. I don't think we're going to be able to afford a TV. Maybe we will. I've watched Star Trek for the generation in German before because I never want to be alone with my thoughts. That's wild. Kind of dark, but sex offenders live in them because it's not a residence, so they don't report. Oh, that's wild. I didn't know that. Oh, okay, I have to... Okay, we gotta go for a cheaper bed than that. Um, this one? No. Some of these could work. That kind of works. BRB? Okay. The heart shape bed from Sims 2 would be perfect here. I want it so bad. I don't know why they haven't given that to us. Just give me like a, a retro Sims pack with like a bunch of, with like the, the cage that you can dance in and the, the heart shaped bed and the heart shaped, wasn't there like a heart shaped jacuzzi or whatever their jacuzzi was? I want those things. I don't, I think, I think that they think that other people don't want that, but we do. We want it. Give it to us. It's what the people want. They're asking for it. Give the people what they want. Technically, have space. I mean, we have some space in here. I don't know if I like that. Maybe <coughs> it's like mint and and pink vibes and green. Hey, you could get the CC one. I know the CC heart bed. I've thought about it. I've thought about it for sure. Let me get this smear. I like the smear. Um, okay, hold on. Before I before I decorate, stop decorating. Um, can I move this over? Does that look weird? Does it look weird? Hold on, let me put a light here and see if it fills the space enough. Such a, no, it's kind of a weird light. On, it's on such a small house. I don't know. Just like a basic one. Unforgiving, it says. It's an unforgiving light. Speaking of doing it in a motel, have you seen those love hotels in Japan? No, I've seen like the regular, like the other hotels, the ones where you're like crammed in there. But I haven't seen, I've seen the capsule hotels. 
but I haven't seen the love hotels. I was wondering like, what if people are doing it in those hotels? I guess you don't, you go to a love hotel. They look so cool. I gotta look that up. They have a little bit more like, they'd be like, excuse you, you can't do that here. You can't hook up in this capsule. They also have these fancy smancy hotels that you rent by the hour. Oh, hmm. A little, a little rent by the hour. <gasps> these actually light up. Oh my god, string lights for the house. Welcome to our house. Here's our string lights. Maybe we should have, oh, I didn't even think about putting a little fence here. They should probably have a little fence here. Not that big, that's too big. Too large, thank you. Does that go? Often they're themed. My favorite is the one loosely based on Jurassic Park. <laughs> That's not what she said. <laughs> I want to do the cute rent the boyfriends there. They like take you out and pretend to love you, but they're really just a tour guide who so aren't lonely. <gasps> I want to rent a boyfriend. I want to rent a tour guide boyfriend. Japan has a lot of really interesting things. No. <laughs> the more I go up, the more expensive it is. Don't go there. No. That makes the most sense for what I'm doing. Other countries is still this idea. I would like yeah just have a my own little built-in tour guide this is my boyfriend he's also my tour guide he'll kick your ass don't even look at him i went to a maid cafe while i was there that was fun a maid cafe I get the nice bin. This one's nice. Okay, I'm not gonna do landscaping until I see if we have any money. Oh, I don't even have a sink in here. Oh shit. Hold on. I'm gonna hold on, I'll do the sink. Is that one of the love rooms? Okay, hold on. That's a very long link. It didn't even, <laughs> it doesn't know what's happening. The, the thing does not know what's happening at that link. <laughs> it's just like, no. The waitresses are dressed up as maids and will draw cute pictures on your food with sauce. Oh my God, that's adorable. This goes like, I'm on this, I know. Fixed it, okay. What is that? A slide bath? You can slide into the bath? Have you seen the cafes where they can print pictures on the drink foam? I think I've seen it. I have, well I've seen the, I've seen what they look like. That me click. It's a water slide in the room. Oh my god, I want to go. <laughs> and when are we going? Are we going together? Vacation, group vacation. Stream, va this is a stream vacation. 
I feel so bad destroying them with my tongue. <laughs> destroying the pictures. Just be like, this is so lovely. <laughs> Eat it. Japanese love hotel. Yeah, there was one with a water slide in it. I want to go there. I want to go there. That sounds fun. I like fun. Do you like fun? You know what? Fuck it. You're going in the middle. It messes up the borders, but I don't care. I don't care. Oh. Do I spend the extra money and get the fancy trash can that gives us money? We do have to get a job. So maybe I don't. Maybe I'll just get a generic trash can. Yes, do you think I should? Okay, I won't get it then yet. I want to get a couch first. Should I get a couch or a table? Technically, I could get a table. I could also probably fit. Mm, I could probably fit. I could go like this, get rid of that corner. Not what I meant to do. That ugly thing has saved my life. <laughs> It is ugly, isn't it? Um, do that and then get... Well, you may think, why not just go to any hotel? It's because love hotels not only allow you to stay for just a few hours, they also offer a saucier experience with things such as mirrored ceilings, jacuzzi tubs, and complimentary flavored condoms. We're going there. That's the one. That's, uh, that's the spot. That's the place. Where'd you go on your vacation? A love hotel. We got um, chicken and waffle flavored condoms. Can you do that right in front of the door? I don't know if you can. Maybe I'll do it like this. No, then where am I going to put a couch? Oh my god, I don't know how to feel. I can put that door there, which is weird. And then put this like that. It does give more space, though. Ketchup condoms? <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Be like these are egg flavored condoms. It is like eggs. <laughs> you want some gummy bear flavored condoms? Gummy bears? Let me get these ones. My friend's work makes THC ketchup. No way. Let your ketchup get you high. Wanna get high? My Mr. Tally impression never gets never gets much use. My South Park impressions never get much use. Maybe we should say maybe we should do a, a South Park game and then I could do all my impressions for you. It's way better. <laughs> Welcome to the hotel, woohoo. Would you like a complimentary sauerkraut flavored condom to go with your sausage? Sauerkraut. <laughs> Three milligrams per packet? My god. I love it here. <laughs> We're just talking about the most ridiculous shit. Yes. What kind, of, <laughs> what kind of condoms did you get? What, what were they flavored? Were they flavored condoms? What did they taste like? 
could fit this in here. Oh, you should probably get a library. We should probably get one of these. Do we, what does she see? What career are we picking for her? She's really, oh, she could pick, isn't that, wait, that's not a career. What could she have for C? Garlic is rated the number one strangest. Garlic condoms? They have bacon condoms? They have garlic condoms? <laughs> like what? Oh yes, try the garlic condoms. My goodness. Would you like some garlic condoms? I was distracted by condoms, that's fair. I think that's expected. I'm gonna maybe put a desk here. Oh, I could put a desk. Oh, I could put this over here. And then I could put a desk there. No, not that one. This one? No. This one? Mint condoms? Where would you want? <laughs> I would use those. You might not like those. I would use those. I like the I like the taste of mint. I have mint I have mint chocolate right next to me. Mint. I was locked up so hard. The 100 proof is no joke. Oh my god, you had 100 proof? What? That's nuts. <laughs> I feel like mint might have a burning effect. Yeah, I feel like that's true. I was actually thinking about that. <laughs> I was like, mm, it would have like a... It's not that bad. <laughs> It's a little, it would have, definitely have a cooling effect, that's for sure. Like if you use peppermint oil, it has a very cooling effect. Maybe a little spicy. Mm, no. Go for another chair. Sure, that one's fine. That's a luxury dining chair. That's not a dining chair. The vagina angulera is sensitive. <laughs> oh my god, when I was younger, my best friend and I used to call um they used to have party hotlines uh back in the day where you could like call and it would be a bunch of people on a phone and you'd be all like talking to each other and a lot of people would do it to like flirt with other people or whatever. And we'd go in and be like Hello, I'm Fartina Aguilera. And then we just play fart noises from a fart machine. You called those too? Yes. No condoms. Seeking of weird flavors. I had cactus ice cream once. Mmm. I would <laughs> fruit punch condoms. I would punk so hard. How could you not? Okay, we'll get a cheap computer. Oh my god, it takes up the whole thing. Um. You had a cactus smoothie? I've eaten cactus. It wasn't my favorite. But it, it's a it's a thing. Oh, I want this light. I like that light, it's cute. Please come clean the shit up on your break. Mom, can you not do that while I'm streaming? Thank you. On your break, I can't sleep. That's, he, no, I can't. Very rude, thank you. Am I gonna paint? I don't think I'm gonna paint. 
My mom's mad at my dog. They can eat there. That's not really nice. I don't know if I, I don't know if I like, I don't know what I like anymore. She's mad at Chewy, yeah, he's pooping places. She um, made me take out the the thing that you put in the, we have like a, we had a thing in the door that could make it so that he could have a door to go in and outside. And she was like, I don't feel safe with that in the door. You need to take it out. And I'm like, fine. And now she's mad that he's going to poop places. Well, let's, why don't you take him downstairs? <laughs> Sorry about it. I always clean it up, so. She's just, she just likes to find reasons to complain, you know. I had one of those, I loved it, right? I know that condoms exist in cherry, strawberry, banana, chocolate, vanilla, and pina colada. I've never had a flavored condom experience. Like, yeah, add on to the sliding glass door. Yeah, totally, that's what it was. Yeah, I think some people just like to complain because a lot of times I'll go talk to her about it and then she'll be like, and then once I actually like talk to her about it, she's like, oh, well, I had a shitty day. And I'm like, well, then don't take it out on me. Don't be rude. Don't be fucking rude. Are you kidding me? <laughs> just have like, I never even watched the Kardashian show. I thought about watching it just for like giggles. But I have so many of the, but I know so many of the things and I don't know how that works. <laughs> oh, this little thing. Oh, I'm sad you have to go, but you're always welcome back. You know, I'll be on for a while. Kardashian's a dirty pleasure of mine. <laughs> Maybe. Pop rocks? Oh my god. Did you ever use those candies that make your mouth sizzle for the deed? I've never done that. It, it, is that like a good thing? Does it like, is it like feel good? I feel like that would be debatable. I feel like I technically have room for a little table there, but it would also take up a lot of room. Oh, I could do one of these. What a weird house. <laughs> We have no TV. Oh, we should have music. They should be able to dance. Let my people dance. Um, okay, we're really running out of money now. These are $5. Yeah, we'll pay, we have neon signs. Decorating and neon signs, yeah. No, it was horrible, I went to the e ER and had to tell them what happened. Wait, what? I got them at Pride last year and it was like, this will be fun. The, the coffee table, this one, is high school pack. The wallpaper pattern with the door is off center and it hurts. This one? This? What do you mean it's off center? It's on center. It's on the thing. Like that one. Is it because it doesn't go to the top and it bugs you? Is that what it is? Do you need a door that goes all the way to the top? Will that make you feel better? 
And it hangs over the sides. No, what do you mean hangs over the sides? Meaning it doesn't line up straight like with this. Of course it doesn't. It's not the same size. That's the kind of stuff that doesn't actually bother me when I'm building. But I will change it for you if it bothers you. Ooh, what is this? Is this a llama? Llama. And rainbows. And clouds. I said I'll change it for you. Where are we going to put the clouds? Here, you guys can have clouds over there. And... Where's the little cactus ones? These ones. These will be... Here, we'll do that. And that. Now, I kind of liked them when they were more off. I like that. We'll just put more. The sun. I don't really like the sun one. Oh, the star one's cute though. A little star one. And I kind of want, I want plants. Hmm. That one doesn't look right. It's because it's because this corner is so dark. I mean, it's like some with the ads over there. This is cute. You like it? I'm trying. I'm trying to make something that's like fun. Like, this is their first house that they get to live in, you know? I feel like they would just kind of decorate it however, with whatever, whatever stuff they liked. It wouldn't be like a specific style or anything. It would just be like, what do you, what do you like? And then just throwing it all together. Yeah. They would have fun here, yeah. Where's that one hanging shelf for tiny living? The tiny living, tiny shelves are like one of my favorite things. Where is it? The kitchen one. I want the kitchen shelf. Oh, I don't have any, are these money? Are these money? They're $40? No, we don't have light switches. Everything's on a clapper. Everything in our house, clapper. We don't have light switches. Clap on, clap off the clapper, okay? Every single thing. I wonder how many people still have a clapper. They still make those, right? Pretty sure they do. I guess the modern clapper would just be like the ones on your iPhones. You made one? Is it under shelves? I didn't think it would be. Oh my god, it is. Okay. There you go. Or maybe on this wall. Yeah, I kind of like it like that. All right, we don't have a vent. That's, I guess, okay. Um, we don't have any curtains. That's probably fine. We don't have a lot of decorations, but it's functional. We have a computer. Uh, we have a place for them to eat, but it makes this not as functional, I don't think. The lights are on the Wi-Fi, yeah. They're modern. Did you, why'd you slap yourself? I don't think we're talking about the same thing. <laughs> what do you, I don't know. 
Just because TikTok doesn't let you go live until you're at 1K and I want to stream Sims to get a start on one of those platforms, but I just, I'm just going to come on here. TikTok is weird like that. All right, we have a shower, a bath, and a toilet. We're good. We have and a sink. We technically have two sinks. We don't have just a bathroom sink or just a kitchen sink. We have both. Can we afford... We have $500. We really shouldn't afford anything else. We don't even have the, the trash can. <laughs> we have an outdoor trash can and that's it. We can't, okay, we can't afford this. That's fair. That's fair. We're hand washing the dishes. Um. <laughs> you asked why her infants had makeup on? <laughs> some people, some people like the makeup. Thank you so much, Jacqueline. You're so sweet for, for lurking and being so active doing that. Thank you for that. You did roast me. So something get the robo trash can that gives you money. How much is it? It's like over a thousand. It's $1,200. sell a few things mm, well we have to get a job anyway so we'll we'll work towards that that'll be the next thing we purchase we don't have a roof hold on I need to do a roof and then we're good going to, going to addicted and it wasn't good for my mental health oh no Stop showing ads over here. Or at least stop playing the sound for them. Gross. Okay. I'm just gonna do it across the whole thing. This is, this is, oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's what we want. That's what we want. across the whole thing. Is solar roof texture good? I have great CC lashes. CC lashes, some of the skin textures I kind of want to try. I have been. I was going to look at Emma's. Emma has a bunch in their, um, in their stuff I was going to look at. I need to head to bed. I have a job interview tomorrow. Oh, congratulate. I hope that Sending you all the luck, all the love. I hope that it's a good job and that you get it if you like it. It's gonna be a disaster. Oh <laughs> my. Thank you so much, Mandy. I hope you sleep well. Thank you for being here. Sending you all the luck, all the luck and love. Ah! <laughs> Let's see. You're ugly. You are disgusting. I'm going to kill you. Give me $200. Give me $200. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. All right. This isn't costly, so let me get this. Ah, <laughs> oh, welcome in, everybody. Yes. You shout like that, they, they put you in jail right away. You're playing music too loud, right to jail, right away. You're driving too fast, jail. Slow, jail. You undercook fish, believe it or not, jail. You overcook chicken, also jail. Undercook, overcook. I stopped watching someone that posts their gameplay on YouTube because every male or female sim looked identical. Really? <laughs> That's wild. Looks like the Trixie Motel, thank you. We do have a very similar vibe. I love how a bunch of my friends have messaged me like, oh my God, we need to go to the Trixie Motel. <laughs> I was like, I agree. <laughs> we do. All right, I think this is good for now. Let's save it. Um, this is our first house. 
Okay, I'm gonna take a quick break and go to the bathroom. While I do so, I'll give you some, do you wanna watch uh, the OG BRBs, the Sims BRB that shows our 100 baby stuff, or the variety one? The OG one is like all of the oldest content. You want variety? Okay. I will BRB. Juno Birch and Trixie need to do a, ho a Trixie hotel collab. Well, Juno was just at Trixie's motel, so maybe they are. I don't know. They are, they are friends, though. Okay, I will be right back, and then we're going to jump into the gameplay. So, um, BRB. Okay, Zane, how dare you? <laughs> I am. <sighs> I'm losing it. Slowly. Cookies for Santa. Cookies for Santa. Santa. That's a pretty good Santa. Keep staring at the cookies. He looks Sandy disappointed with the cookies he looks left. Disappointed with the cookies. <laughs> Fuck these cookies. <laughs> I mean, I hate Santa. So. All right. That's so good. That's so good. <laughs> Why do my eyes every my eyes on all my animals and people tonight look like they're pissed? <laughs> he's just he's just looking down at these cookies like what the fuck? How dare they? <laughs> fuck these cookies. <laughs> Pickles, are you gonna fall? <laughs> what is happening? Oh, oh, right. I forgot. I forgot he's possessed. I forgot. It's fine. This is normal. Who? Who pranks the toilet again? Oh, there's a poop. Got a poop. Oh, here's another poop. This is the poop cult now. I like how they do it at the edges of the map, too. It's hilarious. Give blessing to Shrek. Yes, Shrek. Give, give blessings. Give blessings to Kitty. Good, good Kitty. Okay. Where's everyone else? Where's everyone else? Ashinova, you want blessing? Blessings. Blessings for Ashnova. Blessings. <laughs> Blessings to you. Blessings to you and yours. Alright, Kevin. Blessings, honey. Blessings. Yes, Kevin. Oh, yes, Kevin. Good job. Level up, Kevin. Alright, where is... Oh, more poops. Who did this one? Who did that poop? Okay. Where's Lemon? Grim doesn't know how to get through the maze. <laughs> Where is Jacob? Okay, he's over here. Okay, are we all in the maze? Joe? Get in the maze. Dr. Phil, get in the maze. You can't. I thought. I don't know what I thought. I don't know what I thought. <laughs> Must kill Sunjuan. Caleb died. Who is this? This guy? Dr. Phil. Oh my god, everyone's crying. And this random guy is on fire. Who's that? Levin's on fire. Levin's on fire. Lady Scott's on fire. Everyone's on fire. They're burning. They're burning. <laughs> Hi, welcome back. You're hungry? Oh my god, me too. I was just thinking how I wish I had more snacks. I don't have a lot of like healthy snacks that you can eat on stream and not have it sound like crunchy, you know? Crunchy. I don't really like that sound. You don't have food because you're moving? Oh no. 
it's it's time to do for a snack run. Who cares? Eat <laughs> ASMR of crunch. <laughs> Cause like I have like um, you know carrots, celery, and hummus, but I feel like it'd be weird to eat that on stream. I need to get more too. I'm running out. Tomorrow's grocery day. Okay, we're here. We're here. This is our house. Eat. Well, I did just have dinner, so I don't, I'm just complaining. I have, I'm gonna eat my my chocolate. I don't think I just don't think I had enough dinner. I think I needed more. You're gonna get wheat thins and cream cheese. Ooh. You wanna know what was surprisingly good? Although I haven't had it in a long time, so maybe I shouldn't recommend it. Share, yeah, share. <laughs> One time I remember me and my friends when we were in high school, we got drunk and we had like a bunch of Doritos and we dipped it in pesto. And for some reason it was so good. I was like, why is this good? All right. Babe, we have a house. Okay. So we have to get a job. Danny's gonna get a job. What's Danny gonna do? What's Danny gonna do in this job? What are you gonna do? Why am I feeling bitter? Shades of Schadenfreude? Why, who am I feeling bitter towards? Oh, wheel spins. Okay, hold on. Who do I feel bitter towards? Do I have pizza in here? Oh, I do have these. I can sell those. That's good for money. Oh, I have a bunch of roses. Oh, yes. Oh, shit. We can plant roses for money. Okay, we don't have a lot of spots. Let's let's put them in the sheltered area back here behind the house. We can plant a few. Go do some planting. Okay. Taking pleasure in another's <laughs> bit in another's pain. Okay. Avenue Q has a lot has a song about it. Okay. That's wild. Okay. What do we get? Oh yeah, we also have to give her a makeover. <laughs> we do love the outdoors. We do love the outdoors. Yeah, we love the outdoors. Oh. <laughs> so that'll just mean that she'll have to probably, <laughs> what a midlife crisis, make over in a mermaid. <laughs> you hate mermaids the least, that's true. Um. Oh, I can, I remember now that I can buy them. Reward store. Oh, we have a ton. Oh my God. We should vote on what kind of rewards we get. We have 8,000 points but it jacks up the family line it jacks up the family line it'll be fine i don't think that they'll definitely have mermaid babies but we'll we'll see breed out the mermaid challenge she'll be a good swimmer <laughs> um where is it there it is What kind of rewards should we get? We have a ton of them. We could probably, we could get a money tree. We have that many points. We have 8,000 points. We could get a fucking money tree if we wanted. Is, is it all seasons? Do you wanna get, should we get a money tree? You 
have an unhealthy obsession with Taco Bell. If they ever stop selling the Doritos Los Tacos, I will never have Taco Bell again. I hope that they know. I hope that they. I want to say that to you specifically, Taco Bell. Okay, uh, money tree. Yeah, they do have some some pretty cheap items. I don't know why more places have abandoned their like dollar menus and stuff. I used to really like Chipotle, but it's been really bland lately. Like every time I've gotten it, it's been really bland. Maybe I just need to go to a different place. Okay, um, is she like a career girl? We got let's figure out her career. We gotta we gotta join a job. Join a career. Oh, kisses. Join a career. Yeah, we gotta think about money now. We're living on our own, and while we have this cute little house, we need to pay for shit. Okay, we have to only get a job that starts with C, because her name is a C name. Oh, and she loves the outdoors. Okay, so we have civil designer, conservationalist, criminal, and critic. <laughs> Well, the conservationalist one goes with being a mermaid quite a bit. The one I got is two hours away, so I don't get it often. Yeah. Two hours away? Wow. Damn. Conservationalist? Yeah, that one works for her and the mermaid crap. <laughs> She's joining, she's, she's like, I want to be like my Uncle Braun and be a mermaid. I live in the boonies where the banjos play. <laughs> the real boonies. What, what kind of, okay, if you live in the boonies, then what are like, are all the places that are close to you more like small businesses that are family owned? Or are they like shittier um, chains? Or like, what kind of stuff do you have close to you? McDonald's? Hi! Grandma's mad at you. Grandma is mad at you. <laughs> it's interesting how they have a McDonald's everywhere, isn't it? It's mostly mom and pop places. The nearest Walmart's 40 minutes. Even my nearest Walmart is like 25, 30 minutes away. I don't know why. I distracted by Chewy. One, one heck of a life crisis. I'm a conservationalist now. Danny, what are you gonna do? Danny's gotta get a career too. She's planting. She's gotta eat her mermaid kelp in a minute. And then we'll do our makeover so that we can also do our mermaid makeover okay should he have a d career because he's a his name is danny danny devito or should we make him an actor an entertainer he is an entertainer after all you're within 20 minutes of six walmarts whoa a D. A dollar store, like dollar stores are just randomly popping up and I'm like, what? <laughs> that is wild. An educator. <laughs> All right, what do we have that are Ds? They have, we have detective and doctor. Are those the only Ds? Detective and doctor? I'm a doctor and a diver. If he wants to, if he wants to go with, he wants to go diving with his mermaid wife. Maybe he's a diver, or is he gonna pursue his acting career? He wants to, <laughs> he wants to be an actor. Diver, a snorkel guide. Grab your snorkel and get to work. They should live in fucking Sulani. <laughs> They just like to go to Solani. Should we do? Should we do diver? 
Between diver and educator. Put your... Or not educator. Between diver and entertainer. What do you think that Danny DeVito should do? Because technically he could be a comedian and go for more of like a C career. Or something like that. You like diver? 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 Okay. Diver seems to have... Diver seems to have the majority. Diver. They're living their own life. He's a diver. He wants to spend his time with his with his girl. His best girl. I guess they're not married yet. Danny, you want to pop that question? No, maybe we should make it more special. I See, I'm totally the person where, like... How special am I even going to... What do you mean you can't reach it? It's right there. What about this one? Don't fuck with me, ma'am. 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 Don't be ridiculous. Okay, plant this one. No, we're planting. We're planters now. Okay, plants. She's so cute. We'll have her do the mermaid thing. I forgot if it takes a while or not. I think it's instant. And then we're just gonna eat this. this it looks good. It looks tasty. It's pretty tasty. Are these all seasons? Hold on. Are you an all season plant? Normal. It's not for eating. <laughs> I would suck if they ate it. <laughs> yeah, plant that one too. Oh, you're already doing it. Great. Put it inside. They're where? <laughs> Don't you just eat the kelp? Yeah, you eat it. She's eating it. She gonna eat it. She gonna water these two. <gasps> Clover enjoys feeling the beach sand and the ocean breeze in her heart. Clover feels like a child of the ocean. I mean, fair. I didn't know we were gonna go this direction, but fair. <laughs> Clover is a fucking mermaid through and through, isn't she? That's hilarious. Oh, we gotta put our picture out. We need to put some one of our pictures out here. I want a nice little, cute little photo right here. I wanna frame it. I don't wanna sell it, I wanna frame it. Frame. Um, I don't know why I always pick white frames. I mean, in reality, I would pick black frames every time, but. This room's more white. Oh. Oh yeah. Imbo Bange. Yeah, Imbo Bange. What happened? She's having strange sensations. As thoughts of coral reefs and salt water fill Clover's mind, she has a sudden urge to enter a large body of water. Should she answer the call? I don't know, should she? Oh, she's hungry, okay. I don't know where the pizza was. We don't have pizza. We have to make food. Serve dinner. Oh God, serve mac and cheese. Ignore the call. Taco Bell has been ordered, nice. Take a bath. I said the sibling gave Birdie the pizza. Oh, okay, it was Birdie. Rude, I want pizza. Oh, we don't have any rugs either, oh my god. The rugs could really add to this place, I need rugs. Yeah, we need the pizza, not Birdie. Is he just, he's just playing games over there. <laughs> We're living our mermaid life. She's gonna take a bath after she eats. There you go. 
at least now we don't have like 50 million people in our house so this food will actually last for a couple days why don't you go sit over here here can you sit in this one I don't even know if you can at this point oh we can't well then why did I even put it there I could get rid of these all right, hold on. If this is useless and you can't even get to it, then hold on. Let me fix it. I'm pretty sure in real life it would be fine. <laughs> Maybe not comfortable, but it would be fine. All right, let's get rid of these. Sell. Ugh, of course you put the fucking chair in the inventory. Sell. Get rid of the chairs too. Clearly I can't use those. Okay. We get like a table, maybe? I guess we don't need a table. I mean, she could just sit on the couch or on a chair. But a little table would be cute. It's like a nice little two, two, two table. They don't really need to use this, so I'm not too mad about putting something in front of it. They don't need to like escape through the window. It doesn't really go with the table though. These go more with the table. really big though those chairs why does it feel like they're so big just kind of clunky it's fine what about now you want to sit here now how much money we got now oh we got some you want to sit down no, don't set the table. You don't need to set the table. Why don't you go sit, though? Are oh, you going to go sit on the bed? No, I think you should sit out here on the table that I just gave you. Wow, a table appeared. How weird. Pizza first. We need the pizza. There we go. Delicious. Yeah, it kind of opens up the space. All right, then why don't you take a bath? I think I'm gonna keep her blonde because she's still blonde. Married, Pregante. We're supposed to have three kids, so I guess we should get on that. I think um, maybe maybe Danny should take her to the beach and propose. You know. I never really do like special things when they get married or propose or whatever. We should do like a nice little proposal at the beach. Is this enough for you to be like, ooh, water, is that not enough water? Maybe we go to the beach. They'd be like, it's, a, it's, it's, it's midnight. They're like, it's midnight. I think we should go to the beach. What are your needs? You're feeling flirty over here? You're feeling quite flirty. Dreamy eyes from crushing on someone nearby. Oh my god. Feeling flirty. I think we should go to the beach. Oh wait, maybe we should do the makeover first. We'll do the makeover first, then we'll go to the beach. Then we'll go. Because then when we'll take pictures, it'll be in her makeover, out her, her new look. All right, she's gonna be a makeover. I think she's gonna have long hair. Being a mermaid in Strangerville will be tough. It won't, it'll be fine. 
She'll just need to, um, she'll need to take more showers or drink more. She'll just have more of like a water need. Okay, let's do our makeover. I'm gonna assume she's still into like, she's pretty into pastels. So I think we'll dress her in pastels mostly. We'll see what kind of mermaid look we can get with that. Change them. I love Strangerville, but the damn mother kills me. Wait, like literally kills you? Or you just like think it's funny or something? <laughs> I've defeated her like twice, I think. It's a pretty funny storyline. Stranger Bell. It'd be better. We we should do the Strangerville storyline when we get to M, and then we can do military. Though the possessives get me every time. Oh, they're so funny. Yeah, they're so funny. Conservationalist? Mermaid. <laughs> Um, boom in a box. Why are we so laggy? Is it because I'm. Ugh, I really think that once I put this upgrade on my computer, it's going to help so much. Okay. Uh, that's all fine. I'm fine with that. Do you, have a, do you have a walk style? No. All right, well, let's give you the makeover first and then we'll talk about that stuff. Okay. So first, let's pick a new hair. Although you're not a mermaid yet, so we couldn't do your mermaid look yet. Oh my god, no, that looks weird on you. Um, I am thinking, though, of doing more, like, longer hair. Here, go back. Let's see your, hair, your, your regular hair. So she has like straight blonde hair. So it's just like a longer version of that. I feel like mermaids need flowy hair, yeah. Although when we were doing our makeup look, I was like, would mermaids have eyebrows? And I decided we decided no. <laughs> That for speed and ocean dwelling, they probably would not have eyebrows. Let me see. There's going to be one. Not that one. Here's the mermaid hairs. I'll probably give her that when she's in her mermaid form. Yeah, that's true. Probably not hair either. Probably. That's why the hair is so luxurious. It's wigs. <laughs> Mermaid hair wigs confirmed. Maybe we'll do the feather hair. It's like a longer straight version. You like the feather hair? Let me just see really quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we could do feather hair and then we could do like, for her workout hair, could be like this hair. Cause she put her hair up. Huh. And then sleep hair could be uh, another one where your hair's up. You don't have bangs. Where's updo's updo? What's 
this one. Yeah. Like that. She's really likes, she really likes having pieces in the front. Ah. Um, and then in cold weather. Oh, that's cute. It's one of your favorite hairs is a longer one with uh, like the one she had with the bangs in braids too. we had more hair in this game but the newer hairs that they've given us are, are a lot nicer hmm. and that's been very helpful because I really wish they would revamp some of the older ones to not look so like clunky download CC I know it's just it's like a rabbit hole of like new shit <laughs> that I'd have to learn I did it when I was doing the um, the drag stuff. So I still have all of that CC in a folder somewhere. Okay. Um, so we do, we're a conservationalist. Uh -huh. Maybe we're more like into flowers. Uh -huh. Maybe we're more into pastels. Maybe, I wish I could just put pastels as a category. Flower power. I just want pastels. Cause I don't, I want them to be like any color, but I want it to be pastel. Bruh. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Um, like, you know what I mean? Sporty, special, special birthday? Oh, for the, like the birthday anniversary. It's like what? I have too many choices here. Ooh, how about that? Ooh, or this? We don't really use this. Oh my god, look at her waist! It's so small. Oh my gosh, that's wild. Her waist is tiny. It's snatched, man. It is snatched. I feel like she'd show a ton of skin. But I don't know. Maybe not because the sun would dry her out. Hmm. Right? Yeah. Talk about an hourglass. I know. It also kind of has to go. I feel like she's okay. She's a conservationalist. So I feel like her wardrobe is going to be a mix of. Um eco lifestyle, island living, high school years. We'll put growing together in there for fun. And, um, and kits. Okay, that just narrows it down a little bit <laughs> for me. Because otherwise there's just too many things to choose from. Okay. Because she could easily just wear like this stuff because she's a mermaid now. Or she's going to be once we go to the beach. I think that's how it works. <laughs> Is that how it works? How do you become a mermaid? You go to the beach? That's actually really cute on her. Does this come in pastels? <gasps> Comes in purple. She looks like a whole different person. She looks like a totally different person. It's wild how hair changes what you look like. Okay, now I want to narrow it down. I can say I've never had a mermaid sim. Really? This one, this one, this one, this one. Right, and uh -huh. kit. 
I truly believe eyebrows and hair just make a person. They do, 100%. Hmm. You, you look like a totally different person depending on your eyebrows and your hair. And I think a lot of people don't realize how different they can look. Ah. Oh. The amount of times I've put people in like different makeup and hair and wardrobe for photo shoots and they were like, who am I? <laughs> this doesn't look like me. And I'm like, yeah, it does. It just looks like you with different hair and makeup and stuff. Let's see. I have no idea what, I have no idea. Maybe a skirt? What goes with this top? It's an island living top. I kind of want pants. What are these shorts? Those are too long. I'm not wearing shorts that long. The new quilt, quilted pant shorts. Quilt, some quilted shorts. Ah. Denim. Is this denim? <gasps> Denim's cute with it. Pink. Purple. No, maybe just like the denim color. Gray. Green? No. Uh. I don't know. I'm supposed to be good at fashion. You may want to have her change uh. into a mermaid before completing cast. She will have more looks after she changes. No, I know. She has a... Uh, that'll be the whole mermaid look we haven't done yet. But I wanted to change kind of her general style first before we go propose and take pictures. So then we'll have the pictures look like the new one, look like her new look. I love these pants. It doesn't go with that shirt though. There you go. <laughs> that kind of works. Kind of. The, the shades are a little off. I love these shoes. Um, no, I want wedges. These shoes remind me of 2010. I love these laundry day shoes. I feel like I use them a lot. Your Etsy is gorgeous. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you for checking it out. I appreciate it. I kind of want to ah. keep some of her old looks. That one's cute. I think we'll keep those. No, I don't. Maybe we'll change this one. She doesn't need two outfits like that. We'll give her more like of a comfy outfit that she like goes out in ah. for like to work in, like for her conservationalist work. She needs to be, she needs to be functional. She needs to be able to move around. Ooh, what are those? I know that that has matching pants, but what does this look like with it? Oh my god, that's so cute. Shut up. With, um... Sneakers. Is that... That's not purple, is it? I'm going with the white ones. She's working out, you know? Not really. She's not working out. She's working. She's doing. She has stuff to do. We don't need this though. It kind of looks weird with the shorts. There we go. With just some regular socks. Keep the socks. There you go. It's just for when she's she's got stuff uh -huh. to do. I don't know if I like this outfit or not. Do I? Ooh. Is there a better top with the skirt? I 
It's funny how certain clothes just make you think of certain types of people. You know, it's just um, like I'll, like I'll see like I just saw a top in here that reminded me of like, um, you know, kind of the more like bohemian mom. Like it just like it gives off bohemian mom looks. <laughs> Or like some of these like feel like a business, like business casual, very chic business casual. Ooh, this one. Ooh, it's not in purple though, but the pink's cute. skirt kind of gives me schoolgirl vibes. I know it's kind of what she was before though. So it kind of goes with, um, it's kind of like a good transition from like before. Maybe more like that. So it's a little more neutral, a little more nooch. And then that's when she's she's out doing some work and then here's when just like some more chill going to the store just gotta go to the store um formal that's still cute i don't really think we've even used these yeah those are fine athletic gray i don't know about the gray at least let's do a little bit more colorful well, so it's gonna be a little more fun than that. That's just a little boring. I like how I just always pick pink. Just a very predictable person. Oh, is there is the but does it come in pink? How about pink? Green's cute. I've been liking green a lot lately too. Green's cute. Hmm. But does it come in pink? We'll just leave that. All right, um, sleepwear. Okay, we're changing this. Aww. She's 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 in a new era. This is a new era. We're bringing sexy back. We're going for. You're new ugly. Vibes. You are disgusting. I'm gonna kill you. Give me two hundred dollars. Give me two hundred dollars. Give me two hundred. Wow. Va va boom. Oh my God, look at her back. Look at that arch. That's, ugh. Oh my God. <laughs> Hello, hottie. All right, no, no shoes with this outfit. You don't need shoes with that outfit. What's your second outfit? Yeah, that's chill, that, that makes sense. Just chilling at home with with the hubs, and then come here, baby. You know. All right, and then party wear. Uh, I don't mind it, but I kind of wish your hair was different. I know I made made Bev extreme, but the genetics have been gorgeous. Oh yeah. No, I think it was worth it. Fully worth it. What about this for your hair? For party? Does it look weird? See, I really like this hairstyle. It's just, I feel like it should have some front pieces or something with it. It feels a little, something about it feels weird. What about this? Yeah. You think it's fun for party? Yeah, we might go with that. That one has too dark of low lights in it that's too dark of low lights needs bangs it, at least something it needs like a couple of hair pieces like you know just like some strands like this in the front with it with like the make it a little more 90s looking They rarely touch the party outfits. Well, I mean, they rarely go to parties. 
I kind of like, I like the regular kind of space bones because of the bangs. Oh yeah. That works. Cute. I don't know how often you're going to be in the water with a swimsuit though, because you're going to be a mermaid. Oh. That one's still cute. And that one's still cute. Christian, Christian autumn vibes. <laughs> We're just going to keep it. All right. I think she's good. She's good to go. She's had a makeover. Her hair has grown out. She's learning her style. We're going to have a midnight proposal at the beach. She doesn't know though. Don't tell her. Shh. Don't tell her. It's a surprise. Leave, leave a lerve. <laughs> Somebody has got to get a sign that says that. Instead of live, laugh, love. Leave, leave a lerve. Yeah, it's a secret. Shh. We're not telling her. <gasps> Hi, Toxic, how are you? I'm glad you love it here. We're not telling her she's gonna get proposed to. Don't tell her. Don't tell her. It's gonna be a secret. I'm gonna have to start, um, making more of our sims i'm gonna in in future um letters of our generation i'm gonna have to make more sims that have completely different aesthetics because a lot of times i just give them my aesthetic and i'm like we need to try other aesthetics <laughs> watch her deny the proposal oh my god that would be wild Taking screenshots of a few messages that were from friends I used to be so close to. You forgot entirely about nicknames they had called me. Whoa, wild. One of them called you Bathany, like Bay. <laughs> I have like fifty thousand pictures <laughs> on my phone. Oh, they're so cute. Let's go to the beach. They're both feeling romantic. It's the middle of the night. They just moved into their new home. And Danny's like, I really think it's time. We just got out of high school. I don't know if our parents are going to be supportive, but we're no, not there, not there, not there. Go there. This one, the romance, cozy little loves. So cozy. Don't go to Bron. I don't know what Bron's doing. Bron's child just grew up hella fast. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> Lemon wants to name a character. Lemon, do you want to name? Can I name the first baby? Well, there's there is actually a line. <laughs> there's a line already. But I'm putting you in, I'm putting you in line. There's a line. <laughs> oh, I have different, I have, I have a different, this, so this pad is under babies and this pad is screaming, crying, throwing up. <laughs> Who is that first? You are disco. You can give it to Lemon if you want to. This is Hunter Baby. This is. A, this is alphabet. <laughs> okay, we are going to the beach. Let's go to this beach. Should we go to that beach? Which one's cuter? I was thinking of going to this one. But this one might be ro more romantic. Let's go to this one. It's more... It's more... I don't know. I love that we're compatible. Look at my whole family. <laughs> Look at the cat. Okay, let's go. I'll give mine to Lemon. I don't know where I'm at on the list, but I don't trust myself. 
You're on the 100 baby list. You're the next step on the 100 baby list. Um, on the 100 baby side, we're having, um, we're currently pregnant with um, Leonardo DiCaprio's babies. And um, one of them has to have a cursed name. And the two naming, the two babies that we're having with Leo are Barry and Disco. So between Barry and Disco, you can figure out um, there's a girl and a boy. You want to name the girl? Okay. Are you giving it a curse name or a not curse name? Because <laughs> one of the names has to be cursed. No, Barry has to name Leo's son. You're going to go with Frank. But no. <laughs> I mean, Frank is not really cursed. Wasn't the Snoot Baby the cursed name? We got it again. We got it twice. Yeah. You want Lemon to choose the name? Yeah, we got two cursed baby names in a row. I'm confusion. I think that Barry was going to offer you to name one of Leo's babies. Is that what I'm getting from the chat? Okay, pause. Who the fuck is Leo? Leonardo DiCaprio. So at the end of our Let's Play last uh, on Tuesday, Lemon... We, um, we had Snoop Dogg's babies, and then we got pregnant with Leonardo DiCaprio's babies on the 100 Baby Challenge. Where is Leo? He's in the 100 Baby world. We're in alphabet world right now. What do you mean by cursed name? It just has to be... You're talking about the alphabet challenge. I know. I'm just telling you, because Barry, Barry has... A name redeemed for the 100 baby world and they were offering it to you but you can fight with disco and tell disco that you <laughs> want to name a baby that the, the the alphabet world has disco and then esme and then esme and then disco disco lemon disco and esme were fighting with each other although i haven't seen esme in a while so if esme doesn't show up then it's Disco and Lemon. I'm too high for this. <laughs> well, I think that Disco wants to collab with you on the first babies. We're, we're going to have, we're supposed to have three babies for the Alphabet Legacy for her. That's what we rolled for. We did a spin and she's supposed to have three babies. So there's going to be three babies to name. And if Esme doesn't show up, then they're all going to be named by Disco. So, <laughs> so I'm going to have you go in. I'm sure that Disco would not mind giving up control of at least one of those babies for you. Okay. Oh my God. Look, look at this nice place that we are at. It's new school day. Cool. Does that make, does that make some sense though? I'm sorry. I don't want to confuse you more because I know how it can be when you're high. <laughs> it can be really bad. Okay, Danny, I think you should go light this fire. Please don't catch on fire, but light the fire, please. And then she's going to go. He's going to light this fire. I just wanted to name a DeVito baby. Well, now you get to. You're going to. On rum I mean, catch on fire, too. <laughs> I want to change the color of the fire. Change the fire color to pink. They just have to have be D names, and we don't know if we're having boys or girls. <laughs> Danathan. <laughs> Danathan. Danathan, please. 
Are you gonna go swimming with me? Oh, a nice pink fire. Are we swimming together? We're gonna go swimming. Danithy? <gasps> I have, I have changed. I am a mermaid. Dan, can you propose to me in the water? Oh my God, can you? <gasps> Call over dolphin, what? No, you know what, skill day, go away. We're done with you. We've both done you, okay? We're fine. Where are you going? Uh oh, what is it? Is it between Danathy and Dan Danathy and Danathan? <laughs> Which is Danathan? Danathy? Danathan? Danathan? Danathy? 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 Danathan? I can't decide, honestly. Like, there's a lot. They're both pretty good. Danathan. Dan Dan Danthony. Danthony? Danthony. What about Danthony? Just switch. Just switch it. You're too cursed. I don't want to touch it. Lemon, you're too high to make a poll. <laughs> I like that. Danthony. 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 Danthony is excellent. <laughs> Danth Danthony is a little is a little clunky, but Danthony. Danthony DeVito. Yeah. Imagine. <laughs> Imagine moaning that, like. <laughs> I was gonna try, but I feel way too weird doing it. <laughs> oh my god, ew, David! <laughs> you shout like that, they, they put you in jail. Right away. You're playing music too loud, right to jail. Right away. You're driving too fast, jail. jail. Slow, jail. jail. You undercook fish, believe it or not, jail. You overcook chicken, <coughs> also jail. Undercook, overcook. <laughs> I always feel so weird doing it. A lot of people do it, especially in the gay community, as like a joke. But I feel so weird doing it. Please disregard the poll. It's Danthony. <laughs> we have settled this. Danthony, gosh, Danthony. <laughs> oh, Danthony. <laughs> that's not. That's not it. That's probably the closest I can get without just like freaking out. <laughs> you like fitness, sure. <laughs> oh, we're both out there. Who's this? Get out, get out of here. It's your hairy back. <laughs> Cherry. <laughs> Cherry like Danathan. Someone take the mic from Lemon. <laughs> Pull you lie. Okay. Can you just can we talk? Can we chat? Jokes on you, I don't use a knife. <laughs> can I propose to you in the water? Kiss in water, absolutely. Romance, can I? What would, would it be under affection? Would it be under flirtation? I don't think it's physical intimacy. Why isn't it? Can, we, can, I, not, can I not do it in the water? Not it, but proposed, you know what I mean. No kiss in the water. Where do you think you're going, sir? 
Yeah, go back out here. Kiss your mermaid girlfriend. Oh my god, how cute is that? Oh my god, her boobs are huge. Yeah, I think we'll have to go on land. Alright, that's fine. Ew, Braun is here. Braun, go home. Leave me alone, Braun. Okay, we're gonna go over here. No, you can't cook right now. Cooking is, cooking is not for us right now. Get that lady out of here. Go here together. Is there a hole in her fin flaps? How would this work? I have no clue. They're coming over. Red is not her color. We'll change it. Okay, she's coming over. Propose. Babe, I love you so much. Will you marry me? Yes, babe. Work, babe. So, so cool. ah. <laughs> take photo with. Let's take a selfie. Let me take a selfie. We're, we're engaged. Still here just lurking. Thank you for the lurk. The way she looked at it. <laughs> if Braun is in our photo, oh my god. Is he gonna be in our photo? Take the photo. It's glitching. So cute wedding time. <gasps> I need to put a wedding venue in the, in Solani. I've made them before. Or I made like wedding places, but I would have to just turn it into a venue. I've made a lot of beach wedding places. Oh my god. Oh, there's a pregnant lady in the background. <laughs> it looks like she's giving birth. She's like, whoo. Just ignore, no, ignore her. She's not there. There we go, there's one. By the way, anybody can clip. I appreciate disco is always on top of it, but if anybody does find things that they like, that they think is funny or something, you can always do exclamation point clip in the chat and it will clip it for you. Why isn't your sound alert playing? What one? What one was it? It doesn't say that Eddie was redeemed. I thought it was only mods who could. I never knew that. Yeah. <laughs> Dory is just high too. <laughs> Did it not go through? Did like the did it have like a countdown and then it just didn't play? Cause it'll do like the little countdown. No, don't get the pregnant lady in it. There we go. Get his little hairy chest in there. No, no sads. No, no sads. No, 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 no sads. Sillies? Kind of. I mean, their silly faces are kind of weird, though. Yay! We're engaged! You're sure? His nipple is tiny. <laughs> yeah, clearly you don't. Clearly you don't want more any more Nubu. You can hear her, not the tiny nipple. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, wait, he's gonna make food. What are you doing? What's going on over here? What's going on with you? Fuck my pussy with a rake, mom. That one played. That one played immediately. Fuck my pussy with a rake, mom. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> that one played and it played immediately. Okay. I don't know why the other one didn't play. <laughs> kinship. You live in the you live in kinship? Dante Roca? Ooh, she gonna pop. She about to pop. I've never heard that one. That's from Trix that's from uh, uh with Trixie and Katia. It's a classic Katia clip. She's dressed as an evil witch. It's a Halloween episode, I think. I'm unhinged. Do you want me to show it to you? Oh, we definitely been talking about boobs. I can't believe how often we talk about boobs on this channel. It is, are you okay, dude? You look not good. You look not happy. You look really pissed. I wish I could do something to disable back hair and chest hair on my on the girls in my save because just that's just weird i mean i guess there are women who have but i just i don't think so she looks very tan I'm just out here getting tan Pregnancy can make some women grow body hair. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. And I know that there are some people just in general that grow m more hair than others, but I don't have, I don't think I've ever seen it like that, but maybe. Yeah. What are you making? A pot of franks and beans. Well, that's nice. We don't really have a lot of money though, honey. Just tossing around franks and beans like this. You got a stash. I have to wax and shave now. That's yeah. I think I think that's normal. I think a lot of people have at least something like that. All right, you gotta put this in your in your inventory though. We're not just giving it away. You already won bingo. Congratulations. Where am I? Oh, am I swimming? I'm swimming. All right, I think we gotta do your, um, I think we gotta give her a makeover. I'm also gonna save it, because we just got engaged. Who does Mojo hate? Oh, Ryan Reynolds. We're talking about Ryan Reynolds? I like Ryan Reynolds. I'm a fan. There you go. <laughs> In fact, I was just thinking about Blake Lively because I was looking at the Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants and I'm thinking maybe I should watch this. Maybe, should I? And she's married to Ryan Reynolds. We could call over a dolphin. We could sleep, we could sunbathe. See, being a mermaid is like, cool. Call over a dolphin. I wanna make a dolphin friend before we go. Can we, can we make dolphin friends? Oh great, we have bills. Oh, okay, we can afford them. Mara! Hi, little babe! You're too close to the water. Oh, the sun? Yeah. Yeah, splashy. <gasps> Feed the dolphin. Oh my goodness. Where'd you go? Did, why did you? Why did you go? Call the dolphin again. You call, you get that dolphin over here. A rainstorm. I can call a thunderstorm. And I can change the weather. Dolphins are kind of sexual. Pred How dare you? I, I've heard those stories. I know, but I love dolphins. My mom's like best, the best moment of my mom's life, other than like the, you know, the ones that everyone has, like your child being birthed and whatever, um, was she was in Hawaii and she was in the water and a bunch of 
dolphin showed up and she got to swim with dolphins. I just thought, like, ugh, how cool would that be? Do they actually have like a humping addiction? I don't. I don't. Maybe it depends on like the time of the year or like the the conditions. I don't know. She uh, she didn't ex experience anything like that. I think you can also hunt down a unicorn, right? Wait, you can what? <laughs> Make baby in waterfall, please. Oh my god. Uh, we were just gonna go home, but yeah, that's a good idea. We'll come back. Don't go. Well, we'd have to go to a different part of the island anyway. We'd have to go to, there's a different part of the island where the waterfall is. Which part has it? The one where Braun, by, by where Braun lives. We're currently on the, um, in the third part. Yeah. We gotta go over here. We'll go to, we'll go visit Braun. Danthonia? Mmm. Danthonia. Bring Danny. We're going to the, we're going to go. I was going to say Danastasia. Dantasia. Dantasia, like Fantasia, but it's Dantasia. This is poor child. Danastasia. Dennis Sage is pretty good. Mm. Disco could never say anything bad about EJN again. Emo Jesus Nickelback is offended that you even thought bad things about him. How dare you. <laughs> the reason they won't let pregnant women swim with dolphins is because the echoing of the second heartbeat startles them and they become intensely curious about the sound and they will become aggressive. That's fascinating. Oh no, the nickname will die. <laughs> I think the nickname is hilarious. <laughs> that's wild though. That's like, it's wild. I could see why though. Because even, like, if, if, you know, dogs and cats and all of them can detect when you're pregnant, I'm not surprised. And they would be like, what the fuck is in there? What you got in there? Let me at it. That would be so cool, though. That's one thing I kind of look forward to if I if I were to have a kid is to like, just see how my, my animals would react to it. Hey, Bron. Um, still, I see you still live in a little shack on that island. So that's really cool. Good for you. We're going to go to the waterfall. We're going to go try for a baby in the waterfall. What does she need to do for her job? Research com cons conservation. Okay. It always freaked me out because they told me you couldn't get in a hot tub when you were pregnant because it slowly boils the kid. And I was just like, what? There's some wild shit that you can't do while you're pregnant. I have work in an hour? Uh-oh. I'm gonna take the day off. I, I'm, I'll start tomorrow. I can't do it today. I, I just got engaged and I'm about to get impregnated. Why are we talking? Oh. I'm so sorry, I can't do that. Okay, fine, let's go, hold on. Let's knock on his door. Let's go to the bathroom together. She can be a stripper as a job as stripper wife. I love that. I love, I love a stripper. 
Okay, can they go, can they go to the bathroom in the water? I don't remember. Hi Emma, welcome in. How are you? We're having very weird conversations. Um, I just learned that you, when you're pregnant, can't go in a hot tub because then you'll be boiling the baby. And that dolphins can tell that you have a baby. And so you're not supposed to go around dolphins when you're pregnant. Because they'll get way too curious about your baby and try to get it. Or something like that. Pregnant people. <laughs> Pregnant people putting kids in hot tubs, the insanity. Okay, we're trying to, where am I, where am I? Why am I out here? Where am I doing? Oh, we're here. Where's Danny? Oh good, we're doing it. Good, let's do it. Try for baby. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's what we're talking, that's it. That's the stuff. Waterfall baby, waterfall baby. God damn it, I can't believe you guys are making me have a baby again this fast. This I feel like The Sims is just baby simulation at this point. Oh, you know what we should, oh no, I can't do that, damn it. <laughs> they have to have at least one baby for us to continue the legacy. I was like, damn it, can I just have one with where we have no baby? But no, we can't, because it's not a legacy. Congrats on your birthday. Thanks. That was a while ago. I've gotten engaged and maybe pregnant by then. Rebo. Let me see. Let me see if you're pregnant. Oh, wheel spin? Okay. Wait, did we get a wheel spin? Or is Lemon just chanting for that? Oh, we already did it for a number of babies. We have to have three. We have to have three lemon, three babies. Yeah, I was like, is lemon just trying to get free wheel spins? We have to have three babies. <gasps> I didn't get pregnant. Excuse me. You wanna do it again? Three, three babbies. Yeah, three babbies. Let's go. I know you need to pee. I need to pee too. And that's why we're going to go, you know, I don't need free. <laughs> D'Anthony, D'Anastasia. <laughs> She's like, fuck it. I'll redeem it. <laughs> we got a wheel spin. Dan, Dan Lexander. <laughs> Did we, did we do it? This tur this quickly turned into a mermaid let's play, by the way. I'm still not pregnant. Can I pee in here? <laughs> shower nude, I can shower nude. Why can't I pee? Why can't I just try for a baby? Try again, just keep going. You're not trying to see. Oh no. Unsatisfied from mediocre woohooing. Danny, get it together. Also, you might be stinky, but you are in a waterfall. So, like, how bad could it be? She's like, I really have to go, and you are stinky, but let's do it. Let's do it. Oh no, there's a conservationist person here getting frogs. Leave. We're trying to woohoo. Get out of here. This is so, this is a woohoo place. Try for baby. Peeping Tom. Science baby? You could adopt a kid for one. I I did I was thinking about that. It is on the um the plot twist. Oh I'm gonna <laughs> she's gonna pee herself immediately. Okay, let's spin. Let's see what we get. Look at all the froggies. Just woohoo amongst the froggies. We don't have an ex. We've only been with Danny. Yeah. Does that mean we have to spin again? 
It might. <laughs> it's going. It's being slow, but it's going. The speed. The wheel already made us a mermaid today. Uh, and it made our our sister polyamorous. Oh. Okay, one of our family members is a sex worker. Honestly, it happens all the time. I feel like many of them are. Um, maybe, oh, Chanel. Chanel would be a sex worker for sure. Cassidy too also tracks, honestly, either of them because Chanel is an actress. So maybe she's getting her, maybe she's been, you know, spending a lot of time. Yeah, good, go shower in, yeah, shower here. Yes, shower, perfect. Um, so it could be Cassidy, who is in a polyamorous relationship and is trans, or it could be Chanel, who's trying to be an actress and trying to work her way up the acting thing. And so maybe she's getting into some smaller budget movies. You know what I mean? To be honest, couldn't you pee in the waterfall? That's what I'm saying. I think it's stupid. Is she pregnant now? We'll find out. They're both showering naked. It's so cute. Catch frogs. Yeah, we love catching frogs. We're frog people. Uh, are we pregnant? Did we finally get it done? No. <laughs> Why? How? I, I forgot how easy it was. Waterfall escapades. Yeah. All right, let's go again. Try for baby again. Come on, let's go. We showered, we peed. It was a little embarrassing, but let's let's hook up, let's go. We peed next to each other, we showered naked next to each other. We can do this, we've been through it all. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm doing that now, okay. Okay. All right, making little dolphin sounds, it's fun. Sad My boy. kids have reverted themselves back, like tell me how they always go back to the schedule. They woke up at 5 a.m. this morning, oh my God. It's just their mating call. <laughs> if somebody asks me if I'm a mermaid, I'm gonna be so offended. How dare you call me that? Oh, oh, that's good. That was nice. She's like, thanks, babe. Did it work now? What is going on? Are we gonna have to have a science baby? Uh, fourth time? I don't know. Maybe we'll come back. Can you hook up in the cave? I don't think you can, but I just wanna look. No, you can take a photo. Okay. Danny, put your back into it and stop faking. <laughs> oh no. Why am I going there? Here, let's go home. Sometimes your sim can get PCOS with it and cause infertility. Do you have slice of life? And we don't have slice of life on, but we do have wonderful whims, which might be doing it. Maybe he's wearing condoms every time, even though I'm at trying for babies specifically, and I didn't I didn't see anything that said condoms. Maybe here for he performs better on dry land, maybe. Yeah, let's go home. 
Maybe he's getting caught in her fin. <laughs> I feel like if they're trying for baby, then he shouldn't be using them though, but maybe. I mean, they are in water after all. Yeah. Maybe it's just not, it's just not happening for them. I don't know. We have, I don't think it, this is the case. Um, but we have met Sims who can't, who, who have the ability to not get pregnant. Science baby. Maybe. I think we'll try it home. I think I'll get their needs up and then we'll try it home and see how it goes. And then from and then we'll go from there. She should be able to get preggy there. Or maybe he cut his sperm baby. <laughs> maybe. Maybe he's like, mm, I'm not quite ready. You can peek in full cast, that's true. I'll do that. I don't see why it would have made them not be able to have a baby, though. You know, like, I don't see why it would have made one of them not be able to. Okay, you guys are really sleepy. Let's do... Cast dot full edit mode. And change sim. Sci-fi 2 babies. <laughs> yeah. Some nice sci-fi to babbies. Sorry, I apologize. Babbies. Babbies always. Honey, do you still smell? He's just not taking care of, he needs to take care of himself. I understand. We went to get engaged at the ocean and now we kind of smell, okay? That's what showers are for. We'll be fine. One of my not so berries were that I got lucky into the fertility treatments and she had one, which is all I needed. Wow. Okay. So I can't go to bed quite yet. There was a fire in my brother's apartment building. They're okay, but they might not be allowed back in their apartment. Might have to go get them over here. Whoa. I'm glad they're okay. That's scary. How bad was it? I like that I keep going back and forth because I have chat in like two places. <laughs> like what, what, what? I don't know, so I know that everybody has, I have one monitor, and I know that a bunch of people have two monitors, so they can have one or three monitors. I feel like I would be all over the place if I had three monitors. Not such a big yeah, I'm happy they're safe too. Yeah, that's super scary. can get others pregnant. Okay, so he's not the problem. It was two floors up. They got themselves and all their pets out right before the sprinklers went off. Oh, the sprinklers went off. That's, ugh. So a bunch of their stuff becomes pregnant. Okay, so she can become pregnant. They're just being difficult. Fire just scares me. It's one of my ultimate fears. Is it? Oh. <laughs> look at how great her boobs look. Oh my god. You've been in three fires? Oh my god, that's scary. <laughs> Bad boobies. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Do we have any, like, um pastel ones. <laughs> Let's see. Because I do like this combo they gave her. Ooh, it like blinks. Oh, that's cool. It has like bioluminescence in it. You have? Oh, wow. That's, that's crazy. Mm 
That's really scary. Ooh. <laughs> or this one? This one looks like tie-dye. But I like the blue in it. It's lucky because you know that someone's house totally. There's been a few houses around me that have burned down, but um, but everybody got out. <laughs> the sound, the way that she's, oh, that makes her look naked at the top. Shells, please. You want shells for her boobies? Instead of this? Let me see. Tops. Where are the shells? These ones? I kind of wish they had ones that were just shells. Someone broke in his apartment just hours before the fire, too. What the hell is going on? Yeah, clean out your dryer lint. <laughs> My city is whack. Oh, no. Yeah, you've been talking about it. You've been warning us. You've been telling us. These shells. They cover her boobs, though. <laughs> but for some reason, they don't look as good. What is the coconuts? What do the coconuts look like? Oh my god. No, I'm, I'm gonna go with this. I like this better. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, accessories. I need to change her makeup too. It's weird. What is going on? Oh my god, it hasn't done this in a while. My computer's like. Hold on. Okay. But one of the cords I think is kind of loose in the back. I need to fix it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Do you need accessories? I guess you don't need accessories. Gloves. Gloves. Rings? Maybe. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Get a ring out. Mm -hmm. She's engaged, after all. <laughs> all right, give me your um, your face and your hair. Yeah, this isn't working for me. We need mermaid hair. We can have just the blondes. Oh my god, stop! It's so weird. There you are. We could have just the blondes. She's she's too high in the air. Oh, I'm gonna have to change my thing. Okay, hold on. Oh shit. Let me change my headphones. We're at the five hour mark. By the way, I have a question. Um, Cause I'm always trying to think of how to make this stream better for other people. Yeah, winner, Zoe. Um, do you think it would be, do you like the long streams? Do you think it would be better if I did like you know, five to six hour streams, four days a week, as opposed to like eight hour streams, three days a week, you know? I don't know, I've been trying to think about if I need to restructure my time. Six hours would be good, yeah. And then I was, I, I kind of want to add one more day. I'm just not sure if I should or not, because I'm going to start doing YouTube videos 
So maybe I could just use that day for that. But a lot of people seem to do like four days. But I think I would need another day of streaming if I would do only six hours because we that would only be an hour from now. And I feel like it wouldn't be enough. <laughs> we would need another day. I don't know. I don't want to take everyone's time, though. We get those big raids at like hour eight. I know, which is why I probably should. I was also thinking maybe I should go earlier in the day so more people could join. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'm just overthinking it. There's not a ton of people, though, that are on at the time that I go on. And so a lot of people end up raiding into me, which is great. Don't stress yourself out. I mean, for me, you start at like 9 p.m. and end around 5 a.m. I know. Which, like, it works really well for me because I like to be up at night. But I know that for other people, most people are up, like, during the day, normal hours. And it might be smarter for me to change it. Hmm. I don't know why the gloss always looks kind of weird on their lips for me. I go with a natural lip. Just like a, just like a, yeah, like a lip balm. There you go. You're in, you're naturally, you're in the ocean. You don't really need a lot of makeup. We will give you highlight though. Cause you're like super, we'll just, we'll be one of the highlight girlies. You're, you're glistening, you know, you're in the water, you're glistening. Yeah, for being someone who stays up super late, I found you personally because I'm not a normal person who sleeps, so it's perfect and no one streams late this late ever. Yeah, because I was even like looking when I was, when I, when I do have times where I'm up more throughout the day, like I was yesterday because um, my sleep was all off from the night before. Um, there was, there's tons of people on throughout the day, so maybe that's just, it would make it harder for people to find you. I don't know. Okay, that looks nice, makeup-wise. Do we like this hair with it? Or should she have more straight hair? Or just all blondes? I kind of, I don't know. It's definitely a departure. Oh, wait. Why did it change her hair here? Oh, because they're locked. Oh, shit. That doesn't work for me. No. No. No, ma'am. Abs- No, ma'am. Oh, no, ma'am. No. <sighs> okay, hold on. I'm gonna have to unlock them. Stupid locked thing. Ew. Did it mess up all my hair? <laughs> it made her- Okay, her, the outfit's an easy change, but the hair- No. It's not- No changed up it changed all my hair you bitch where's my hair there you are so rude did it change even the ones that had like specific individual hair? oh my god no Okay, here, give me just eco lifestyle. <laughs> yeah, because if you search people placed in sport at this time, it's usually you near the top or at the top. Yes. Thank you for that. Aww. I don't know. I, I figure that I could try doing like one day a week where it's earlier just to reach different people. That might be smart. There we go. Just do it like that. It should have changed all of them. Bruh. Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. How could you do this to me? On this day of all days. Ah. In this in this economy. See, that one's the same. 
in this economy of all economies. There we go. That one's the same. Oh, wait, hold on. I didn't check the other one. Okay, that one's that. So some of the, so the special ones that I had, it's fine. But the ones that were like our regular hairstyle all changed. You bitch. This is just our mermaid hair, not our daily hair. I always forget that they, like, you can link them. I had to change that outfit, too. It's, she's just wearing coconuts. She's only, only coconuts. This is, this is my only coconuts. Welcome to my only coconuts channel. She only wears coconuts. Okay, let's change your outfit for swim and then you're ready. Give me my swimsuit back. Coconuts all day, every day, every day. This is a coconut channel. <laughs> Just swear. You know what's so funny? When I was helping one of my friends do like hot tub stuff, um, the parameters of like what you can show on here are so weird. Like you can show as much cleavage as you want, basically, but you can't have under boob. Like, what is that? Why can't I have under boob? What do you have against under boob? So if I was wearing coconuts and some under boob, come on. Yeah, really. It's weird. And people will like, and you know, it's even so like, I'm so glad I don't do that stuff because there are such hateful people out there, especially to people who do that kind of stuff. And they'll be like, they'll be pissed off that a hot girl is making money from like doing hot tub streams. And then they'll like, they'll like report them as much as possible just in case they have some kind of thing that might violate something just to try to get them suspended. And it's like, you've, they've never interacted with you in any other way. They'll just be like, um, oh, this, this picture that you have has some underboob on it and that's against the rules. I'm reporting you. And it's like, what the fuck? That's so mean. Like some guy literally did that. And I was like, why would you and it's just because he's, like, mad that hot women are making money and that he's not with that hot person. Like, get over it. It's crazy. People are hateful. <laughs> Repeat after me. Incel, right? Incel, for sure. For sure. Like, why? When, like, if you were nice, maybe you'd get... Maybe maybe they would be nice to you. I don't know. I couldn't, I couldn't do that. Like, the way that uh, the boundaries you have to have with people alone are just so much more... Why would you literally possibly take money from someone over somebody? It's just because they're mad. They're just mad. And it's they're mad they're not getting laid is what it is. Just men in general who um, like who uh, like how things have been in our society with the patriarchy get mad that women want rights and that they want to uh, date people who believe that they should have rights. The audacity that we want rights. When I sold it, it was rough, man. People are so demanding and several of my snaps shut down. Yeah, exactly. Like, it's so... It's, it's rough. It's not an easy job by any means, like... It might seem like it's easy because you're selling, you know, like pictures or something like that, but like it's not easy at all. 
Okay, you need to go take a bubble bath. Go take a bubble bath. Eyes watching. It's hard to spend time with those you love when all, oh, he, he got, oh, that's what happens. That's what happens. He couldn't perform well at the, at the waterfall. He doesn't like public. Woohoo. Danny. Danny gets, he's too nervous in, in public. Okay. That's all right. He's, he just got too nervous. Yeah, it's okay. His performance issues in public. It's okay. It's not for everyone, you know? Oh, wait, don't we have Franks and beans in our pocket? Did they go bad? Oh, they went bad. Damn it. He was a little spaghetti noodle. He might be nervous, but his swimmers are too. Maybe. Maybe he didn't, you know, finish because he was too nervous, you know, something like that. I don't know. There you go. He's having fun. He's happy. He's engaged. Why don't you get some leftovers and then you can go to bed. I'm not really supposed to be controlling him because we're doing it to where I only control one person, but that's been abandoned a few times. <laughs> Oh, Danny has work in an hour. Danny's gonna, Danny, you need to, you need to, you need to ask for time off. You can't, you can't go to your first day, Danny. You're gonna, you're gonna fall asleep in the water. <laughs> That's not gonna work for you. Take a vacation day. There you go. You guys need to go to bed. She's asleep. It's fine. We won't tell. <laughs> Where are we going to put a baby? We need to make some money. <laughs> we need to make money. Where is, is, is my money tree? What are you doing? How are you doing, money tree? In season. Not your normal tree. This is a money. Girl, this is a money tree. Oh, girl. Yeah, eat, eat your mac and cheese. There you go. Take the day off. No, don't go to work. Oh my god, he's gonna be exhausted. Oh no. Oh no. That's alright. He can crash as soon as he gets home. He's might crash at work. He might drown. Please don't drown. Power conservation? No. No. Chanel's calling to chat. Alright. What's up? He became good friends. Good. No, I don't know. No power conservation. That's no ridiculous. Absolutely not. Yeah, no, that's a no for me. I want to vote. Favorite action plans, man. Okay, get up. Talk, talk to your sister. She's calling. Let her know. You're like, I got engaged. Tell her. So exciting. Oh, we also got to pay the bills. Pay bills. Oh, no. He did bring home some money. Good leftovers. We love... That's nice. Money, please. All right. I need to spread conservation awareness to other Sims. I only really know Danny, and he is asleep. Is that the sex worker sister? Chanel, yeah. Chanel. She's telling me about how her only Sims is going. She's telling me I should join. And I'm telling her, girl, I just don't have the bandwidth to deal with those people. I just don't have the, the capacity to deal with all that. And, you know, they're just too demanding, honestly. Okay, so hydration. So instead of hygiene, we have hydration now. Which we can get from drinking water, going in water, or rain.
Okay, we're good. Danny, I need you to wake up. I need to tell you about conservation. Oh, can I post that I got engaged on Social Bunny? Can I tell everyone? That's like the best, one of the best parts of it. Dad, you are, dad, you're dead. You're not having lunch with friends. Let's be real. Post about a new outfit. Why can't I post about being engaged? They need to update the social buddy system to not just be for teens. It's ridiculous. I love my new outfit though. Feel free to stop and stare. I'm looking fresh to death. To death. Do I have more friends? Hard to agree. Like, it's not... Like, lunch is a great time to make some friends. Doesn't work for your parents. Who's this? Who's Bahan? Milton? Wasn't, wasn't Bahan one of my teachers? Or one of the chaperones? I'm not going to add him. He has... He has a mustache that I just don't agree with. I don't, I don't agree with his specific mustache. I'm going to not support his facial hair, as the Sims would say. Clean that up. All right, I need to, I need to tell people about conser conservation. Hello, Daniel. Daniel, wake up. Wake up, I need to tell you something. Chat with Crush. Girl, you're engaged to him. What do you mean? It's scary, but Clover is dying to talk to her crush. I know you're engaged. I have the worst heartburn. I'm blaming the mustache. Yeah, that's fair. It's the mustache's fault. That specific one. Hi, welcome in, Sunny. Thank you for being here. Oh my God, he went back to bed. I need to tell you something. Wake up. Wake up. I'm just bugging him. I'm just bugging him at this point. See, that's kind of what I love. I kind of love, I kind of love that I'm like a sim streamer that people find when they can't sleep. <laughs> How are you doing, Sunny? I hope that you're doing well. Okay, I want to, I want to tell you about, I have to tell you something. It's for my job. Sirens lullaby. Oh my god, I forgot about that. What does that do? Does that make them love you or does that kill them? What does that do? That's how I found you. Yes. Just restless. Totally. I totally understand. Your name's Lucille or Lucy. My dumbass watched a VTuber. Wait, what? Watch scary shit. Now I need something to get my head. Oh no, not scary stuff. Welcome. We um, you're doing the not so berry challenge. Nice. What gen are you on? We're doing the um alphabet legacy. We're on um. It was created by our friends at Thick Like Cheesecake, and it's basically every generation has like an AA name. You get married to somebody with a B last name. You have CC kids, or you have BB kids, and then you. Be, be kids and then they you know and then you every one you have to have a career that has that letter so like our first one was alan allen he was an actor um now we're on the c generation she just moved out with her boyfriend danny devito <laughs> and um she is uh a conservationalist and she we have a plot twist wheel as you can see above and it made her a mermaid. So we thought conservation works great for that. And then he's a diver because his name is a D name. Then they're going to have D kids and then it'll, so on and so forth. And we also have a wheel that tells us we, we the wheel is like our own flavor on the challenge. It just makes things more interesting. Um, it adds a little plot to us here and there. We like, uh, for instance, at one point um, in our last gen for B, uh, our husband cheated on us with our mom. She never found out about it, though. It was crazy. Um, again, I keep talking to the microphone for some reason. I, you're talking to you specifically. Although I do feel weird when I talk directly into the camera. I feel like it's so, so personal. So, <laughs> 
But um, and then on our on Tuesdays we do the hundred baby challenge, and we thought I thought I was done with it, but I clearly was not because the game gave me ten extra days. So we're currently pregnant with Leonardo DiCaprio's kids, and I think we're gonna try and we're gonna try and end it having Kyle Kyleson's kids, our new the new Kyle, because I love Kyle. I'm obsessed with Kyle, and um. We're going to then turn that into what I call the messy legacy, which I don't think anybody's done, but it's like my own thing. I just kind of made up where each generation, because like my mom and grandma both had 60 something kids, um, 56 and then 60 something, then I just feel like they would have problems, you know, kind of like some generational curses. So we're calling it the messy wow. legacy. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in. And then, um, so each generation then is going to have some kind of like wild backstory of like things being messy. Um, and I've wrote, written a bunch down, but I'm not telling people just so that they can kind of have it unfold as it goes. But the first one, everybody kind of knows what it is because I kind of already said it. We're just going to have a bunch of roommates and we're going to try and hook up with all of our roommates and we might, I don't know if this is part of the story yet, but we might get pregnant and we might not know who the dad is. Just, just a, just a thing, you know, just some fun stuff. <laughs> you stared into my soul. That'll be $5. Boop. <laughs> See for chaos. Yes. This is a comfy chaos channel. As I think most all Sims channels are really. We're just a comfy chaos community. Speaking of spin the wheel is out of stock, is it? It shouldn't be. I think it has a 15 minute cooldown and it was taken like 39 minutes ago. Yes, claim your abundance, love that. Okay, I don't like this new system. It's hard for me to find things. Where would my job stuff go? Interests? Yes, spread conservation awareness, babe. Babe, no, I love you, but I need to tell you about conservation. Babe, let me tell you about conservation. He's very tired. He's just exhausted, and he doesn't want to hear from me, and I understand. Babe, I understand. He's getting facial hair. He's getting facial hair. Okay, I think we should also try for a baby. <laughs> that was yours? I had a bunch of them. Um, oh, here, if I take the wheel away, you can see some of them. Well, some of the ones that were like friends ones and then some of the ones that were mine. Let me take the wheel away. I have a little. What was the one I used the most? I think it was the O-Town's Angel one. Is that one on there? I can't even see now. I was too young to be on AIM, but when I got a hold of a device, it was hot, Hotmail chat, yeah. Yahoo, Yahoo chat was my favorite, I think, for like the chat rooms. Oh, oh, we're doing it, okay. I think my favorite um, screen name was this one. I think it was that one. I was really into O-Town. I don't know why. I do know why. It was Ashley Angel. I also used to... Oh, I, don't, I, didn't, I don't even know what that was. Early internet was so interesting. He sounds... He sounds not enthused. Oh, okay. There's a woohoo. I was like, you sound not enthused, bro. Oh, there we are. You can go to bed now. Go to bed. Yeah, you go to bed. Did he use a condom? It doesn't say he did. A chat site, site for pervs and furry role play. Fascinating. Fascinating. I was like 10 or 11. Yeah, I was like eight in chat rooms and I was, it was not good. <laughs> it 
It was the Wild West. <laughs> Actually, I'm not going to check. I'm not going to check. I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to take a pregnancy test. I'm going to take a pregnancy test. Where'd your drink go? On the floor? Why'd you put it on the floor? Nervous? You could do local meetups and I gave them the neighbor across the street address while they were at home. Oh my god, wild. I didn't have a brain. Yeah, I didn't either. I'm not pregnant. Why am I not pregnant? Take a fertility test. She's like, they've tried for a baby now like five times. I need a fertility test. Thirty nine percent chance. Fertility information via phone by using the period checker app. What? She has a period checker app. What? I didn't know this about this app, about this mod. Currently, you're at day five of your cycle out of seven days. Next PMS is coming up in one day, period, in two days. The next most fertile day coming up is in zero days. The next ovulation day is coming up in one day. The most fertile day is coming up in zero days, so then wouldn't that be today? What? I don't understand these things. I'm not very smart when it comes to this stuff. Casually doing sit-ups? Yeah. Just cute little sit-ups. Some cute, some, just some cute little sit-ups. How's my garden? Take photos. No, I don't want to take photos of it. It bugs me that these aren't in a line. Are these sheltered? Yeah. This one's all season, so it should be fine. We're ever on Omegle. Which one was, I don't think I, I don't remember. Which one was that one? Was that one of the like video ones? Are we gonna talk to you the plants? We're gonna research the plants. It was the random stranger chat room. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That one's still around, actually, isn't it? I see people do that on TikTok. Um, I did it, like, a few times, but it was always just so many dicks. It was just, just dicks everywhere. You pop in once in a while to troll. I think it's just all people use it for, really, at this point. To troll or, like, make TikToks. <laughs> or just, like, show their dick. <laughs> just be like... Oh my god, I saw this, um, I watched the, uh, the docu-series about, um, Cornhub, I don't know if I can say that word on here, um, Cornhub, and it was, uh, there was this girl in there who was like, oh yeah, actually my most popular thing that people pay me for is to rate their dicks, so they'll send me pictures, and I'll send them, and she did one, like, on the thing, and she was, like, she went into, like, detail, like, examining it, and being, like, it has a really nice, you know, length, and it seems like it has good girth, and, and I was just, like, whoa. <laughs> I was, like, whoa. I mean, I guess it's, I guess that that would, is what they would want more than just being like, that's nice, good, good for you. And then she gives them like a rating. Like, I'll give it a, I'll give it a solid seven, which is high for me, you know? <laughs> I'm like, damn. Everybody has some kind of job, yeah. I mean, I guess when I think about it, it makes sense that maybe you might really want that kind of 
critique or like, or to want to hear somebody really pay attention to that part of you in that way. I don't know. I think we should go to sleep. I think it's, I think it's time to sleep because we got work tomorrow. We already spread awareness. Oh, you're up. Wait, if you're up, then then we should do it. <gasps> Where'd you get a mutton chops from? Okay, no, I think you should wake up. Where did you get this beard? Where? Okay, Wolverine. Purchase a diving knife. Okay. Where did these? Where did this Wolverine come from? I think you need to come in here and lay it down on your babe. I think that's what you need to do. Where? The new like facial hair that grows is so interesting. He's like, yeah, I'm just giving it a try. Do I, do I look like Hugh Jackson? Is it? Do, do you like the Wolverine? Do you, do you want to watch? Um, do you want to watch the movies with me? You want to watch X Men? It's a nar. It's a nar for me, dog. Hi, sweet Sammy. Welcome in. New to Twitch? Welcome, welcome. Twitch is like a whole new thing. But you're more than welcome here. Thank you for being here. It's a nar. He went full Wolverine. He did. He's like, I'm going to go mutton chops, baby. I looked away. Danny decided to grow mutton chops, Disco. Yeah, I don't know why. He's, he decided to go full Wolverine. Welcome in. Thank you, Sammy, for the follow. I appreciate you. If you have any questions about Twitch, if you're, like, really new to Twitch, feel free to ask. Um, we're, we're a friendly bunch. We're, we can get weird, but we're a friendly bunch. It doesn't suit him. Should we have him shave? We're trying to get her pregnant. Who's thinking about, oh, Danny's thinking about mac and cheese. That's fair. That's fair. I'm going to, I'm going to check and see if you got me pregnant. Okay, lemon. I hope you sleep well. I hope your brother's okay. Let us know how he, I know how he is. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you. I'm not pregnant. Why am I not pregnant? I'm going to attempt this mysterious thing called sleep again. Oh, no problem. I hope you sleep well. If not, we'll be here, I'm sure. I used to use my boyfriend's account, and now I have my own because he got annoyed with me watching Sims. Oh, my God, that's so funny. That is so funny. I'm going to have you... Can I have you... Wait, why can't I have you shave? How can I get you to shave? Shave. Shave facial hair. Does she like it? I don't know if she likes it. I said it twice. Oh, yeah. Am I buffering? <laughs> Just a cute little buffer. It's fine. Go sleep. He's going to shave. Oh, my God. Let's watch him shave. Yes. That is a huge razor, bro. Are you good? Oh, my God. You're going to cut yourself. You're putting it in the one area where you don't have hair. The hair is on the sides. The middle part had no hair on it. D Danny. Daniel DeVito Jr. Every day I'm buffering. <laughs> I want to see this kid at least be implanted. I know, right? There we go. He looks, he looks better without facial hair, I think. <laughs> What? Are, what? Oh, you're sick? He's trying to make it thicker. Leave him alone. <laughs> He's trying to pretend that he has hair right here. He's like, don't, don't worry about it. I just don't have a lot of hair. It's fine. 
just really own the facial hair that you do have. You know, like Pedro Pascal, which is the little, he doesn't have a lot of facial hair. It doesn't grow super strong everywhere, but it really commands what he does have. He just got 10 years younger, right? <laughs> it's crazy how that stuff changes people. She's always sleeping, I swear. Is a state of mind, you know mm. what I'm yeah. I'm your daddy. I am, yeah, for sure. For sure. What, um, yeah, well, I'll go to work today. No, I'll go to work today. Um, on Sweetener Sam's stream, they have a, I'm trying to learn how to do the video re um, commands so that you guys can have, like, little videos pop up once in a while when we do, like, certain sounds. And um, I haven't figured it out yet, but I'm working on it. Um, but she has one where it's the Pedro Pascal edit, where it's like, you know, the really like popular one where he's like looking all sexy in that cowboy outfit from like Kingsman or whatever. And um, and it and so people we just can play it, and we just, I just play it constantly. <laughs> And every single time, it's so mesmerizing, and it's like, how do I not get sick of this? I don't understand. <laughs> and I, like, kind of want to do something like that, but I, I want to find our own thing. Right? <laughs> we got to find our own thing, though. I don't want it to be the same. I feel like that would be taking it from her. We'll just pick up, we'll like figure out all of those, all of the people that we lust after and maybe I'll make an edit. <laughs> I've never made an edit like that, but maybe we need to make an edit. <laughs> all right. Are we going to, where are we going to work? Oh, I'm supposed to be at work. Oh my God. Wake up. Go to work. You're late. Oh my God. You're an hour late. And you took the day off yesterday. You need to go to work. Bruh. Do it, please. You work in eight hours. Why do you work at 5 to 8 p.m.? Okay. Um, where do I change? Can I do it on the computer? I need to, I want to change the settings for Wicked Whims or Wonderful Whims. I think it's messing me up. Can you change the settings for it? Do you have to do it on the person? Computer security settings. Upgrade. Bruh, he is sick or something. Settings. Pregnancy settings. I don't want a menstrual cycle. <laughs> it makes it more difficult. Although it does make it better for like some things. Oh, I think we're having an ad coming up soon. You could pose him. Did it, where does it say that? That would explain a lot. Don't override game and mods pregnancy. It requires restarting the game. Oh God. All right. Birth control settings. Who's this guy? Who's this guy? <laughs> who's, who's that a picture of? That's not Danny. <laughs> who's this random dude? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, that's too good. <laughs> Woohoo settings. STDs? How about we don't? 
How about we don't? I don't want crabs. <sighs> Should I have that on? Is it on? It is on. Okay. That's fine then. We'll leave it that way. I think this one... Yeah, we'll just leave it, but let the, let the game do its normal thing. Otherwise, everybody's going to get pregnant. Just you, who's someone without her knowledge. <laughs> she got caught up. Who is this guy? <laughs> is that like the wonderful whims dude? <gasps> I have a hankering to tinker with something. You want to come fiddle the rocket ship at GeekCon? My mom's calling. His mom's calling. Do we want to go see his mom? His alter ego. He's like, I don't have performance issues. I love publicly doing it. <laughs> the new guy. <laughs> the new guy comes in and he's like, I'm much better than your old guy. I like doing it in public. <laughs> We're busy. You gonna get down? I wanna see this, I wanna see this. Yeah. Try to make a, trying to make a baby, leave me alone. Yeah, do you want grandchildren or not? Where are you going? You're gonna play in the rain, wow. The whimsy. I'm sad that we don't really have height because then he could be like actual Danny DeVito and he would be like four foot. How tall is he? How tall is Danny DeVito? Four foot ten. He could be four foot ten. But he's not. And now he's taking a nap on the couch. He's like, I don't know what to do if she's not here. I don't blame you. Where are we going to put a babby? If we have a babby, where are we going to put it? His knees are pulled up. <laughs> no, dare you. So he is that short? The bathroom put the babby in the bathroom. The babby lives in the bathroom now. The porch? <laughs> He has a high metabolism. Ugh, lucky. I have a jacked metabolism. First promotion. Yeah, I know you're romantic. First woohoo. Uh huh. Got a job, right? Got engaged. Mm -hmm. We oh, we gotta do our wedding. Fell in love. Mm hmm. Made a best friend. Yeah. Preferences. He likes spirited Sims. What does that mean? What is that? What is spirited Sims? Save and add a room? Well, if we do, then we're not going to be in a tiny home anymore. I think that up for... I think up for a baby and an infant, we could probably make this work. But once they become a toddler, they're going to need like a, their own room type of thing. And then we're going to have to expand... Do we have enough money for it? We don't have, we have $581. He likes, what's a spirited sim? What do you like? You have first bladder failure. Yeah, totally. First woohoo, first promotion. He didn't, he have a bladder failure too? Uh, manifested as a mermaid, <laughs> manifested. Is that a cheerleader? Maybe. That's what I was thinking. Made a self-discovery, yeah. Do a job? Celebrated a birthday? Wow, we've had quite a life. Oh, I wanna look at all my milestones. Let me see my milestones. Celebrated a birthday. Got engaged. Where are my firsts? What do you mean? I've woohooed. Oh, I woohooed as a teenager. That was my first. Oh shit. Oh shit. Called me out called me out okay those age groups aren't available <laughs> I got called out 
Best friend, fell in love. This one's for getting married, okay. Then milestones are cool. I'm a fan. I don't know what all you can get milestones for though. Oh, I was checking if she liked, if she has preferences with Sims. I don't think so. I think it would have told us. No, she doesn't. She likes video but gaming. Daddy is a state of mind, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm your daddy. Yeah. Thank you for that. I appreciate that. Thank you, Fixie. We're, wait, famous? Oh no, I have a great reputation. I'm not famous. I have a great reputation. I have influencer points. Oh my God. I'm an influencer? Ew, what? Dried scales. Oh, her light hydration is low. Oh no, she's feeling fishy. Oh, she needs a bath. He likes dancing. Good for him. And I'm feeling feverish. Damn it, Danny got me sick. Oh no, I need to take a bath. As soon as I get home. Her hydration is super low. What happens if it goes out? It's your bedtime. I love you so much. See you guys Saturday. Thank you so much. I hope you sleep well. I hope everything's good. I'll see you Saturday. On Saturdays, by the way, if you're new here, we do drag on Saturdays. Um, if you haven't seen my drag before, here is a little bit of it. I've been doing drag since 2018. She'll pass out maybe? Maybe. Yeah, is that what is going to happen? Um... But yeah, we do drag on Saturdays and we do like variety. Sometimes we do Sims, but a lot of times we try to do like variety, like other games. Um, and it's fun. That's how you find other fun games. We got, I got really addicted to the game growing up, which is kind of, it had some twists and turns, girl. And I don't know what we're doing this Saturday though. We're talking about doing the um, Who's Your Daddy game where you play, where I would be the dad I would be your daddy and then you guys could be the babies trying to kill yourselves and I have to try to stop you from killing yourselves it would be a disaster oh my god she's not doing well hurry up and get home they also have like opposite schedules she's gone all day and then he's doing it at night and Whatever, we gotta plan our wedding. <gasps> we gotta plan our beach wedding. I gotta put a I gotta put a beach wedding venue down. There I am. I'm here. I'm here. I'm going I'm going in the water. I need it. Ugh. Ew, that looks so weird. It needs to update with the fin. Look at her feet. <laughs> okay, it came up. <laughs> her little feet. No. There you go. <laughs> Thank you for clipping that. <laughs> her little feet. She's having her splash moment between the baby and the wedding. They need to work overtime. I know. We don't even have enough money to, hit, to actually pay for a wedding. You're right. It's like $1,000. Well, now we have 725 He's going to work. Oh, in his little diver outfit. Oh, man. So cute. Get your diver outfit on. Can I vote? All right, I'm just taking my little bath. Okay, go pee. Take all of, taking care of all of her stuff here. We don't really have enough money to waste food, so I'm gonna finish your food. Or I'm gonna, I'm gonna get leftovers, and I might finish your food if it's left out here. Actually, how hungry am I? 
Okay, I'm gonna try to eat your food then. I'm just gonna eat your leftovers. Oh shit. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Okay, all right, all right. It's just, it's just a little glitchy. It's just a little glitchy. There's like a little bit of glitch. Just, a, just, just having some glitchies, you know. Just little, just little things. Just sim things. Just sim things, and we're fine. It'll be fine. Just ignore the weirdness. <laughs> Mermaid by day and Kim K by night. <laughs> oh my god. All right, how am I still not pro okay? When he gets home, he, I think he gets off at eight. We're we're tr we're trying for a baby. I'm gonna take a nap with the music on. I gotta turn that off. We're gonna turn it off. You can't you can't nap with the music on. There you go. There you go. In this cute little house with no money. Our money tree hasn't grown yet. Our plants are doing something. The plants have been kind of buggy though lately too, so it's not like super guaranteed. Are you home? I thought you were supposed to be home at eight. When do you get off? He's very tired. He looks exhausted. There he is. He's like, babe. She's like, oh my God, you're home. Finally. Finally. Are the plants sheltered? Yeah, the roses are, but the the other one isn't because it's supposed to be all season. Oh my God. I know you're not feeling well, but you need to try for a baby. Babe. Oh my God, you're home, babe. Babe, babe, babe. Oh my god. I'm so happy you're home. Uh, I love you. Oh my god. Can we try again? Can we? Can we Can we go hook up? You want to hook up? You want to? I don't know why we're talking so much about it. I feel like we should be in there right now. I feel like we should be in there. I feel like we're, this is a lot of talking about it. When we could just be in there doing it. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is more of an action-based thing, babe. Not really a talking situation. I do love talking to you, though. I'm a big fan of talking. However, in this situation, it's a little more action-based. Test two baby time? I mean, we're going to see how this goes. I turned some of the stuff off of the game on the mod. But I didn't... I would have to restart it for all of it to take effect, so I don't know if it'll work or not, but we're gonna try. I turned the, like, one part off. Uh-oh. What's this? You're angry about have about Crush? He waved at someone? Oh my god. How dare he? I'm s upset? Devastation. Something is bothering... Something is bothering Clover's crush. How can she be happy when he's not happy? What is he upset about? Do you have a crush on someone else? Oh, she's waving at other people too? What is happening, you guys? You are both young adults now. Stop worrying about people waving at each other. There is, There are more important things. You guys, who is the, what, what baby do you want to talk, no, who is this? Who you, think about family member, who is that? Is that Charlie? Is that your brother Charlie? Where's Charlie? Oh my god. <gasps> Dolphin! Oh my god, look, we're best friends! <gasps> Porpoise pals forever. Oh my god, me and the dolphin are porpoise pals. Shut up, porpoise pals. Where's Charlie? Is this Charlie? Show me him. Show me Charlie. Did we... Did she not check? Did I not have her? She's not pregnant. What the fuck? 
That is Charlie. Okay. Um, all right. So I could restart the game and then try it. Um, we also want to put down a wedding venue. However, again, we can't afford a wedding yet. But that is on the agenda. Restart and try? Okay. I'll take a quick break then. I need to also go to the bathroom. I need to go to the bathroom and have him go in the bathroom. You can check that off on the on the <laughs> bingo. Also, we're do we are doing stream bingo if you want to play along. Maybe because you changed the setting, yeah. So I'm going to save and exit and we'll restart it um you need to pee too okay good good timing to take a quick break we're gonna take a potty break i'm gonna put up a brb screen so you can see some like stuff from past streams um and <laughs> if you need to go to the bathroom please do go take care of yourself get a snack get some water something good you know and we'll, we'll be right back okay brbs let's do this I'll do the Sims one and you can see some of the stuff that we've done in our hundred baby stuff uh, that we do on Tuesdays. Okay. Get out right now. It's the end of you and me. It's too late. And I can't wait for you to be gone. Get the fuck out. Get out. There's another door. Lock for Allie. What? Wait, what? Wait, what? What? Wait, what? Wait, what? Did we just get triplets? What the fuck? Oh my god, it didn't say we were having triplets. What? What? Oh my god, Salim! Salim's got the powerful span sperm. Uh, we need another name. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, we'll get a minute. We'll get, we get, we need another name. We need to, we need to say, oh my god, we got triplet. <gasps> Thank you for the clip. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god, I've been waiting. I've been waiting. I've been waiting for this moment. I have been waiting for this moment. Alec. That's a good one. Means angel. Love it. Fuck me, dude. Guys. Oh! I got him! Triplets! 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 Party! Ah! Don't imprint. On my typing. On my kids. Okay, thanks. Bye. Don't imprint, don't imprint on my kids. Okay, thanks, bye. That's what it says. Okay, he's ready to go. He is ready to go. He heard that we wanted to have his babies, and he has, he is ready. Um, Pickles. Honey. Pickles is in. Flirty introduction. Oh, okay. He's like, okay, I'll, I'll get dressed. I'll get dressed. I don't want to be... He has no butt. That's okay. Hello. Hello, Pickles. How are y'all? Is there anywhere to woohoo at this place? Beguile. Beguile, Pickles! Right now. Get beguiling. Is he single? Oh. The love. The instant love. We just put a love spell on him. Are you single? Look at it. Damn, he is ripped. He's ripped and tiny. At the same time. Hmm. Exchange numbers. Do I exchange? Oh my god. Are you okay? Bruh. You just fell hard. There, there was like dizziness about up there. Are you sure you good? Oh my god. He looks so... <laughs> Gotta crop him out. He's so. <laughs> He's just.
touching me. <laughs> He's touching me. Stop touging me. Get out of, here. Get out of the frame. Oh my god, he's so sad because he's gonna die. It's alright, it's on. It's fine. <laughs> Her face. <laughs> I know, right? It's a whole meme right here. Mom. I know what you did with this guy. Mom, I, I know. Mom, I've heard about Woohoo before. Mom? This guy right here, I heard, I have, hmm, I know what you did. Mom. Oh, it's, oh. <laughs> Stop. I just got downstairs and there's bears everywhere. <laughs> it's bear night. It's bear night, everybody. It's time for some bears. It's the bears. <laughs> the bears are here. Okay, hold on. Come on. Oh, is this is your is this your sexy face, Kevin? Okay. What about this? That, I mean, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. All right, one more. That's the same pose, Kevin. What is what is this? Is this a kissy face? What well, what's happening here? Okay, let's do a different face. No, I'm sorry I didn't like your kissy face, Kevin. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Hold on. Let's do another one. Just do another one. Yeah, let's do that. Welcome back. Um, Disco, are you here? How do I delete? How do I delete a chat in the chat? <laughs> I've already blocked them. <laughs> I don't know how to delete messages, though. I don't know why people feel the need to do shit like that. What does that even mean? Is it because I'm a drag queen or is it because... Like, what is that about? Ignorance is what it's about. How do I delete comments? Do not see the comment. How do I delete comments in the chat? I already blocked the person, but I need it deleted. And I can't, I don't know how to delete stuff. Why, why do I not know how? <laughs> well, I know how to like block people. <laughs> Thank you for that. How do you delete comments? Do you have to be in mod view to do it? I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> yeah, I already like bans and reported them. Oh, I looked at the cute little animation. It was bans. Thank you for that, Tooth Disco. I really appreciate it. Probably just saw the drag tag on my stream and was like, you're a groomer. Okay, you're Ill Ill informed. Thanks. My LOL was it one of your videos? Thank you. I kind of I kind of thought that, or I thought maybe it was like a nervous LOL. I wasn't thinking you were like laughing at what he said. Yeah, actual assholes. This is one of the reasons I've been like, I have very strong political opinions, but I try to not. Like, I do share them on stream, but I, I feel weird about posting them everywhere just because I don't want to invite those people to then uh, harass me, you know? Like, I'll talk about it on stream, no problem, but I feel weird putting a lot of my political opinions, like, on my about me or something for that reason. At first, I was like, did I mess a dog care clip? No, I only know what they're talking about because I'm a drag queen and I'm very active in the drag community. And um, that's like a narrative that's going around for right wing conservatives to say that um, drag queens are groomers, even though like there's literally no like not a single piece of proof of that. There is no 
court cases of that. There's like, it's not a thing that happens. It's just one way that they can get people mad in order to get them to go against the LGBT community. And it's just, and that's why there's like over 400 something laws trying to be put into place to ban drag and trans people <laughs> and among other LGBT stuff. And so that's why I talk about that a lot, especially when I'm doing drag on Saturdays because it is a huge problem and um, it's really, really sad. It's really upsetting and it's really upsetting that not a lot of uh, celebrities and people are talking about it. It needs to be like something that we're all participating in, but you know, politics are weird here. There's actually, oh, okay, I'm not going to go into it. It's fine. You're gorgeous. What the hell? Drag queens are my favorite. The sweetest people I've ever met, actually. Yeah, it's just, it's just ignorant people who literally have no idea what they're talking about. Um, you know, in, in the, can, I'll just say this, if anybody is not, um, paying attention to this kind of stuff, maybe you don't hear about it, maybe you don't see it, but, um, on the, on the right wing conservative side, which I'm obviously like, I'm like a, I, I say I'm like a progressive, but I don't really know what the terms, like what terms are what at this point. Um, I just believe in a lot of more progressive agendas, but, um, on the conservative side, one of the big things that they usually do is like, say, oh, this person is a groomer in order to have, because to them, they view like that kind of stuff as the ultimate sin, which it is like, it's awful. It's like one of the worst things that you could do. It's, it's just, we all agree. We all universally agree that that's super fucked up, but they're trying to use that narrative to then attack people on the left to say that like all of us are groomers and that we are cool with that because we're cool with drag queens and gay people and trans people. And therefore we support groomers because they have convinced, um, because in order for them to justify their homophobia, their transphobia, etc., the only way to do that and not be called homophobic and transphobic and racist and whatnot is to say that they do something so much worse that everybody hates. And that is something like grooming kids which is not a thing that's happening. And it's really, really sad that this is a narrative that they're using to try to push that kind of stuff. And so that's where all these bills are coming from. That's why there's so many town halls. If, you, if, if you've seen them, there are tons of them on TikTok where people are fighting this, trying to get these things taken down because what they're trying to do is what they did in like the 80s and 90s, which was create laws that would make it illegal for you to dress as your opposite gender in public, which would then make it so that police can then attack not only drag queens, but, um, but trans people on a regular basis for dressing that way. And it's really disgusting. That gross comment was from someone who is and was a streamer and is a father of two, setting such a horrible, gross example to them. Absolutely disgusting. Wow, that's really fucking sad. It's really sad because he's just buying into this narrative that they're feeding people on the right to say, like, this is a thing. This is what's happening. And it's not. It's not a thing. It's just another way for you to... Reporting him, reported him directly. I reported him too. It's just another, and I'm talking about this because I got, <laughs> I got attacked in the chat really quick. And it wasn't really that bad. It, I've, I've had much worse, but, um, and what's even crazy too is like, they'll see drag and they'll just assume that I'm trans or they'll assume some whatever. Um, they don't realize I'm like a cis female. And so really what they would be looking at is for a lot of people, what they think is like, I shouldn't do even do drag because I'm a cis female and it's just me dressing up more. But in the drag community, it doesn't matter. It's just, you know, that's different people's opinions, but that's what's, you know, this, just because I am, for instance, a cis female, I still get this stuff. I still get people saying this stuff. So I still have to see it and it sucks because people don't do it in person. 
at least not where I live because I live in California. It's more progressive. But um, it's it's just really the whole thing is really shitty. And uh, they're trying to make it to where basically being gay and being trans would be illegal. And then they're trying to eradicate home people who are gay and people who are trans. And that's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. So they can keep screaming and yelling into a mirror as much as they want. But to me, when somebody tries to accuse you of being a groomer because of something like that, it just tells me I'm a little concerned about you being a groomer because why are you so fucking concerned about everybody else being a groomer? Like, I... Anyway, I should just stop talking about it. I probably shouldn't even say that word on on Twitch. I don't know how they feel about that, but just want to like share a little information. If you haven't heard about that stuff before, that is a thing that happens on a regular basis in America, and it's really sad. I think it has it happens in other places too, but yeah. A dog groomer giving awful cuts. Yeah, a dog groomer. Um, it's just yeah. All right, one more time, Danny. We're trying to have a baby. Let's wake him up. It makes no sense because there's no face to a groomer. Yeah, but it's something that people have made up to make it to to make it seem legit to them. Uh, it's a legitimate reason for them to hate someone because they don't have a legitimate reason, babe. Babe, I think that we need to um, try for a baby. I think we need to try for a baby. Danny, you up? You people have existed long before the beliefs of bigots. Honestly, it's crazy. It's just insane. <laughs> it's insane. I also really like that that happened on the day that I decided to put 18 plus in the title of my stream, which is literally telling people don't have children come here. Literally. <laughs> like, don't. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. All right, maybe it'll work this time. Maybe we'll get pregnant this time. I don't know. Oh, we had poor Woohoo. He, he's been... That was not a full Woohoo. Oh my God, you guys. This is... This is depressing. Oh, <gasps> we're pregnant. Finally, finally. Stupid mod. Hi, baby. Stupid mod. He's just not performing. <laughs> You're blaming her fins. Her fits on her fins. She's pregnant. She doesn't know yet, though. Yeah, it was the mod, I think. Use your pregnancy test. I've spent like 50 bucks on pregnancy tests in this game. He's just tired. He's very tired. Yes. Danny, wake up. I'm pregnant. He's getting out. He's getting out because I'm pregnant. Danny, Danny, guess what? We're having a baby. A baby. A baby. Babby's all around. All right, you go to bed. Go sleep. What's up with you? You are sleepy, but you're also, your hygiene's really bad. Here, go take a bath and sleep in the bath. They're gonna have a fish baby. They might. They don't always come out mermaids though. So we're going to have, so we do, we did a, a wheel spin and she's going to have three kids. So the chance, there's got to be at least one of them. That's not going to be a mermaid. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Oh my God. I can't, this is <laughs> going to be so interesting to see where this let's play goes because uh three kids yeah so we have like so we have a wheel right the, the wheel that you're seeing right now is our plot twist wheel 
um, where we have various things that will change the plot of the plot of the story, you know, or add to the story a bit. Um, then we have another wheel. We have other wheels for other things like this. We spun the wheel to figure out where we were going to live in what world. We spun the wheel to figure out how the, how many number of kids we're going to have. So it just adds to the challenge a little bit. He's just... <laughs> Okay, good. He's good. He'll be fine. Oh, they sh hold on. We should turn the lights off. Auto auto lights. Auto lights, all lights. I love the idea. It's so interesting. It makes it, like, fun and random for me, you know? And it also kind of adds a little bit more to the challenge. That way, also, it's like... Because, you know, with, like, Not So Berry and stuff, there's more of a specific way, like, you have to do this and this and this. With this one, it's like, we don't know what those things are going to be until we're on that generation. So it kind of keeps us on our toes. I like the, I like it because it makes it more interesting for me because I don't know what's going to happen. I didn't know she was going to become a mermaid. <laughs> Oh no, why is it always, I feel like it's always Winterfest. Every five fucking minutes it's Winterfest in this game. <sighs> Harmony Huntington III was adopted? What happened to the Huntingtons? Okay. He's really gotta pee. I want to make a grand meal. Mark was adopted by the Guzman family. All right, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a grand breakfast, babe. It's sixty fucking dollars. You better appreciate it. We're we're hurting for money. Tasha. Oh, people are adopting dogs. Cupcake. Ducky. Jim. Jim. Fish dinner? Oh my god. I know, I wonder how she feels about fish now. It's, she's She got child of the ocean as one of her traits, so I think, I don't know if she can eat fish. Or I don't think she'll go fishing either. Wait, hold on. Is it that one? There's one of the Solani traits. I don't remember if it's this one or another one. But, like, you can't go fishing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, what happened? You have, you're not even near it. What are you? You're not even near the oven. Oh, my. You're not even. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. Get out of there. You're pregnant. Oh, my God. Stop. Stop! You're gonna be on fire! F yeah, it bur put it out! Oh my god, you're standing in the fire! No! <laughs> oh my god! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Yeah, you discovered the fucking fire! I bet you fucking did! I bet you fucking did! Oh my god, call the, fi call the fire department! Call the fire department! Call the fire department! Call the fire department. Stop freaking out. Call the fire department. Oh my god. Oh my god. Call the fire department. Her man's useless. I know he didn't do anything. <laughs> he didn't do anything. Oh my god. Call the fire department. Call the fire department. Oh my god. Our house is on fire. Exting extinguish. Extinguish it. Oh my god, everything's on fire! This is the biggest fire I've seen in forever! The house is gonna burn down! Put it out! Extinguish it! Oh my god. Extinguish it! What do you mean? You can't reach the fire! Extinguish! Did you get the fire mod? I didn't get the fire mod! <laughs> Sims can be both so frustrating. I know. I can't. Can I not put this out? Put this out. 
I didn't even get the fire mod. <laughs> shot like that, they, they put you in jail. Right away. My mirror is on fire. Right away. You drive too fast, jail. Slow, jail. You undercook fish, believe it or not, jail. You overcook chicken, also jail. Undercook over. Oh my god! Put yourself out! Oh my god. That's not nearly enough money to pay for everything that burned. And now Danny's growing more facial hair. Clean the floors. Oh my god, I can't believe you both. She just kept going. She wasn't even near the stove when the fire started. This is ridiculous. The, the, the mirror. The mirror is cute. We are not going to have enough money. Oh my god. I don't have enough money to replace all this stuff. I can't afford a new stove. Is the computer broken too? The computer's fine. Oh my god. I'm gonna need to get it. I'm gonna need to get an only Sims. This is ridiculous. Is the speaker not broken? No. Is that weird? Oh my god, we really we really need to make some money. This is ridiculous. Oh no. Look at him, he's on fire. I can't talk to you right now, Chanel. <laughs> Things aren't really going well for us right now, okay? <laughs> Things aren't going great. <laughs> if this was a YouTube video, this would be the thumbnail. <laughs> Mermaids are probably worth a lot on only <laughs> You need to take a bath, bro. Oh my god. I was just trying to make a nice Winterfest breakfast for my hubby. Joke's on me, I guess. Get leftovers. This is a leftover channel. Is my door okay? The door doesn't catch on fire, apparently. <gasps> Is that my money tree sprouting? Oh my god, my money tree sprouted. Finally. Let's keep going. Let's get that. I gotta weed it. There's some roses. Fuck yeah. Sell roses. This is our money out here. Money is money is gonna happen. Let's what's in our pockets. Let's sell some shit. We got roses. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna take two three roses out and keep them um and then i'm gonna sell the rest how much is that 580 dollars. that's good that can get us a stove okay i also have some outfits i can sell let's do that we're, we're hustling this is like my real life just me hustling constantly um i'm gonna get rid of this that's 140 dollars it's gone I don't need it. Um, tepid, tepid, tepid. Well, you know what? Who cares? We are going to sell it on Trendy. Sell all these on Trendy. We don't need them. I saw TikTok of a Sim posting on her only Sims. I've seen it all. Oh my god. I know there isn't a mod for it, but I haven't seen I haven't tried it. I heard that they can only have that as a job, though. Like, you can't use it as a side job. Enterprise. Similar fits are selling for $355. Well, then we're selling it for $365. $369. Let's sell that one. This one, okay. We're going to sell it for $150, slightly less. That's a lot, you know. It's it's not going for nearly as much. How about this one? What are you complaining about in there? 
380. Okay, this one's gonna go for 396. 396. All right, we can at least afford <laughs> to replace the oven. We can't, oh, we can afford a couple more things. Can we replace all of it? Replace that and replace that. Okay, good. We got our stuff back. Um, but that's it. They're going to need to go fund me. Yeah. So just, you know, it's just the American system, isn't it? Have a fire. The insurance company tries to find any reason not to give you the money for the fire. You know, just the whole thing. <sighs> she made mac and cheese. No problem. All right, well, she also really wants to have animals. I don't know how, if we have, oh, Bert, mom's calling. We've been thinking about trying for a baby lately. Do you think we should do it? Mom, you've had seven children. Mom, you've had seven children. You, no, no, you say yes? You want her to have another baby? <laughs> why why I think she should decide for herself I think she should decide for herself I don't think that's crazy she's had seven we don't have to raise it I know oh my god fine her mom's gonna live forever her mom's gonna live for fucking ever why am I old? Oh. Why am I fat? Oh, hi! <laughs> what is this? The 1800s. The elephant in the room. Why am I old? Why am I fat? Why am I old? Why am I fat? Why am I old? Why am I fat? Hi, Rachel. How are you? How is everyone? Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you? Um, well, welcome in, everybody. Uh, my name is Chelsea, also known as Tragic Glamour. It's so nice to see you. Your grandma had nine kids. Oh, my God. So, um, I didn't grab it right from my, oh. Okay, so, Bruh. let me, uh, I'll, let me catch you up. But first, do you want to see a raid video? I'll catch you up. What were you doing, though? You were playing, you were playing Sims. Were you building? What were you doing in Sims today? Tell me all about it. If you're not following Hi Hello Rachel and you like The Sims, then that's just ridiculous because she's amazing and you need to go follow them. You need to. I'm going to clean this toilet while we talk about it. You were doing gameplay? Really? How was it? What did you do? Oh my god. Rachel's an incredible builder, so I'm used to seeing them build. But gameplay? Shock and awe. Okay, I'm going to pause here. Let's save it. We just had a fire. Oh my god, I have to catch you up. There's been drama. There's been tea. Okay. Um, I'm going to show you my raid video. Give you a little bit of a view of what you can see here on this channel. And if you like to, if you like what you see, please be sure to give a follow. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Um, you did an orphan teen raising her infant sister after their parents died tragically in a grilled cheese fire that took their house and their mem- Oh my god. How was it? How was it? Was it crazy? Was it chaos? That sounds chaotic. <laughs> well, here is the raid video. If you like what you see, please be sure to give a follow and then uh, I will get back and tell you a little bit about what's going on in our stream. Damien, I'm going to tell you a secret. Damien, 
I'm gonna have every single one of you impregnate me by the end of this let's play. Drugs, I don't wanna get the drugs. I wanna live my beach life. Oh my God, that is terrifying. That's fucking terrifying. Are you serious with me right now? Look at him. I'm blending in. I'm being sneaky. Did you know that he will swing on a swing? Excuse me. Did you just pee on my dog? You just wear the top. It looks like you're wearing a condom. <laughs> so yeah, that's a little bit about me. If you like what you see, please be sure to give a follow. I'd love to hang out with you sometime. Um, so yeah, that sounds crazy. I need to see that. I need to see you in the chaos. Because I feel like... I feel like I need to see more of it. I just need to see more of this gameplay. Are you gonna do your 420 stream doing gameplay? <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, thank you so much again for the raid. I really appreciate it. If you need to go de stream and take care of yourself, please go do so. I totally understand. Um, it is late. <laughs> I'll probably be on for another hour, is the plan. Another hour or so. But um, maybe um, we have been doing the alphabet legacy, which was created by our friend Thick Like Cheesecake, where uh, each generation has like an AA name and then you marry someone with a B last name and you have BB kids and then so on and so forth. And then you have a career that has, starts with that letter. So, for instance, when we were in uh, AA, we were Alan Allen. That was his name. <laughs> Uh, we married someone named Bev Burgundy. You don't, they don't have to have the same like BB name, but we did because we're extra. And then he was an actor and so on and so forth. So we're on our C generation and we just moved out and we have, uh, we're now engaged to Danny DeVito Jr. Um, which is Danny DeVito's actual name. I didn't know he was a junior until recently. Um, this is him. <laughs> It doesn't really work because of the, you know, height issues, but at the same time, it's fine. He's decided to grow another beard, I guess. He had mutton chops for a minute. It was interesting. He was going for a Wolverine thing. We made him shave it. Um, we just got Kyle Kyleson would fit perfectly in this. Yeah, we are. He, first of all, um, I obsess Kyle. He's like my dream. I love him so much. I love him so much. And I am planning that when we get to K... Kyle Kyleson is going to be, it's all about Kyle. In fact, on our 100 baby challenge, I'm trying to end it with our last baby daddy being Kyle so that we can hook up with him. <laughs> I manifested his existence, I swear. Like, my favorite, like, like, California Valley surfer guy? Are you kidding? That's what I, that's, that's my dream. That's the dream. It's my dream. He loves cake. <laughs> <laughs> so is he just making cakes constantly oh god not that not that glitch um but here we are we are engaged uh we have a chaos wheel uh it's this this one is the uh plot twist wheel where it causes different plot twists in our games it's caused things like um in the last generation our husband cheated on us with our mom um our brother came out as transgender and transitioned um they are now our sister Cassidy. Uh, multiple family members have come out as sex workers. Um, our brother became a mermaid. We became a mermaid this stream. That was one of the things that happened on this stream today. Our sister came out as a sex worker. Our uh, sister Cassidy tried being in a poly relationship. We moved out and moved here. And then um, and we got engaged to Danny obviously. And, uh, and then we became a mermaid. And so we decided to become a conservationist because we're on sea. Um, her name is Clover. Um, oh, yeah. Cassidy's in a polyamorous relationship with Father Winter. Um, and then our, our, our fiance, Danny. What mods do you use? I just have MC Command Center. We have Wonderful Whims. On right now and uh, passionate romance and that's it right now we've used other ones though but that's all we have right now and we had to turn part of 
wonderful whims off because it was preventing us from getting pregnant. It was very annoying. Oh, and we're pregnant. We just got pregnant uh, with our first. We also do a wheel spin at the beginning of each, like once they become a young adult, to figure out how many kids we're going to have on that Let's Play. So we have to have three. And we're starting from our this, our little tiny home. Oh, no, it burned. The fire burned my stars. We just had a whole kitchen fire. We don't have enough money for this. We have $130. Um, but we do have a money tree growing in the back, so that should help. Um, can you use base on mods for streaming or do you get flagged? So for for the drugs one, yeah, you can use it. I haven't I, a lot of people use it. I don't think it's an issue. I think the only thing that is an issue is if they're nude, and obviously we can't do that. Um, so you have like wonderful whims instead. Uh, thank you for this. Thank you for subbing on, on YouTube. Thank you so much for that. Um, I post a lot of archive stuff there and I'm also going to be working on specific YouTube videos. I have a bunch of them that I'm going to be working on. But yeah, so here is where we're at. <laughs> We've become, a, we're a conservationist. We're a mermaid. Um, We've, we've gone on, okay, on this wheel, we've gone on a reality show. Uh, we've inherited money. We've lost money. We won our dream house. We lost our dream house. We had to move house. We had a haunted house a couple of times, honestly, a couple of times. I'm surprised we haven't had sex with a ghost yet or start a cult. Our brother went into witness protection. Our brother Cyrus, he's now known as Billy Ray. Um, Bruh. we've had a lot of, thank you so much for the follows. I really appreciate it. So yeah, we've had a lot of like weird, we had a lot of stuff. Um, and just kind of keeps it more random for me so I can have more fun with it, you know, and, but also it's just random in general. So it's fun for all of us. Oh, are we talking to our plants? Yeah, yes. Yeah, it's an ARP. Okay. It is technically... Winterfest and I was trying to make a nice beautiful breakfast for my for my fiance and the kitchen said no and we had the biggest fire I have ever seen in this game and we have lots of fires here on this channel I was just trying to live a nice life I had made mac and cheese no problem before all right um also I feel compelled to mention this it's not okay oh somebody wants to purchase my stuff on vlad wants to purchase my outfit on llama on <laughs> he wants to per vlad wants to purchase my llama core outfit work vlad fucking work that's cute i like that i like that a lot um i do want to mention something though because we did have something <laughs> We did have something come up today, and I just kind of want to mention it since you all came here. And I feel like um, you're part of Rachel's community. You'll be you know, um, LGBT friendly and everything. Um, I also do drag on this channel. I do it every Saturday. And I had somebody come in earlier talking about being a groomer. I'm assuming it was because of the drag tag that I have on my channel. Um, and I wanted to just mention that right now in America, we have over 400 different laws currently trying to be passed across our country to ban drag and uh, trans people and a bunch of other things. Um, if you want to check out more information about it and see if it's going on where you live, you can check out right here. It's currently at 430. Here is the ACLU link if you want to check it out if you live in a state that is pushing this these bills highly uh oh great we have some in california now oh geez all right i'm gonna have to call somebody about that <laughs> i didn't see that one all right see this is why it's good to check um i live in california we usually don't have stuff like that but apparently they're so uh good at telling people about uh trying to push people against us that they're trying to push these things through 
Um, so if you do have something like that going on in your state, please call your representatives, email them, etc., and tell them how you feel about these laws because they are trying to make it illegal to be drag or to do drag or be transgender in public, and it's very upsetting. Trans man who lives in the Bible Belt, East Tennessee, it absolutely, it's terrifying. Yeah, it's absolutely terrifying. So please, there are people literally living in fear because of these bills, and it is not a joke, uh, and it really needs to be talked about more, and there needs to be more celebrities talking about it, more people talking about it. So um, please, you know, look into it. I, it would be, it'd be really great to do so. Thank you so much. I just wanted to share a little bit of that because I... I do share, I do talk about it, especially on my Saturday streams, but, um, I wanted to, you know, I think it's good to talk about it. So, okay, we'll get back to it. They're trying to stop the freedom of existence. That's super uncool. Yeah. Non-binary Texan support journal, sports journalist. Oh my God. That is a, that is wow. Who was an athlete? Not a fun time. Yeah. Thank you so much for sharing that. Um, so yeah, I just want to share that if, if you were not aware, I think it's a really good thing to be aware of. So, um, okay, let's get back to it. So we're currently in our C generation, like I talked about. That was my first message, but hi, hi, nice to see you. I think I've seen you in Rachel's chat before. It's nice to see you. Thank you so much for that. Oh my god, you have one of those dinosaur things that I never know what it is. GlitchCon? Is that what it is? I always like, I always see that little, um, that little thing next to the, and I'm like, what is that? Okay, are we talking to our plants? Your name does look familiar, but then again, my memory is bad. Yeah, I'm totally. Um, I'm the same way though. I do that all the time. I'm like, I have to remember people's names. All right, hydration is great because we're just standing in the rain. Honestly, yeah. Glitchcon was what they used instead of TwitchCon in 2020. That's great. That's so cool. Was it any good? <laughs> All right, what are we doing? We don't really have any goals right now. I think we need to do a wheel spin. It's kind of scary when we do it, but we'll see what happens. No, I refuse. No, it makes the storyline more interesting. Come on. <laughs> Which one of them, though? Danny or her? Who's going to have the one night stand? But they're so bonded. It's not going to change it. It's not going to change that. I hate this. I quit. Kyle. Kyle. <laughs> Just go to Kyle's house, honestly. <laughs> Would it be bad if it was Kyle? Maybe it should just be Kyle. Maybe we'll just go to the beach. We're gonna spread some conservationism. I love that. Maybe we would just do that. Kyle lives here. Kyle lives at the fucking the plane. So I'll try to make it better because it's Kyle. <laughs> Should we do it with Kyle or should we go find somebody at like the beach or something? Is Kyle the rebounds? Kyle's the secret. <laughs> Just go do Kyle and get it over with. Don't let Danny find out. I won't. I'm going to Kyle's house. No, don't bring anyone. Don't don't bring him. Don't bring him. Kyle. Kyle's yeah, Kyle's our hall pass. Exactly. It's a hall pass. We're just have it's just a hall pass. It's fine. It's just <laughs> Everything is just sunshine and roses until the wheel comes in. The wheel comes in and says, hmm. Time to hook up with Kyle. <laughs> Is 
she's just she's seen him surf around a bit and she's really you know she's really interested she thinks he's a really great surfer she's been out you know in the ocean swimming around and her with her with her dolphin friends because she's a mermaid and she's like ooh, who's that surfing those waves hitting those pipes H2O. <laughs> Just hitting, the, hitting those gnarly pipes. Maybe he's got pipe. Who knows? We're going to find out. She just wants to find out if he's got pipe. That's really all we're talking about. You know what I mean? She just wants to ride the pipe. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> I'm stopping. It's over. She's already pregnant. It's not like she's going to get pregnant again. I know. You're having a baby. I know. You're having a baby. I know. Where's the door? Is this the door? Oh. I'm here for it. Where's the door? That's not a door. Where's... Where's the door? Bruh. Do I just go down? Hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. There it is. Knock on the door. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm here to sell Girl Scout cookies. <laughs> Would you like Thin Mints? Or Tagalongs? Do you like shortbread? Hello? He's like, no aliens, please. Oh my god, I can't see anything. There he is. Oh, he's dancing. Oh, he's just in here dancing. He's grooving. He does not have... Where are we? Do you hook up in the shower? You don't have a bed. <gasps> he's coming to see me. He senses my presence. He senses my mermaid presence. Oh my god, he's coming to see me. She's like, I shouldn't do this. I shouldn't do this. And he's like, no, you should. No, you should. Hey. just walks up the stairs to be in my presence, to dance next to me, and then checks his phone. <laughs> Flirt. Let's be flirting with him. Flan. He's got a twin bed. Yeah, that's... Mm. Thank you for the follow. Oh, hey. Oh, oh, we got that. Oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Excuse me. Can I give you a Winterfest gift? No, I don't want to give you a Winterfest gift. Hey. The head nod. <laughs> Pick up line. Mm, yeah. Don't. No, not the computer. Oh my god. What are you going to do on the computer? Oh my god. <laughs> I don't want to ask you to be anything at my wedding. I want, I want a physical intimacy. I want to kiss hands. Pick the wrong guy. <laughs> Wait, which is the guy wrong guy? Oh, because he has a twin bed? Mermaid. Physical and Mermaid. <laughs> why did I say mermaid? I was looking at mermaids. That's why. Embrace him. Embrace the Kyle. It's Winterfest. Oh, God. He's so cute. Shut up. With his, with his cute little freckles. Have a magical kiss in the air. Yeah. Let's have a magical kiss in the air. Oh my god. We're floating. We are floating. Ooh. You shout like that, they, they put you in jail. Right away. You're playing music too loud, right to jail. Right away. You're driving too fast, jail. Slow, jail. You undercook fish, believe it or not, jail. You overcook chicken, also jail. Undercook over. <laughs> this is mad. Disgusting. I'm gonna kill you. Give me $200. Give me two hundred dollars. Give me two hundred dollars. You slapped me. <laughs> oh, worth it. Kiss him. You're lashing out. I can tell. Mmm, Kyle. Oh my God, making out. Just making out. She's like, I don't want to spend. 
the rest of my life with the same person the say with the same person if i don't at least experience someone else you know i gotta experience why is why is santa trying to talk to me where the fuck is he no 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 clement walk away oh wait it is winterfest can you give me a gift never mind i changed my mind i want a gift um friendly Polite introduction. I'm very polite. I have to pee. I have to pee, but I want a gift. He just showed. He just showed up. He just knew. I'm going on the naughty list. Fair. That's fair. That's fair. Can I have a gift now? I got. Now I'm distracted with gifts. This is the way you distract me. Gifts. Hello. Can I have a present? I mean, you've been giving it to my sister. You can give at least give me a present. Oh, you, he values the time we spend together. Am I on the good list or the bad list? What did I get? I guess that'll tell me. That'll tell me. She loved it. I got a motion gaming mat. Dude, I'm on the good list. Don't even. Don't even come to me saying that. Go use the bathroom. Kyle, wake up. Oh my god, Kyle is ripped. Kyle. Yeah, you can sleep a little bit while I... We need money. We... we god, we have something to sell. We do. Okay, I gotta... She's really gotta pee. And then I think we should... Woohoo. No, no. Not that. You wanna, hey, I'm gonna wake you up. Kyle, wake up. I like that he has roots. So does that mean he like, puts highlights in his hair? Santa, no. Santa, Clement, Mr. Frost. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to say no. You can sell it on a yard sale table. Can you sell a, the gaming mat on the yard sale table? The whole mat? The, like, the thing on the floor? I pre Really? Can you? Kyle, wake up. Hey, hey, Santa. Excuse me. Kyle. Oh, my God. Look at his... I, oh, my God. He put his clothes... Don't put your clothes on. Don't you put your clothes on around me. Woohoo with Kyle. Santa's a cop blocker, honestly. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. I don't know if you can sell it on the table. I don't... I think you can only sell things on the table that can fit on the table. Santa? Thank you. Hi, Kyle. It's good to see you. I think... You want to, like, go take a shower? You want to take a shower? Oh, my God, he's so hot. Shut up. Can't even look at him. But I can. Show me your body. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> he used a condom. He used a condom. He's responsible. He said, I don't want to give you crabs. Yeah, he's responsible. bad for Danny? Well, at least Kyle can seem to really satisfy because Danny's been having a hard time satisfying lately. <laughs> I wonder if Kyle was, uh, oh, look at my tummy. Oh, we had a little time. Don't blame him. <laughs> well, they had quite a few unsatisfactory woohoos. That's what I was talking about. That's not my first woohoo. I've literally we've I've we've had so many woohoos. Come on. All 
All right, I gotta go. I'm going home. I gotta go home. <laughs> I gotta go. It was in the shower too. It's fine. I'm clean. I'm clean. Oh my god, if he, <laughs> what if she does get crabs and she gives them to Danny? <laughs> oh my god, it'd be wild. Yes, I'm going home. Just me. We chafed him? We ch <laughs> It's because we were trying to do it too much? Is that what you're saying? We're trying to hook up with Danny too much and he couldn't perform? That sucks. That sucks. <laughs> Clean and hydrated. <laughs> Couldn't handle all this, all this snoo snoo. <laughs> Wait till Noodle, Noodle hears about his dead Danny slant. <laughs> I'm not. There's no slander. He just was having, you know. She just wanted to try something different. She just wanted to try something a little different. It's fine. And now her thirst has been quenched. And now she doesn't have to think about it. Until maybe the wheel decides that she needs to again. Yeah, he doesn't know and he doesn't need to. He doesn't need to know. What's he going to do with that information? Go cheat himself. Maybe the next time we get cheat, he's going to cheat on her. Going to set fire to your wheel. <laughs> oh, because he waved at another. <laughs> I know that's so funny they like so they because they have a crush on each other they have like they get upset about him about each other waving at other people like what is that you can't wave at someone no the jealousy it's too much <laughs> okay I'm back and I'm wearing different clothes Hey, babe. He's dancing. All, all the boys be dancing. Do we not have any more get leftovers? Oh, no. Order pizza. The pizza's $25. Zoomers food delivery? What can I get? Ooh. I've never tried this. A poke bowl. How's this the first time you looked at this? I don't know. I usually just make their food. They usually eat at home. <laughs> they're not big on. If they're going to go out, they usually just go out. <laughs> Chicken stir fry. Is it only one serving? That's cool, but like, if I make the food, we get a bunch of servings. No, no canning. I don't want to can right now. I'm busy. I want to make food. Oh, we do have leftovers. What am I thinking about? Why are you eat? What are you eating? A peanut butter and jelly? That's fair. That's good. Who doesn't? No, I'm not going to say that because I've met multiple people now who said that they don't like peanut butter and jelly and that just confuses me and I don't want to know about more of it. I don't, if you're a person who doesn't like peanut butter and jelly, I don't know if I want to know that. We've been neck deep in Hunter Baby and it's too pricey to do that for lots. Yeah. Did you just break the toilet? This is why, this is why, Danny. These are my reasons. I don't PB in jelly, but I like PB. I don't, why don't you like, oh, repair it. Repair. Winterfest was awful. You got a gift. Is it too late to check for gifts? It is. They aren't married yet, right? No, not yet. We don't have enough money to get married. 
Where is our, where's my inventory? It's not in here, is it? It's gonna be in the other one. Oh, I gotta sell, oh, I gotta ship this. I gotta ship this. Oh, I have to do it from here, I guess. Ship to buyer. Elope for free? Fair, that's fair, we could do that. Okay, so it was an oopsie cold feet. I'm less mad, but still disappointed. <laughs> Yeah, she just wanted to try, you know, one, one, one time. Is this one not sheltered? It says it's sheltered. Why did it go away? Uh, she just wanted to try, you know, hooking up with someone else before she got married. She gained 21 followers. Wow. Good for her. Sleep. I'm an entrepreneur. Danny's gonna be a plumber in a minute. All right, let's check. Let me see. How much is that game pad we got? We have a baby on the way. How are we gonna buy things for the baby? The babby. How are we gonna? Handiness skill. Yeah, you got it. Uh oh, what facial hair are you growing? Ask Kyle. <laughs> oh, oh my God. $3,750. Dude, Santa's the best. What? Bro, Santa's the best. Uh, Santa forever. San Santa. Pff. Besties, man. That really coming in, really coming in clutch for us. You know, that was nice. <gasps> Bob Pancakes would like to purchase Groove Wave on Trendy. Wow, Bob. Bob would like to purchase my stuff. Okay, I, we got a wheel spin. I'm nervous about it. I'm always nervous about it. <laughs> okay, what are we going to get? Cassie's giving the good good. <laughs> Clement feels generous. Hell yeah. Where is he going? Lose job? Is that what we got? Aww. All right. Um, should we have her lose her job or Danny lose his job? Does Danny want to go into a different job? Or should she lose her job? Danny is currently a diver. Um, we were con contemplating between diver and entertainer, like, like actual Danny DeVito. Maybe he could be a comedian, you know, he could go into entertainment. Maybe he's like, diving isn't really for me. Diving's not really for me. I'm not really enjoying it. He's like, I did it cause you're a mermaid and I love you. And I want to spend time with you in the water. But like diving is just a little too demanding. I think I'm going to have to like quit. I'm going to have to find a new job. He's making a salad. Yeah, he just needed to follow his real love. Yeah. See, she had a little she had a little crisis and was like, I need to hook up with someone. And he had a little crisis and was like, I need to get a new job. His is healthy. Hers was not. He took the job because she needed to move. He was happy to try it. And, but it doesn't fit. Yeah, it doesn't fit. It doesn't quite fit. Um, I think what we're going to go into this. Yeah. He quit his job at dive a dozen. <laughs> okay. Now we got to learn how to make jokes. Cooking level two. Good job, Danny. Eat your salad. Well, eat your salad. You just made it. Eat your salad, and then we're going to try to write jokes. Right? No. Jokes. It doesn't pay more. That's probably true. Nah. Does he have any? Um, oh, yeah, he likes to work out. I forgot about that. Oh, he has, like, no rewards. 
I think we still have rewards. We should, uh, we should get the one so that we can move up in our job. What is the ones where you can move up in your job? Is it oh, entrepreneurial, more likely to get promoted? And then there's another one, right? Connections. Start all careers several levels ahead. Would we have to quit in order, and then get the job again in order to do that? Should we do entrepreneurial or connections? Quit first. <clears throat> Quit first. Okay. Okay, we need to quit our job. I'm sorry, babe. I'm sorry, Babs. Let's um let's just do it. Let's we just need to quit. We're shipping on Trendy, and then we're going to quit. Then get connections and get the job again. Okay. She's like, I just don't, I just don't know if I can, if I can do this job. It's just not paying enough. And then, and then they're like, okay, that's, uh, we understand, blah, blah, blah. And then they're going to call us back. We're going to call them back and be like, oh, crab's immune. Oh my God. <laughs> not crabs immune we're gonna call them back and be like we'd really like this job is there any way you can promote us is there any way that we can we can move up in this job i just i have a baby on the way we have a baby on the way and i just station is this negotiations yeah I need to is there any way now hiring a wildlife enthusiast $14 an hour yeah that's just like not gonna cut it it didn't do it it didn't do it we're still at level one. Yeah. School's out forever. Why didn't that work? It makes it easier. You're supposed to start like several levels ahead though, it said. It's TV season premiere. We don't have a TV. We can't afford a TV. Research conservation. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. All right. I'm going to I'm going to research conservation. We already did it. We used all of our points anyway, so we'll have to just keep getting more points. We got to clean that too. All right. We can't afford to have to have animals right now. So we're gonna go to Soulmate. Ooh, and wait, what are the easy ones? Fortune, Mansion Baron. Okay, well, we don't have that, that's for sure. Um, oh, that's the wrong thing. Uh, not really family, because we we're not quite there yet. Maybe gardening, because we're, like, learning to garden. Okay, let's do love. Soulmate. Fitness. Yeah, the fitness one's pretty easy, too. Yeah. Oh, and if we do fitness, then we can both do fitness together. Because he also has the fitness thing. The bodybuilder one. Painting. We're going to have a shitty season. We don't have a TV. Although if we go to the gym, maybe we can watch on the TV. You have work in two days. Yeah, write, write your jokes. We, have, we both have work in two days. So you finish your what you have to do for work. 
I know, you're very sad. Write sad jokes. Write jokes about being sad. What are his traits? He's a hero. Hero and jester. Oh, what am I? Lover and a jester. Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, she's just going to take a quick nap while he finishes his jokes. Oh, and see, he's so happy I'm around. <laughs> Hydrate, thank you. Walking on smooth shine. Okay. I'm gonna have you get up because she needs to research conservation and then we're gonna go to the gym. I need the mirror, right? Isn't it cute? Um Babe, I need to check res I need to research conservation. I need you to move. Oh, that belly is showing. Here, why don't you go dance? Go dance a bit. Ooh, more people have joined bingo. Yeah. Yeah, claim your abundance, woo. Claim that abundance. Technical difficulties, fair. <laughs> I feel like we have them every stream. You can get the Penguin TV. It's only two seventy five. Oh yeah, we have like thousands of dollars now. Oh my god, we can get married. Oh my god, okay. We're gonna go to the gym. We're gonna watch TV at the gym. <gasps> Why are you here? Why is he here? Don't tell Danny that I was at Kyle's. What, are you gonna ask me to be your best friend because the answer is no. No, no. Oh my God, damn it. You, why? You bitch. I'm Swell. wants to become, no, we're not, be, we're not best friends. We're not best friends. Do, if you tell Danny though, I'm going to kick you in the face. We need a Kyle reference on the card now. True, 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 true. Can Danny ask for a gift? His mom said congrats on landing that sweet job. Let's ask him. I mean, it is the day after. I don't, I just didn't, he's like, I didn't see you. Friendly introduction. Hey. Lymphema. Hey. Admire your courage. I admire your courage. Yeah, I admire your courage for asking. She's not really into you though like that. It's, I mean, Cause I'm her best friend. Save fair. <laughs> All right. When she's done researching, we're going to go to the gym. We're going to watch the season premiere. He's always popping up, honestly. Um, we'll, we'll do our some workouts. And we'll get ready for our wedding because now we can afford it. Are we having our beach wedding? A cute little beach wedding. We haven't asked anybody. We haven't done any... Do we, okay, usually I don't do any of the wedding stuff. We just go get married. Like, I think one time I had, like, a bachelorette party. Do we, do you want to do the whole wedding spiel? Or are we just, like, laid back and don't care and we're just having our beach wedding? You know? Pull a fortune, you got it. Okay. Oh, you got the double fortune. That's lucky. Okay. It says a pleasant surprise is in store for you this weekend. Your hard work will pay off this year. The double fortune. There's only one of those in there. You got the double fortune. Why is he angry? He's angry about his crush waving at someone else. Well, it happens. Silly behavior. Potty humor. I love that there's impersonating a celebrity. All right, am I done with my task? He dislikes summer strut music. No. 
She did more than wave. <laughs> Alright, we're leaving. We are, we're going to the gym. <laughs> Just call over like six people and travel with them. Okay, so like, yeah. Fortune, are you trying to tell me something about the house? I hope so. Pleasant surprises in store for you this weekend. That sounds like good. That sounds good. We need we need the good vibes. We need the good energy. <clears throat> okay, we're going to a gym. Where is there a gym? Oh my god, I should make oh my god, I never thought about that. I should make a Solani gym where it's like a beach gym. Oh, I should make a beach gym. Oh. Damn, I gotta I gotta make a beach gym. Okay. I'm gonna write it down. Beach gym. Just have like random things that I write like ideas for builds. Beach gym. I also want to make a woohoo park. That's on my list too. Every time we've left the past couple of days, we've been like, did we lock it? Well, there's nothing for them to steal anyway, suckers. Not that they would. <laughs> She can invite, yeah. She can invite a few from her side and we can invite his parents once they get to the beach. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the bushes, observatories, hot tubs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of those in one park. So we'd have like a woohoo park specifically to go to and we're like, where, to, what should, we need to, we, we need a woohoo. The woohoo park. Yeah. <laughs> that almost sounds like a water park the more I say it. The woohoo water park. The water park. Okay, where is there a gym that I haven't been to in a while? I would like a new gym. This gym's nice. It has yoga. It has yoga. Let's go to this gym. Does this save have it where it has yoga? I might have to fix it. Because the actual gym has like a yoga room, but you have to put uh spa day stuff in it for it to be functional let's go okay i'm actually while we while we dive into this i really have to go to the bathroom again i'm gonna do a quick brb time to go we'll go to the bathroom get some water get a snack um whatever you need it's gonna be really it's gonna be pretty quick though it'll be like a minute or two um, and I'll have a BRB screen up. So just really quick, a little BRB. Uh, when we get back, we will do our gym stuff and then we'll get ready for our wedding. And I think we'll end it after we have our wedding. So, uh, let's do, I'll do my OG BRB this time. Okay. Be right back. Don't hook up with me. Ah! No. <laughs> I can't. I'm cheating in front of me. <laughs> that's not. That's supposed to be me. And I'm cheating on my. Um. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Who is this? With this guy? An elder? Get out. Oh, come on. Come on. No. And Shrek left again. Did you know that he will swing on a swing? Look at him. He's having so much fun. Get it. Oh my God, he loves it. Oh my God. This is great. I didn't know he swings. He's a swinger. Game yet, we're just doing the training. We need to put on my stealth outfit. This is your stealth outfit? Oh, fuck me. Okay. <sighs> so stealthy. Like that one. Let's do that one.
We're gonna be stealthy, guys. This is the stealth team. Sometimes you will need to sneak away and try not to be seen. Be sneaky. When you make a sneak, you need Get to your make sneaks sure together. Your party is wearing an outfit that blends in with your surroundings. Sneak We're not blending in. Sneaky. I'm not here. I'm not here. I'm blending in. I'm being sneaky. A, a rose. A tulip. A daisy. What's the last one? An orchid. An orchid. Of course. How could I be so blind? Who's. Who are you pregnant? Who got you pregnant? Ma'am? 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 Okay, we're back. <laughs> All right, welcome back. Thank you for being here. All right, let's get back into it. We are at the we are at the gym. Um, I want to see. I don't know if we're gonna be doing yoga. Oh yeah, I gotta fix the yoga studio. It's really cute that they did this, because they're like, you could put a yoga studio in here, but these are just like bath mats not not actually yoga studio so we're gonna put we're gonna pop one in there's a water slide mod wait really that's cool okay which one of these is instructor okay this one Are you serious? Come on. So the thing, some of the things I have to use move objects on are just stupid. <laughs> it's because there's a mirror there. Like, come on. All right. They don't really fit the other way. And it would be weird to have them this way, too. I guess they could fit in the middle. I mean, I've been to yoga classes. They can get pretty, they can get pretty full. All right, that's fine. You can make a realistic looking water park with no CC. Really? You can? I mean, I can see how you could do part of it with like the new, especially the new splash pad stuff. All right, can I use any of these? I'm pregnant. Where is there? Oh, is that my mom? <gasps> my mom's here. This is Birdie. Birdie used to be blonde, which is why I'm blonde, but Birdie had a midlife crisis and needed to change her hair. Oh my god, look at her hips, her hip ratio. Is she pregnant? Oh yeah, let's find out. Oh my god, are we gonna have babies at the same time, mom? Mom, are you pregnant? Let's see, we also gotta get all the gravestone. Are we gonna do a graveyard for this family? For this legacy? I feel like maybe we should. 
Um, no, she's not pregnant. Yeah, we should. Okay. I gotta get, um, I gotta get that started then. She has all the graves so far. I don't think we're gonna put everybody in it, but we'll put like the, you know, at least the, the main couples in it. If we put all the children, it's gonna get really messy. <laughs> she has seven, yeah, she has seven children. I don't know why. She is thick, yeah. Work out together. Yeah, let's work out. I'm ready. Hey mom, I'm pregnant. Oh, did I tell her? I should tell her. She, I mean, I feel like she would know. Give family advice. Train. No, I want to tell her that I'm pregnant. Oh, there's another pregnant lady. This is the pregnant gym. Mom? Is it small talk? I don't like this new system. It makes me have to look more, talk about fertility. No, I don't want to talk about fertility. I want to tell you that I'm pregnant. Female sims get thick after one kid. I mean, they really do. Maybe that's why she's working out. She's like, I just want to make sure I'm good. Oh, there's her sister. There's Chanel. Chanel's, Chanel's been doing sex work on the side. She's an actress. But she, she's been doing independent films. Oh, you're doing yoga. What's this? Oh, the yoga instructor. You're a Bailey? Are you related to Octavia? I'm, I'm so nosy. I always like to know. Grace Greenberg. Then why is your last name Bailey? Oh, Dwayne Bailey. Your spouse is Dwayne Bailey. Dwayne? Okay, that's fair. That's fair. I'm just nosy. Hey, other pregnant chick. Oh, are you the trainer? Oh my god, look how cute you are. You can't even see you're pregnant until this, you look at the side. What are you having? What are you having? A girl? Cute. Danny's got that wellness skill. Oh, I know you. No, I don't want to be, no, I don't want to be your best friend. I'm busy. You can only have one best friend in this game, and it's my husband. It's my boy, it's my fiance. I'm sorry, but it's just too, it's just, it's, if I could have multiple best friends, then sure. You know, like real life, where I have multiple best friends. But like, no. Ooh, I'm gonna go beat stuff up. Go practice punching. Who is this guy? I don't like his mustache on him. Best friend is a tier. It's a tier system. Everyone's... Why am I swimming? Oh, I know I'm swimming. Of course I would be swimming. No, we're gonna go up here. How's my hydration? It's great. It's great. Chanel. Chanel. Oh, Chanel, do you want to be my sim of honor? Oh, no. Ask, ask Chanel to be your sim of honor. No, let's, let's, let's ask. This is our sister Chanel. As you can tell, boobs run in the family. But they are getting smaller as the generations go. Yes, Sim of Honor. Mom, come back. Mom. Oh, Mom. Do you want to feel the baby? Mom, I'm having a baby. No, don't go shower. Mom. Oh. Okay, Mom. All right, that's fine. Love the Tatas. We're, it, we're a Tata family. Fine, I won't talk to my mom. Okay. I want to punch something. This one. 
work out for eight hours. That's a lot of hours. And she's tired and hungry, and I don't blame her. Where's our TV? Are there no TVs at this gym? Is this gym too cool for TVs? Is there one in here? What is going on? There's just bulletin boards everywhere and mirrors. Do rich people not like to watch TV when they're working out? This is supposed to be the rich gym. We paid extra to come here. Swimming counts as working out, does it? That's good to know. Cause she would love to go swimming. But there are no fucking TVs here. Well, TV season premiere day is gonna be bad then. Cause it's TV season premiere day. Oh, she can sleep in here. Here, swim laps. I want to see what it looks like when you swim laps in a pool. She's active? Sure. Why not? That makes sense. She's very happy about it. She's learning so much about herself. Okay, are you working out? Maybe you should push the limits. Push it to the limit. All right, why don't you stop doing that? Let's go swim. You're really tired anyway. It's probably not good. Yeah, it's it's, it's not good. We can swim. We can sleep in the water. <gasps> she's not going to drown because she's a mermaid. I love that. She's hungry, though. We don't have any food. Okay, she's going to swim laps and then she's going to sleep. I don't really know what that looks like. Does that look like how it looks when everybody else does it? When they just like lay on their backs? There we go. Okay, it hasn't transformed yet. Okay, <laughs> there we go. Oh no. Oh, okay. We don't really have enough room. We don't really have enough. We're just hitting all the sides. Yeah, we're just, it's fine. Oh, okay, yeah, no, we're going through tile, it's fine. We're just going through tile, you know, as you do. As we, as we do when we go to the pool. Don't you do that too? Yeah, yeah, just go through the, just go through the floors. The floors are, are not even there, because we're in the matrix, obviously. There's, there are no walls. There, oh, it is the same. <laughs> She's just back floating. Just sleepy sleeps. Sleepy sleeps for the mermaids. Her boobs look great. Oh, you're swimming too? He's like, babe, let's swim together. He's pretty, probably pretty stinky. He's just going to swim around me, make sure I'm good. It's bad hygiene. He's not too tired, so he'll be fine. Check around for a TV. I did. There's no TVs here. I don't know what they're doing. Maybe we should go to a lounge and get some food and watch it there. We could go to across the street to the lounge and watch it. Yeah, get some chips. He's, <laughs> he's swimming in place. He's swimming in place. <laughs> All right, why don't you go? Why don't you go to the back? Oh, we're in the walls now. Okay, yeah, this is the matrix. <laughs> How about we don't swim? How about we stop swimming? <laughs> God, that's too funny. 
I made the mistake of grabbing some gorgeous CC rugs to use in my offline or on stream gameplay, and it makes me sad that nothing this beautiful is in the game. Oh. Oh, my other listing expired. Okay. Dude, he just keeps going. Stop. I'm gonna have to reset you in a minute. Yeah, get out. He's a slob? I mean, that kind of fits with Danny DeVito. <laughs> but have you seen him on It's Always Sunny? I mean, like, he's not Frank, okay, for true, but like... God, it would make us, it would make it harder on us, wouldn't it? Because then he wouldn't clean anything. Frank, yes. Danny, no. Okay, no. He's declines. He was on his way to go the, to the shower anyway. He'll drop all the diapers. Oh, God. <laughs> he was on his way to, to go to the bathroom and take a shower. So <gasps> there's our brother, Billy. Hey, Billy. <gasps> Billy, do you have any kids? I should look at our family tree and see if things have been doing. You have no children. <gasps> but you got married. Who's Cameron? Who's Cameron? Hold on. I need to look. Hold on. Am I compatible with Kyle? Oh, it doesn't even tell me. It doesn't even tell me. Okay, she has to go to the bathroom. Go to the bathroom. Um, I want to see your... It's here. I want to see the family tree. I want to see what's. I want to see what's been going on. All right here's Charlie. Okay, here's us. Here's our sister Clarissa. There's Clarissa. Or you became friends with Satan? Yeah. Here's um. Cassidy is a blogger. I didn't remember that. Billy. Married to Cameron. I want to see Cameron. Why won't you show everyone? Cameron's a mixologist. Coffee stain remover. <laughs> I forgot that Lee became a barista. Yeah, this is our mom. And then we had uh, one brother that died by drowning. Colby. And then we have Chanel. And then Cassidy. And then Billy, who went into witness protection. His original name was Cyrus. Okay, well, it won't show me, so that's fine. I don't know why it's like that. Yeah, I, I declined it. Okay, let's go to the bathroom. What's up, Billy? Did you finish doing your shit? You're uncomfortable. You're very tired. That's fair. We're gonna go the we're gonna we're gonna go out though. So just get ready. We're gonna go to the to the lounge. To the lounge. Alright, let's go. One of the um video I, I probably shouldn't tell you because I'm gonna I wanna make them. But I have a bunch of videos for YouTube that I'm gonna make. And a bunch of them are basically just testing the game, testing, like, what is possible. And one of them is how dirty can the house get? Like, if you have eight sims, one of them's an infant, you know, that they're all slobs. And then also... It will catch a fire. And then I had the idea of what if you had all slobs, but one neat person. And can that one neat person clean up enough to make up for all of the other slobs? These are all things I want to, I want answers to. And so I'm like, I'm going to, I'm going to try that. I'm going to try it. I have a bunch of other ones too. 
experiments. And then I have, um, I think we're going to do on the channel, uh, the adventures of Jimmy Beefster and do a whole Jimmy, do like a Jimmy series and see what happens with Jimmy. The angry dust bunnies spontaneously combust when they get too mad and set the house on fire. I did not know that. That's wild. This thing is taking forever. My game is super laggy. I, I really hope that this new part that I got is going to fix that. Because it's, it's been happening since the update <laughs> the most. <laughs> Some of these I think I know the answer to because I haven't seen any problems like can you infinitely borrow money with no consequences I think you can but I don't know <laughs> I'm curious all right we're going to orchid let's go God, it's being so slow there we go, with Danny, yeah. We might just set up the stuff for the wedding and do the wedding next time. Unless you guys really, really want the wedding and then I, I can, I can continue, keep going. But I was going to end pretty soon. Hey, if the dust bunnies catch on fire and they burn the house down, that would also say, that would answer my question, can you burn a whole house down without any mods? Because usually the fires are pretty contained. You would love a little wedding, but if you're sleepy, you can end. Okay, we'll see how, we'll see how the game goes, because it's been a little laggy, but if I can, if I can, and we can set it up, then I will. I think we're gonna so we'll go there we'll get some food we'll watch the tv premiere we'll go home i'll have them go home and then i'm gonna go into uh i guess i could do that when we go to the location i'm trying to think of how i can set up the wedding venue mojo you're awake Oh, I guess it would be 6 a.m. for you. Or no, it would be 5 a.m. for you. Are you waking up at 5 a.m.? Let's spin the wheel. I bet you thought you were safe. 4 a.m.? Oh, 4 a.m. Oh. Oh, a vacation. Oh, a vacation. A vacation. That can be our honeymoon. It's 5 a.m. there. Oh, my God. We want a, va we want a honeymoon. It's only 2.10 for you. <laughs> it's 2.10 for me, too. Okay. Uh, where are we going on our honeymoon? We got to pick out the vacay worlds. Oh, actually, the new world has a vacay spot, too. Doesn't it? Like a rental? We're in our bathing suits. <laughs> Hold on, we gotta change our outfits. Are we just gonna show up here in our bathing suits? What are you mad about? Why are you mad? Oh, you had trolls on Social Bunny? And because I was waving at someone. Okay, you really need to calm down. Links woke me up pointing because my shoes are <laughs> in their way. Oh my god, that's so funny. Oh wait, um, outfits. Mojo, um, Clover cheated on Danny with Kyle. The, the game told us it had to happen. So, uh, he doesn't know. Danny doesn't know. Danny doesn't know. But we cheated on him. 
Okay, I want to watch TV. I want to watch it. Where is it? But daddy is a state of mind, you know what I'm saying? I'm your daddy. Yeah, that makes me feel better. It does. It weirdly makes me feel better. There it is. Watch season premiere. It makes me feel better. <gasps> when we get to pee, we can have Pedro. We can get with Pedro Pascal. <gasps> Bitch. Stop. Stop right now. When we get to pee. Oh. Oh. Yes. Mm hmm. But no Quint, yeah, no Quince this time. It's too many. Watch TV. Where'd you go? Are you watching it? Oh, Braun is here telling his jokes. Braun's always here telling his jokes. Watch current channel. We ate our chips. Are you hungry too? Yeah, you are. Here, why don't you get some chips? Order some chips. Chips. Don't. Wait, crap. Does this mean you don't need me to do ease so Clover's daughter can have America's ass Chris Evans? Oh, my God. That would make perfect sense. Oh, my God. I didn't even think about that. I mean, I think that we should do an intermingling of, like, chat-made sims and celebrities. I think that'll make it the most fun. Um, I think that Lemon thinks they're... Lemon thinks they're doing E. I don't know. You, I think you and Lemon need to talk about who's doing E and who's doing F. But, um... You were doing F. Okay. And I don't think we have anybody for F. What was the Victorian word? Oh, we had two. Are you, do you want to, do you want, I'll, I'll do a little replay. So we've been doing Victorian slang words of the day. Um, and today we had two. Uh, both of them kind of have a cute little history lesson around it. The first one was the Alexandra Limp which was an affected manner of walking seen in many... Okay, you guys are being too loud. You guys are being far too loud. Um, it was an affected manner of walking seen in many women for several years and attributed to then Princess of Wales who had some kind of trouble with their knee. So people would walk with a limp to emulate the Princess of Wales because she had a limp. The Alexandria limp. Alexandra Limp. Uh, the next one was an air hole. An air hole was a small, often dismal, public park adapted from an old graveyard with the gravestones removed and replaced to stand century style around the circumference of the park. How fucking weird is that? They made a par they made old graveyards into parks. Okay. Did we watch it? Okay, I watched it. You watched it. Cool, let's go home. Airhole is the hole where the baby will escape from Clover's fin flaps. <laughs> so that was what we learned today. The Alexandra Limp and the Airhole. I don't know why they called it an air hole. Was it because they removed the gravestones and so it was almost like you were giving the graves air like what does that mean what was the what what, what was the reason what was the reason <laughs> i wouldn't recommend for digging for foundations there right oh there's Daniel David. Oh, look at how they're all. Oh, oh, they all get along. We love that. Go home. Yeah, that was weird. Um, the next one on the list is one we did already, but I'll tell you what it is. It's bags of mystery, which is what they used to call sausages. You got your bags of mystery. 
a sausage. What if you called, what if you, oh my God, how many times do you think that a person in the Victorian era, very cheekily, very slyly in the comfort of their own home, called a man's a bag of mystery? How often? I feel like they had to. You're a bit of raspberry? Oh shit, you looking him up? Oh, you looking him up? Oh, thank you. That's literally the next one. One of the next ones on my list. <laughs> Reginald, I will be laying on my fainting couch. Please deliver your bag of mystery to my loins post haste. <laughs> I loved, um, I did a, 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 ha a haunted walking tour in the Haight Street in San Francisco. Um, highly recommend. It was super cool. But uh, one of the things they did was talk about the Victorian houses in that area. And... Um, I didn't know that they had a whole fainting room, like the little, it's like a little room right next to the front door where once you got made it up the stairs because you were wearing the corsets, you were probably going to faint. And so you would sit in the room to regain composure after you got up the stairs. I was like, damn, <laughs> damn. <laughs> A bit of raspberry is an attractive girl. Originally, a raspberry jam, as this was considered the most flavorsome of preserves. So the prettiest girl, of, prettiest of the girls were a bit of raspberry. A bit of raspberry. The jammiest jam. The jammiest of jams. That's another one. Beauty is paid and comes from Mr. For Real. Oh, my God. Oh, we're walking on schmooshine on here. Okay. Yeah, let's go sleep. Walking on smooth shine. Sleeping it fast forward. That's so funny. <laughs> I was just jamming. <laughs> yeah, they really need to update the social bunny system because you can't even post that like, hey, I got engaged, which is so something you would post on social bunny. Ridiculous that you can't post it. Do we not have any more leftovers? Bruh. Uh, hi, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Are we all out of leftovers? Oh, God. I'm nervous to cook. We Last time we almost burned down the whole f house. Oh, shit. How? We can take family leave? How pregnant Anne am I? Oh, my God. I'm ready to give birth in question marks. Oh, shit. We might not get married this time. We might just have a baby. We might have to have a whole baby. Uh-oh. Is this baby going to be D'Anthony? <laughs> I became good friends with Clover. I don't even know Clover. I don't even know them. Oh, God. We got a prediction. We got a prediction. Will the house burn down again when we cook? Oh, God. What do you think's going to happen? Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's try cooking. Let's see. Cook. 
Oh shit, this is my jam, man. This channel, what channel is this? Is this still summer strut work? Let's make grilled cheese. I can't find any background on why it's called an air hole. I feel like maybe they just don't know. I think it's because they put the they took the gravestones off and they thought it would be like it's giving the grave air. I bet it's something stupid like that. Oh shit, it's a cruel summer. Hold on, I'll, I'll pause my music for a cool summer. Let's go. This is when the Swedish were taking over all of our music. All the Swedish producers. Cruel, cruel summer. gonna have some nice grilled cheese ready to give birth any moment should we try to have the the wedding and maybe give birth at the wedding <laughs> I think we should I think we should try okay um wedding okay I think that we'll go to the location and then place the wedding stuff I think we'll do it like that. Are you good? How's your needs? Cruel, cruel summer. All right, let's go. It's 4 a.m. <laughs> it's 4 a.m. Wild. Oh yeah, we were gonna figure out where we're going on our vacation. I forgot. Okay. Yeah, we can add the new place because <clears throat> there is technically a new there's technically a rental there okay let's see where we're going on our honeymoon probably after we have the baby we're gonna get married in Solani We're going to the snow. Ugh. All right. It's, all right. All right. We're going to the snow. So we're just going to, we're going to go here together. And then we're going to plan the event here after the, after we make it a wedding venue. Oh, there's a new prediction. Will we ha will we have the baby before the wedding ends? <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Will we have the baby before the wedding ends? Yes, it will wait. No, Clover will pop. Oh shit! <laughs> the game's just like okay. I think that she's probably going to have it in the middle of the wedding. I'm going to be honest. I think she's going to have it in the middle. Because she's already, like, ready to pop. You know? You think you think they're pop? That's what I think is going to happen. If she doesn't, though? Oh, my God. Other than the definition, it also says, For some years past, the churchyard has been disused in the metropolitan public gardens association with a keen eye for what in not in happily terms air holes has been made making strenuous efforts to secure it as an ornamental piece space so it's just supposed to like look nice not really be used i guess that would make sense okay let's build mode I made a wager. I'm sure who can determine the ending now. <laughs> did you wager? I did not. Can I predict? 
Oh, um, I can't, I can't do it. It won't let me. All right, so how do I, do you know how to say like yes or no when we know if it happens? You can determine the ending, okay. Oh, you predicted no. Oh, I like that it has a little thing next to your name. That's so cool, where it says like that you predicted. That's so cool. All right, let's go to the gallery. I have made wedding venues at this location before, but they weren't, they were before the wedding pack came out. So they have a bunch of stuff, but I might have to, I don't know. I think it was before the wedding, the wedding venues came out. We could still get married there anyway. On your stream manager, you can see the little sort of hourglass. Let me see. Manage prediction. Okay. I got it. Okay. Crystal ball. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Um, wedding. Just, no, just lots. Uh, just lots that fit this lot. Narrow it down a bit. There's the cruise ship. It's not that. There's the bar slash diner. What is this? Oh yeah, it was a Let's Play house I did. It was meant to look like the ones in Bora Bora. Okay. Um, no, this one, the wedding. No, that one's the Bora Bora one. Okay. This one, place it. It's a... Current. Make it a beach for now. Yeah. And then I'll turn it into a wedding venue. I might have to change a couple things. We'll see. I can't, you can technically still use it, right? <laughs> even if it's not like... Like we could technically still get married here, even though it's not like a My Wedding Stories thing. It just maybe wouldn't be the same we could just invite people over and get married oh yeah we're getting married in the water <gasps> i wonder if she'll become a mermaid if she's out that far in the water <laughs> okay what would i need to add to make this a wedding video Wedding venue. Oh, we have everything. Okay, work. <laughs> That'd be really cool to get married as a mermaid. True. Okay, I think I'm gonna just add the um, the aisle. Is that what it's called in here? Yeah, the long wedding aisle. The hidden one. Yeah. There you go. So you can't see it. I mean, you kind of can see it, but it's fine. There's a bar. There's a pit to make food. There's a, there's a food stall. Is that what that is? I think that's what it is. Oh, there's a kitchen over here. I put a, I put a secret kitchen. A secret kitchen. For the caterer. Oh, and we need a... We need a cake. 
Okay, um, I need, okay, if I need a cake, that means I need a secret computer. <laughs> Just hide it next to the secret kitchen. Okay, this is the secret computer for the secret, secret, this is a lot of secrets happening at this place. Um, no, it needs to be smaller. What is this one? I never use that. The Chief's Crystal Desk. Jeez. Okay. Now we'll just use this. And a, and a chair because apparently you need a chair to sit in. None of these are very beachy chairs. There we go. A little beachy. No, excuse you. Not in. Okay. No, that's fine. Thanks. Um, oh, there is a desk that goes with this pack. Hold on. Okay, I just, I want just base game and island living and wedding stories. That's all I want. Okay, desk. This one. This chair. A computer okay and then I think we'll need we'll put um, one of those tables right here that we can put the cake on not that one the, is that say the fun table is that the one I want I thought it was a different one that's too big. All right, whatever. Saved recently? Yes. Well, not after this. I'll have to save again. This is a reminder to everyone else to save. Hold on, just go here. Wedding venue items. Thank you. That's all I want. Lots of plants. Cute. Okay. Oh, there's little beat lounge chairs. We don't need those though. Oh yeah. Do you want llamas? Yeah, I do. Oh my God. There's so many cute things. Shut up. Oh, celebration bucket. I do kind of want that. Okay. I want the thing to put the cake on though. That's really what I'm looking for. Oh, I can put, oh, I want one of these. Look at this one. It has more of a beachy feel to it. Welcome to the wedding of Clover and Danny. That's your sign to come when you come in. It's very special. We could have kava bowls. That would make sense at a beach wedding. Here, you can have a kava bowl. Am I hallucinating? <laughs> Where, isn't there like a special table thing that has, I've seen it. These ones, a banquet, a little banquet table. There's another one though. It doesn't look like this. It looks different. That one's probably fine though. Get rid of that one. That one looks like the Renaissance fair though. And I like that. This one, this is the one I was thinking of. I like that. I want, I like the Renaissance fair. There we go. This is where the cake will go. Like that. Pop a cake there. Okay, I think that's all we need. Okay, so to further explain that extra blur for some years past, the churchyard has been no longer used and 
It's been making great efforts to make it an aesthetic, an aesthetic usable gardens. Yeah, that makes sense. Maybe they would also call it arrow holes in like the way of um, if they're adding more plants to it and stuff, maybe that would help the air. But I don't even think they would have known that in the Victorian times. But maybe they did. I don't know. Okay, I want to order. Oh, wait. Order. So bug it's so laggy okay order order wedding cake wedding cake so it was really literally to make it look better and bring more people in the area since graveyards were a dying trend <laughs> that's that's fair okay are we having a we're having a beach wedding cake what colors Kind of like this sand and blue ombre one. It's nice. Purple's kind of pretty. Purple or blue? How society never changes, honestly. It's crazy too because um, like my perception of history is so warped. You want purple? My perception of history is so warped because I'll feel like, oh, that was like forever ago. And then when I really like sit down and think about time and what it's like to what it's been like as a person and as in the time that I've lived so far and like, like how, like I asked my mom the other day, you know, when you were growing up in the 60s and 70s, were the photos that brown and dingy at the time? Was that like a style of how it was printed? Or was that the wear over the years? And that at the time when you had the pictures, they were like fresh and new and vibrant and, and great. Or is it, or were they always kind of not great? And is it the same way for like photos that were originally printed in like, you know, the 1800s when they were printing photos? Did they originally come out kind of looking like that? Or were they uh, patinaed over the years, you know? And so we view them as being like a sepia tone, but they weren't actually ever that way intentionally. I think that's how it is. I just don't know for sure. And I remember seeing like people restoring paintings and how like I realized, oh my God, there's so many paintings that when they were originally made were so much more vibrant, but because we were afraid to clean them or like hadn't cleaned them or they were cleaned wrong or whatever, they just look darker, browner, dingier. And then once they actually restore them, it's like, oh my God, <laughs> the colors. <laughs> I don't know, stuff like that, because then I start to think about, I'm seeing how pictures I took when I was a teenager, I thought were like great quality at the time. And then as technology changes, they're like so pixelated, you know, shit like that. Color photographs developed over time. Many photos have aged and gained patinas, but some earlier in the process of photo development did have more grayscale or sepia tints. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I ran. Okay, now we're on green tea. All right, let's get um a cake topper, and then we're gonna invite everyone. Okay. Uh, it's a beach wedding. We can have beach things, but it's also a purple cake, so it's pretty specific. Palm tree topper. <gasps> a palm tree topper. Maybe we're doing that. Made a stupid joke. Yeah, always. Always out here just making stupid jokes. You know, just making the silliest jokes. 
I'm sure I said it's giving. We need to have a gay wedding so I can use some of these cute flag rainbows. We need a gay wedding. I'll be back. Okay. I'm going to do the this one. I want to see it. Oh, I see it. Oh, I see it. Like we're both little trees. It has shells on it. It has shells on it. Okay. D'Anthony can have a husband. D'Anthony DeVito will be a hot. Oh my God, D'Anthony DeVito. All right, we're gonna serve an assortment and we're gonna plan the wedding. We're gonna, no, it's a social event. We're gonna plan or we're planning the wedding. Chatty family call with, no. Chatty family call? Oh, okay. I thought that meant you could have like a, a three-way or four-way call with multiple Sims. And I was like, what? Can you, maybe you can do it with that. I don't know. Okay. Plan wedding. The, the food is set. The cake is here. Let's go. With the evolution of development chemicals and technology the quality of the photographs has improved drastically in the last 50 to 60 years my dad taught me how to develop with old chemicals when i was little but that form of development with true film is sad yeah dying art yeah i should have taken photography in school because they would teach people how to do that and i didn't and i kind of i wish that i learned i didn't even know i could take it i didn't even know it was a thing until like other people were taking it and i was like wait you can take photography and then I became a photographer. <laughs> I can still smell the mix of chemicals in my memory. Okay, we're having a ceremony. Yeah, Sim of Honor. I only asked Chanel. <laughs> okay, we don't have officiant or any of these other things. Did I invite Chanel? Chanel, thank you. Guests. Okay, mom, both my moms. Who is this? Who's this? Hold on. Oh no. So the game moved Danny and Danny out of the house from his wife. Did they divorce them? Did they get divorced? Did he get remarried to Abigail? Who's Abigail? Is that a stepmom? Oh no. What happens? Who's Damien? No, not Damien. Ray Chanel. Oh no. I'm going to check his MCC when he gets here. Worked for a while in photo digitalization technician. My favorite photo was from 1890. It was a couple couple's wedding photo that had been flash photographed onto a sheet of tin. Oh yeah, the tin photographs for sure. Don't invite Kyle. Don't invite Kyle. It's just going to... Lee, yeah, bring Lee. Charlie. Is that all my family members? We're just, I'm just inviting family right now. This is a family only wedding. Oh my God. Did Daniel DeVito get remarried? I'm going to check his MCC and see if he got remarried. We're going to have drinks. We're going to cut the cake. We're going to have food. We're going to exchange vows. We're going to walk down the aisle. And we're going to kiss. No, that's mostly it. Now I'm just sitting here remembering the sound of the photos being printed. We had a cake. 
Okay, we're, yeah, boho's good. Color, purple. Our wedding color is purple. I'm gonna edit the outfit. She's gonna have a different wedding dress. That one is kind of cute though. But I want it to be like at least a similar hue of purple. <laughs> hey family, guess what? We're getting married. Also, it's four in the morning. Come over here right now. Come over. Also, I'm about to pop. I'm having a baby. Just a lot of things going on. Also, by the way, YouTube has a 12 hour limit to the amount of to how long your video is going to be, which is very annoying. But I'm going to remember that in the future whenever we do long streams. <laughs> Going to school during COVID was an experience. Yeah. Was it mostly online? I've heard a lot of mixed things about it. There were a lot of things that I didn't get to do even when I was younger, just because like for various reasons, like I, um, I started going to independent study when I was in high school, so I didn't get to like go to prom and stuff like that. And I was like, it sucks that you don't get to do that, but um, like it happens. But at the same time, like there was so much else that was so important when it came to like the education of school that that really, it really, really sucks that that happened and it's still happening. Honestly, they haven't really recovered in the education system. He's wearing like a really vibrant purple. This is a beach. This is a beach wedding. What is this outfit? That's it. That's like mother of the bride. That's kind of cute. No. How spicy, how spicy should my outfit be? Should we be spicy? Are we spicy? Are we like this spicy? How spicy am I? Bruh. Hi, welcome in, thank you for the follow. How, how spicy am I gonna be at my wedding? I want it to be, here, I want it to be purple. Just show me purple. We're not wearing white, we're wearing purple. I'm pregnant. They're, they already know I'm not a virgin. Purple. They're gonna know, it's not a secret, mom. I was mostly online because I decided to stay home. However, I didn't get prom, didn't get homecoming, still had to vote for them, but still had to vote for them. I flourished online, I will say that, but everything sucks. Couldn't see my friends, couldn't be a teen. Yeah, that's, yeah. All because I decided that my grades did better when I stayed home. Well, and that's the whole thing, too. There's so many people who are like, oh, it's just so much better if you go somewhere and do it. It's like, I actually thrive better when I work from home. It's kind of funny how, oh, this is cute. She doesn't even look that pregnant from the front. <laughs> but um, at the same time, you do miss out on the social aspect of everything. But you did learn something really important about yourself, which is that you can thrive really good uh, at home and from a from being at home. This one's more the color of his outfit. Do we match? Do we should we match Danny? Or I guess we could go just like white. Is that boring? Should I be rainbow?
What do you wear to a beach wedding? What is this? I haven't seen this coloration of this. Whoa. Matching is cute. I haven't seen this. Or that one. But this one, like, specifically is very sp interesting. Alright, I feel like for a beach wedding, you'd wear something more, like, flowy and all that. But... I think we're going to match. Uh, and then we're going to change your hair, too. Let me give you, like, an updo. I know people very well. It's a muscle. You have to, you have to practice it. It's annoying. I agree, though. Is the age in my bio up to date? I'm 33. Yeah. I'll be 34 in May. Um, updos. We'll do an updo. Not that I, I probably would have my hair down if I got married though. Well, actually it's a beach. You don't need an updo. But you're also about to give birth. So maybe you would have an updo. I don't know. You were 13 when I was born? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's like a whole other life. I was trying to get famous on MySpace when you were born. When you were a toddler. <laughs> it's funny, I've now, like, I've been so chronically online the past few years that, like, when... Uh, people tell me stuff like that. It doesn't affect me negatively at all. It's just like, I know, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I'm more so like in this mode of like when people are younger and they, I'll be like, oh, well, let me show you some really cool movies. Let me show you some really cool. Sh like, have you, did you know about how we used to have to dial up on the computer? You know, like, you know, like when those people do those TikTok videos and they're like, tell me what diet, tell me what burning a cd means and then they'll be all like ha 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 oh my god i can't believe you don't know i'm like do you tell them yeah but it always bugs me like do you tell the kids what a burn cd is or are you just saying that and are you just telling, are you just laughing at them for not knowing what it is? Because when you'd burn a CD, it would be like you would put um, music or pictures or a DVD or like movies, but usually it would be music on a CD and you would have to burn the music to the CD. Um, a lot of people, I guess, don't know that. But there's like a lot of stuff like that where I'm like, instead of laughing at them, can we just teach them? They're children. They should, you know, or you're not, not necessarily, but you're like, you're people who were not around and how are you supposed to just know those things? It's like, it's like if you grow up and you weren't taught, like they don't teach cursive now. So how can you expect them to know cursive if nobody taught them? What a necklace, I think. Yeah, that's cute. Okay. My dad ripped movies off the TV on VHS. How's that different from running a CD or downloading a free MP4? Honestly. I mean, the process is different, but yeah. The OG Netflix. <laughs> The movie book with all the movies that your parents illegally copied. <laughs> Downloaded from LimeWire. Dial up sucked. Yeah. My family wasn't rich or poor. We just used it until something broke. Yeah. Napster. I didn't, I was never cool enough to do Napster. I, by the time that, like, I was too afraid to do Napster because there was so much publicity around it by the time that I had heard about it. But LimeWire was still around. I 
And there's still so many. Freaking, yeah, freaking Metallica. Also, if you get a good item and take care of it, it'll last. Oh my god, the amount of times I've heard that in my life. And I do, okay, to be fair, like, their shit was made way better back in the day. Like, solid wood furniture pieces and all of that stuff. I get it. Like, I get it. I inherited some stuff for my grandma. I'm keeping it. I'm going to try and make sure it lasts. But, like, I was like, Grandma, half of my stuff is from, Tar all my stuff is from Target. Like, if you take care of stuff, it'll last. No, it won't. <laughs> it doesn't. Not even, not in this, not in this world. <laughs> Everything since, like, 1970, probably, has been made to slowly deteriorate. And then, or, or now it's made to quickly deteriorate, so that you have to buy something new within a couple years. Yeah, they mostly match. Okay. And we're doing it here. It's a good house. <laughs> no, not our house. We're not, not at our house. Here. Sapphire Shores. Why does it have nothing on it? That's kind of weird. Yes. I'm in my outfits. I'm ready to go. Where's my honey? Celebration feast it is available. We have it. I bought it. Where's Danny? Is everyone showing up? Oh, Danny's by the Danny's at the bar. We need to invite his family. I did. I invited all their families. Supposed, they're supposed to be showing up. Hi, baby. There's one. Showing up in his boho outfit. The color is purple. There's my sister. 5 a.m. wedding. I am about to pop. So there's Cassidy. Danny's got his 5 o'clock shadow beard going on. Hi, everyone. Hi, hello. Give speech. No. Is Billy Ray wearing a floral skirt? Yes, he is. And he feels great in it. Okay. Is everyone here? Where are our parents? Somebody ran over here. Who was it? Oh, they're all over here. Dan Daniel? I really need to know. Express doubts about marriage? Don't you dare. <gasps> he got remarried. Does she live at the house with him? With them? I think what happened was, I think that there was a glitch in the game. And then when him and Danny... Him and Danny moved out. I put them back in the house and had them add to the family, but I think they had gotten divorced. She was still living there. I made them all live there. But I didn't know that they got divorced. Oh, that's Chanel. How sad. Would you like to see my house? Sure, you want to send it to me on, on Discord? No spouse. She lives, They live at the same house, though. Alright, well, let's get married. I think we should... Ceremony. Um, gather at the aisle. Yeah, because we don't really have seats at the aisle. We have seats. We do have seats, actually. Here. Um, take your seats. Please take your seats. Please take your seats, everyone. Everyone, please take your seats. Oh, my God, no. Don't go in there. Oh, they're all changing into their bathing suits. 
Take your seats. They're gonna sit out here. Am I gonna turn into a mermaid? Okay. Um, walk down the aisle. Oh my god, they're all in their bathing suits. Walk down the aisle. Oh, we can't walk down the aisle. Okay, that's fine. Um, ceremony activities. <laughs> um. What? Yeah, here. Exchange vows. <gasps> Proposal photos. Okay, exchange vows and kiss. Look at, look at his dad. Look at Daniel DeVito. No, I gotta take time off. We're getting married. Look at this family. They're all just standing and sitting. Oh my god, you're okay. You're okay. So happy. What a beautiful wedding. What a beautiful wedding. So the bridesmaid to a waiter. What a shame the poor <laughs> What a shame the poor groom's bride is a whore. <laughs> Hi, Cherry Bear. How are you? Oh my God! Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for being here. How are you? We're having a wedding. Um, everyone decided to. <laughs> We're having a water wedding, apparently. Welcome, welcome, how are you? How was your stream? What did you do? Tell me about it. Let me, uh, hold on, let me go here. A wedding, I know. <laughs> We're very pregnant. We're trying to figure out, is she gonna have the baby before the wedding's over or are we gonna, are we gonna make it? I don't know. It's an early, it's a morning wedding at the beach. How was your stream? What did you do? Tell me about it. You're playing The Sims. Welcome, welcome everybody. Thank you for being here. My name is Chelsea, also known as Tragic Glamour. I am a streamer in California, in America. Um, we do a lot of like, co like comfy and chaotic stuff here. A lot of Sims. We do variety on the weekends. I do drag on Saturdays. Here's some of my drag if you haven't seen it. Some of my drag. We do that on Saturdays. You're just doing some cozy family gameplay, slowly figuring out the growing together. Eat, eat, nice, nice. Are you enjoying it? It's really fun, and I like that. Um, I remember being in your stream, and you were saying that you hadn't really looked at it, so you were kind of exploring it. I feel like that's a really fun way to go about it, though. You know, like to just kind of explore it as it goes. It's really fun. Yes. Are you liking the infants? I love all the like um, the, the milestones and the compatibility system. It's really interesting. I love it. Um, well, if you need to go de stream, go take care of yourself. Please do so. Thank you again for the raid. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you for bringing your community here. You get genuinely surprised because I don't know what to expect. Yes, and I love that. That's always so much more fun. Like the and it's so fun to like watch people explore too. It's a great feeling. Yes. Um, I'm going to show my raid video so you can see a little bit more about what I do here. Uh, but like I said, if you need to go de-stream, if you were a part of the stream and you need to go de-stream, please go do so. You have dinner. Yes. Okay. I'm like, I'm so excited. I'm just excited in general. Um, here's the raid video. If you like it, uh, please give me a follow. 
And then we're going to finish our wedding. We're going to see if she'll pop before the wedding. And then after the wedding, we'll probably be going, we'll probably be ending the stream. But um, yeah, anyway, here is the raid video. Look up with me? No! No! Not Ken. Chelsea, we're glad you're did it again. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Get away from me. You don't know me. You don't know my life. Hot dog realness. Do we like the hot dog? Damien, I'm going to tell you a secret. Damien, I'm going to have every single one of you impregnate me by the end of this Let's Play. Drugs. I don't want to get the drugs. I want to live my beach life. Oh my god. That is terrifying. To change <gasps> On the That's button. fucking you terrifying. Are you track. serious with me right now? Look at him. I'm blending in. I'm being sneaky. Did you know that he will swing on a swing? Excuse me. Did you just pee on my dog? You just wear the top. It looks like you're wearing a condom. <laughs> so if you like what you see please be sure to give a follow i'd love to hang out with you and yeah thank you again for bringing your community here i really appreciate it i hope you have a good dinner um so we are doing our alphabet legacy and we're on the c generation and this is Col clover culver and she's marrying danny devito <laughs> this is a young adult danny devito so he has a lot more hair than than his father uh and in real life, Danny DeVito is a junior, so that's his dad back there. <laughs> um, this is his mom. I don't know if, who his real mom is, but this is his mom in the game. Um, and then this is our family members from our B generation, all hanging out. They're all sitting in the ocean watching this wedding unfold. And we are pregnant with baby num with our first baby. Um, we're supposed to have. Oh, oh, we gotta pee. We gotta pee. Oh, okay, we gotta pee. All right, she's going to go pee. <laughs> she's like, I got to go. Um, we are pregnant with our first baby. We're supposed to have three. We did like a wheel spin and we decided we're getting three. She's also um, a mermaid, the wheel spin decided. Okay. Um, we did that. We did it. Oh, yeah, we did it. We did it. We walked down the aisle. We exchanged the bows. We got to have drinks and we got to cut the cake. It's drink time. Oh, hey, dad. Hey, Dad. Aw, that's so nice. Okay, let's get some drinks. Drinks all around. We didn't hire a bartender, of course. Hire a mixologist. We can spend them. We can spend $100 on that. But we'll get some money coming over. How about everybody come and... Can I just, like, call people to eat it? There are my activities. Uh, time to eat. Go get food. Why did Ariel just write Princess Erica note? <laughs> Not that she didn't know how to write. She signed Ursula's contract. <laughs> okay. Time for food, everybody. Let's have some food. You have to cut the cake. I know. Um, we're going to, we're going to get, we're going to, okay. We're having food. Inscribe the wedding cake topper? Yeah. Who's getting married? Um, Clover and Danny. Um, beach, beach wedding. Oh no, you gotta take, you gotta take the time off. We are having a wedding. This is wedding time. All right, I'm gonna let them eat. It's 9.30 in the morning. Hello everyone, welcome to a lovely 9.30 wedding. On the beach, in the water. All right, I'm gonna put this in my inventory and then we're going to... Bruh. Oh, hi, welcome in, thank you for the follow. Then we're going to, where is it? Gather for cake? No, I want to cut the cake. Do I go to him to do it? Groom. I love how we're just all in our bathing suits. Um, give speech? No. How do I cut the cake? Oh. 
Nobody else touched the cake. I'm doing it. <gasps> Wait, there it is. Why can't I do it? It must be on a dining table. That's ri that's ridiculous. Are you serious? Are you serious? Can I put it? That's ridiculous. <laughs> Can I put it on a picnic table? Sorry, sorry. Sorry, ladies. So sorry, hold on. Hold on. I'm trying to I'm trying to place it. Oh my god. Place. Is that going to work? Okay. Can I do it now? No, I can't. Okay, hold on. Don't touch it. I know it's tempting. It's right in front of you, but don't touch it. Oh, can I put it on a counter? It's not ideal, but it's... Is that a thing? No. Where? I need another table for this? That's stupid. I want to just cut the cake. Why can't I cut it on the on this table? Fine, I'm going to have to get another table. <laughs> I mean, we could just eat the cake, too. But we want to cut it. Okay, let's get um, a random little table. We never do all the things, I know. Are there people who are way, there are probably people who are way more meticulous in this game than I am. I'm just kind of like, meh. Um, okay, let's, how about this table? In all white, just right here. That'll be the cake table. Put it there. And then this table, we'll just, we'll put a fountain on it. How about that? What do you think? Oh, mom. No, 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 no. What do you think about a fountain, mom? You like fountains? I don't know why I said bomb. There we go. No, put this one on there. There we go. Okay. There, you can have a fountain. Do your, do your worst. I'm going to go over here. And, oh... Clover's partner isn't nearby? Where is he? Where is my partner? Where is da Daniel? Here, cut cake with Clover. There we go. Let's cut the cake. It's time to cut the cake. What the fuck is that sound? Did you hear that? What? Oh no, the cat died. Oh man. The cat died. What is this? I swear from performing vows. Oh, that's cute. No, not this crystal. No. <laughs> Why you gotta die? Who's, who said you could die? Come on, Danny. It's time to cut the cake. Come on. I like how we're both wearing a lot of purple. <laughs> Are we cutting the cake or nah? Are you just going to stand over there? Your dad's going to cut the cake if we don't, Danny. Come on. Come on. Let's cut the cake. Get your butt over here. Come on. What, this is a cake cutting party, Danny. We gotta go. Oh my god, Danny. Danny, get it together. Everybody's. No! They're cutting our cake! <laughs> you bitches. Uh, there's no decorum. How could you? Fine, I'm gonna feed cake to Danny. Just feed the cake to him. How dare they?
Oh my god. They couldn't wait. None of them could. Danny, what's wrong with you? Oh my god. Reset. Reset yourself. Get over here. He's just, they're just breathing very heavily. Uh oh, uh oh, I'm making noises. I'm making mermaid noises. Danny, will you feed Kate to me now? No, don't understand. They just don't. Danny? I did reset him. I reset him already. And and then it reset me. What is going on with you? There's cake on the floor. Everybody put their cake on the floor. That's not good. This is not good. Did the, did the bartender ever show up? No. What is happening at this... What is happening? Teleport. Get out of there. Are you stuck where you are? You look like you're stuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're trying... She's gonna give birth if you don't get over here. Bruh. What's going on, Danny? You don't want to get married? I mean, we are married. We're not going to get the cut the cake. I did, t I just, I did teleport him and he's not moving. Oh my God. Oh my God. Danny. Let me feed Kate to you. I'm going over. See, I'm I'm fine. I have the cake. I'm going to Do you want me to bring it to you? Oh, okay. We're doing it from far away. Okay. You you stuck? Yeah, Tipo's challenge. Tipo's challenge, Danny. This is great. This is a great wedding. Yeah. Weddings aren't bugged at all. This is great. This is fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. She's like, he's broken, broken. Oh, honey, he's broken. <sighs> All right, um, feed cake to Danny. I mean, I kind of was. All right, I'm just going to eat it. You know what, Danny? I'm going to eat it. The reset sim doesn't even work. Love the Sims. I know. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I fucking love the Sims. Even though like this stuff happens, I love the Sims. I'm just gonna go eat this cake, Danny. I'm not even gonna bother. Um, she's like worried about him, but like, come on, come on, Danny 404 not found. <laughs> I would like to make a point that I did not do this. <laughs> I have done nothing. I am innocent. <laughs> this is not my fault. You want to eat this cake? You want to go get that cake? <laughs> I like to think the Sims glitch because they want to be autonomous. <laughs> They're like, what is this? I'm trying to live my own life. And he's just like, no, I refuse. I refuse. She cheated on me with Kyle. So she actually cheated on him earlier. Because <laughs> the wheel told us to. So maybe that's it. Maybe he found out. And now he's glitching. <laughs> Please note again how hot Lee is. <clears throat> In his little shorts. Betty, do not hit on Lee. Betty's a single woman. Betty's gonna... She's like, she's like, I bet you don't eat a lot of fast food with that physique, do you? <laughs> she would. Dude, are you... Dude, you're not okay. 
reset again. All right, well, we did it. We're married. Oh, hi. I see you have moved spots. She's she's glad that you've moved. Do you want to eat this cake? You want to eat the cake now? Is this cake time? Tesco, I'm sorry I made you feel ancient. <laughs> Uh, you want to you want to go make a drink? You want to you want to make a drink for you? Why don't you make a drink for your mom? And then make your favorite drink. How about that? No, don't go into don't go in there. You might get bugged. Yeah, you might get bugged. Don't go in there. Danny's never been the same since he went into that bathroom. Oh, we're going to pass out. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. We'll just pee ourselves. What is what happened to the bathroom? Oh, my God. This is a disaster. There's cakes everywhere. He's not moving. He's still he's still bugged. The cake is the wedding's over. We've been here for 11 hours just waiting for Danny to get it together. He ate the cake, I think. Oh my god. The food is spoiled. The cake has time, though. Let's take it home. <coughs> the cake has time. Should we take all the slices, too? Give me the slices. Slices of cake. We'll leave the other food here. Somebody will clean it up. But this food, this is our food. This is for eating. This food is for me. And she didn't have the baby before the end of the wedding. Oh no. I'm, I'm shocked, honestly. I really thought she was gonna pop like in the middle of the ceremony. Oh my God. Danny, you wanna you want clean these up? Throw away. You want to try? You want to try helping? All right. I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but if we go home, will you be okay? It's like, I think I just need to go home. We all said no, so select the outcome. <laughs> Choose outcome. It will wait. We lost our points. This has been weird. <laughs> oh my god, let's go home. Fine, just leave the leave the leave the stuff here. Somebody will clean it up. Who? I don't know. We didn't even get cute photos. We'll come back. We'll come back and clean it and take cute photos at some point. I passed out. I'm dirt. I'm I'm smelly. Danny is broken. <laughs> to this day, Danny has never moved. <laughs> he got married and then immediately, like, froze out of fear. Immediately froze. Did not know how to handle the, the wedding. Could not deal. <laughs> Nobody thought this would happen. Oh my god, let's go home. I wish she had gone into labor. I know, I thought it would be fun if she went into labor. I thought it would be really fun. 
just like in the middle of the wedding oh shit I'm in labor and then everyone like freaking out it would have been so good I was hoping she was too worried about Danny honestly Danny's not, <laughs> Danny's not moving until she has the child <laughs> he's just not moving he's not going nowhere So good. I can't believe it. Give me my stutter, I will not blink. <laughs> He's just like, I can't. I can't do this. I can't have. I will see post till I die. Honestly, if we didn't leave, they might have died. It was just, he was not moving. He didn't even want to move to eat the cake. Even though I think he did eat the cake somehow. He somehow, through the tea pose, ate the cake. Because it, it was gone. It was missing. He ate his piece. So he may, might not have died of hunger, but... Oh my god, that was weird. <laughs> so the beach wedding is just as cursed as our barn wedding venue. Now, we, at least we know. In fact, this might even be more cursed, because <laughs> that was awful. Every, every wedding venue we have is cursed at this point. It was fine until cake. I know, what happens? We should have ignored the cake. We wanted to have a nice a nice moment. Oh, and Smooth Shine is on. Turn it off, though. She needs to go to bed. Go sleep. Danny? Is he alive now? It seems that he is walking. Yes. He is walking. He can go to bed now. Everything else was fine. I know. I don't know what happened. It's bedtime, though. There we go. Oh, her hydration is awful. She needs to go in the bath. He recovered. Let's go in the bath. You can sleep in the bath. She's a mermaid, so... She needs, she needs the water. Oh no. It has like a dead fish smell. There we go. He did not want to eat the cake. Oh, we got roses. Okay. We also got to put the cake in the fridge. We peed ourselves. Oh shit. At our wedding. Good thing it was at the beach. Okay. Pot, yeah. Oh! Oh my god, I, we haven't had these until now. Is this new with growing together, or is this just something I've never seen before? Oh my god, I love it. Shut up. The wedding certificate. It's new. Oh, it's so cute. I love that. I love that. Does it say their names? Yes, it does. The certificate that Danny DeVito and Clo Clover Culver were united in marriage. It does. That's so special. I'm going to sell this outfit for 360 It's such a cute thing they add it. it's so good it's so good and the little like hand prints with the babies when you have when you give birth that's just like so cute it's such a good addition did you not eat the cake i thought you were eating the cake for sure if you start a couple out already married you can order certificate through the phone it has swatches too what that's amazing. Thank you for telling me that. Water all and sell all. Get one for Birdie and Lee. Yeah, I'm going to have to go to their house to do it. That's so cute. It's like 50 sim monies, 50 simoleons. That is so cute. 
That's such a good thing to know, too. Uh oh, I heard a werewolf. What are you doing over here? Get away from me. The Black Widow Challenge Womp Souvenirs. Oh my god, I love it. Where did I hear a werewolf? Was it you? Was it either of you? You're a military person. You can't really tell unless they own oh, your scientist. Okay, well, I'm having some cake. Yeah, that's pretty cheap, honestly, for it. Oh, I gotta clean this, too. I got stuff to do, and then I'm gonna go to bed. How cute! Oh my god, her new life. Married. Oh, we're gonna pass out. <laughs> All right, that's fair. I mean, I feel like the cake would give you a little bit of a sugar rush to last, but sure. Yeah, no, that's okay. All right, Danny, can you get up and do the things I was gonna, I was asking her to do? Thank, please and thank you. We're going to water. Okay, you don't have to water that one. Water these. No, don't harvest them. We're watering them, and then we're selling all of them. Yeah. <laughs> Poor girl. Is the first baby is D'Anthony, right? Or is this a girl? I think it's a boy. So yeah, I think it'll be D'Anthony. I think we'll just stay until she gives birth. Unexpected nine hour stream. <laughs> Staying an hour longer. She should give birth any moment though. But giving birth in question marks. All right, you hurry up. Have you seen the baby prints? Yes, they're so cute. The little like hand, aren't they like hand prints? It's such a cute addition to the game. Although it adds a lot more when you do the 100 baby challenge because then you have like a million handprints. <laughs> but it's so cute, especially when you're doing like a, you know, just a little cute little family house and you can put the little handprints on the wall. I Googled. What'd you, what? There are several men named Anthony. <laughs> oh, we're in labor. Babe. Babe, I'm in labor. That's not surprising. Oh, we're gonna, I'm, gonna have, I'm eating cake. Yeah, I'm gonna eat the cake first before I go get birth. Might as well just like have some cake, you know. He has fun facial hair again. Oh my God, he's got the Wolverine going on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't know why he does that. Let's go to the hospital. I love how creative he is. <laughs> uh -huh. With his facial hair. Join. Bring Danny. He's gonna be there. He's trying to counter his round cheeks. Maybe that's what it is. I think um, this might be one of the first times because <laughs> usually with the 100 baby challenge, then you end up like, uh, you know, having them show up and then they leave like almost immediately because they're not part of your household. But this one, he saw you doing contour on stream. <laughs> oh my God, my hair smells good. Um, he... I don't know anymore. What was my train of thought? <laughs> what was I talking about? That one made me giggle though. Dan Lick Dan Lexander. Dan Lexander. 
I think it was, wasn't it Dalexander? Dalexander. Glam.exe, yeah, it's Glam.exe 404 not found, totally, for sure. I have made some Y2K references. I have started randomly singing. I actually was going around earlier today following random simmers as I usually do, and um, I went into one person's stream, and they started randomly singing, and I was like, follow. <laughs> That's, that's my vibes. And you sang Panic. I did. What a shame the poor groom's bride is a whore. <laughs> he doesn't know. Just like the song. It's just like the song. In fact, we could argue that they wrote the song about her. Do you know John Walker? He was in the band. I don't think so. Maybe if I saw him, I would know. I'm not really good with names. I barely remember that the singer's name is Brendan Yuri. <laughs> and he's very like alive on social media or he used to be. I don't know if he is anymore. I don't see him as much. Okay. We're gonna have a baby. And then after we have the baby, we'll be fighting somebody to raid. He's not just called lead singer guy. Yeah, yeah. That's, I mean, that's what I call him. Aren't you that lead singer guy? The one in the bands about like the wedding with a whore? Isn't that, isn't that? And I'll just be like, yeah, for sure. It's the band's called Whore. <laughs> <coughs> Our doctor's a ghost? Oh, it's a ghost hospital. Oh, hello. Hello. Hi. Um, oh, there's one human person here. Who's this? Hi. I'm, um, oh, I'm not wearing duckies. I would like to check in. Oh, am I just going? Oh, we're just going. Okay. The doctor says, I'll see, I'll see you back here. I will see you right away. I made the mistake of saying I liked his music much more than Panic's music. <laughs> we'll go in here. You gotta watch the birth. A little gothic self back in the day about Nick Carter. Nice. Nick Carter. You hung out with him and his wife. That's so funny. So yeah. I, I said that and he kind of looks kind of hurt. I felt bad but I was really just trying to compliment his new stuff. That's so funny. What are you doing? Oh, he's panicking. You can panic in here. Panic in here with the babies. There we go. This is D'Anthony. Right? That's the name? DeVito. D'Anthony DeVito. This is the name, right? Is this how I spell it? It was nice. Yes. Okay. Got it. Hello, D'Anthony. Welcome to the world. He's still panicking. He's very... <laughs> He's still panicking. Here, can I have you take a photo? Is it gonna work? Oh, oh how cute. It worked.
I'm gonna take a couple. That was so cute. I didn't know you. Hmm. We did it in the hospital. Parenting level one. Let's go home. We got married and had babies. And it was so cute. Today's aspiration is still bodybuilder. He will get to live slightly longer than normal Sims on the same short lifespan. Oh yeah. If he if he accomplishes it, right? Isn't it only if you accomplish the whole thing, or is it you're just if you're working on it? I think it's after it you've accomplished it. So he's gonna have to actually like really work towards that as a as a as a job, as a as a. Then we don't have long. We should adopt a child. I don't know. I think we'll be good. We aged up at the same time, and we're not gonna have seven kids. It's not like we're gonna be as pregnant as our mom was. I don't know. We'll have to look, though. Men don't live as long as we, men do, women do anyway. <laughs> His whole story was sad. Who, Nick Carter? Aaron Carter? <laughs> Are you thinking about Aaron Carter? You're thinking of Aaron. Okay. <laughs> I was like, what? I like how every once in a while it likes to show the two for what you predicted, but like, why? <laughs> I don't know if you're seeing that, but I'm seeing it. <laughs> like, the prediction's over. We already decided. But it's not showing on any of your other ones. Just that. Just like every once in a while it shows one. We had a baby and we got married and we had a recreational time. <laughs> okay. Where'd you put him over here? Ew. In this one. Ugh. Ugh. I hate this one. I'm going to put you right here by the window. Uh, and then I think I'm going to put, I'm going to have some cake apparently. I probably am going to have to feed you. I'm going to put some stuff on the wall right here. Oh my God. My game is so bugged. Okay, excuse you. Okay, I'm going to put our marriage certificate here. There. <clears throat> and D'Anthony's baby prints, which are colors. Wow, that's cute. Okay, and then I'm going to put... Oh, this is birth certificate. I'm going to keep that. Um, I'm going to put... Oh, these are pictures with our family members. Picture of... Oh my god. Why is it like this? <laughs> Why can't I put it in between without being in build mode? That's so stupid. Alright, then I want a picture of me holding the baby. Yes. Put that over here. Okay, we're gonna add a frame. Reminisce, oh my God, you can reminisce. Okay, we're gonna move it. He has trash in his inventory. <laughs> Excuse you. My game is so crazy. Okay. 
Let's, um, why are the pictures poor? How dare you? Don't make fun of me. There we go. Oh my god. It's just so fucking laggy. Okay. There we go. That's better. can't really see anything I know because the light's not on, but... Gonna maybe do it like that instead. Oh, we can have it on there. Okay, we're having it on there. And then we're gonna have more handprints when the other babies are born. Can I change the frame? Oh, I can change the t style. Weird, okay. Can I do it here too? Oh my god, I can. Whoa. Okay, I just want the white frame, but what are the other ones? Oh, cool. Okay, no, I like that one. Okay. Babies. Okay, I'm taking these pictures. These are for me now. Okay, you can you can keep your trash and your and your other stuff. So cute. He's so tired. Okay, I'm gonna feed the baby. Baby care, feeding preference. We'll do breastfeeding, so it's like less trash feed the baby cutie look at how cute look at how cute when we got engaged and then we got married at a beach so special This is going to be interesting. <laughs> We're definitely going to have to get the house to be bigger soon. <laughs> okay. All right. I think we'll end it here. Okay. Thank you so much to everyone who came and hung out tonight. I really appreciate it. Next time we'll go on our honeymoon to Mount Kamarabi. Maybe we'll get pregnant again. You know, just little things. Little, little things. Um, let me look for somebody to raid. Bring some of this love over, too. <sighs> Such a good stream. Thank you guys again for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, ooh. Lilo's playing. Um. Oh, Emma's on. <laughs> just, just, every stream is just me raiding Emma. <laughs> Oh my god, that'd be so funny. Uh, we just raided Kazen. Uh, oh, there's somebody who's new who I haven't raided before. They have one viewer. They might freak out over having 80-something. I don't know, though. Uh, let me really quick just look and see if there's anybody else. We might, we might just go to Emma because, you know, I love you some Emma. There's like less than a thousand people playing The Sims. It's so wild how many people play The Sims at, depending on what time of day it is. Um, let's see. Ooh, a cult baby challenge. Okay, there's a lot of people who... Okay, we're just going to go to Emma tonight. Just go unwind with Emma. Um, I'm 
go give them some love. Uh, here is the raid message if you are not subbed. Here is the raid message if you are subbed. Um, again, thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate you. I hope that you're having a beautiful, beautiful day or night, wherever you are. And I will see you on Saturday for drag and variety games. And then on, um, <laughs> and then on, Sa and then on Tuesday, we'll continue our hundred baby let's play. And then next Thursday, we'll continue this let's play. Um, I'm going to write down right now that we're going to Mount Kamarabi for our engagement or for our honeymoon, um, just so I don't forget. Thank you so much again. I love you so much. Please go spend some time with Emma. Go give them some love. Go say hey. Give them a follow too. She's my Australian twin. Um, I know that you'll love them. We got to make a beach gym. I agree. I agree. Love that idea. I love you too, Disco. Thank you so much again for being here. I appreciate you so much. And um, I'll see you on Saturday. Bye. Oh, oh I'm going to go. Here. Bye. <laughs> Have fun with Emma. <laughs>